jewellery maker. Hello, Yvonne. Good morning. How are you, Carol? Really good, thank you. How good. Are you? Yeah, brilliant. Thank you. Really Jeez. looking forward. Hey, uh... <laughs> oh, how lovely to see you again. And you too. It's oh. been a long time. It has been ages, yeah. hasn't it? Um, yeah. you, how, how's your summer going? Yeah, well, it's a bit rainy. It's a bit rainy in Somerset. <laughs> I'll tell you something, I'm, I'm sick to death of it, are you? Yeah. I'm just hoping the next thing isn't going to be autumn, or otherwise we're in for a long haul, aren't we? We really <laughs> are, aren't we? I think next week's meant to be better, apparently. Fingers I don't crossed. know. Maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Anyway, jewellery maker, the sun is always shining. Oh, no. <laughs> We've got an absolutely amazing show today, haven't we? We have. We've got some gorgeous things. Um, the 9 o'clock, uh, sorry, the uh, 12 o'clock, I beg your pardon, 12 o'clock uh, kits. We've got the most beautiful electroplated pearls. Love the jewellery that you've made. I love these. Thank the, you. The necklace on the end, that gorgeous kind of scalloped, kind of almost wave design. It's beautiful. It's a bit unusual, isn't it? That Oh, it's lovely. Yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. And the, um, and the necklace next to it as well. Just stunning. These pearls are such high quality and with that electro plating it just gives them that yeah. wonderful frame doesn't it it does uh, in fact a friend of mine said it looked as though they were sitting in a puddle of silver which Ooh. i thought was a lovely description well that is a nice yeah. description to yeah. want a job how nice. <laughs> <laughs> i'll ask <laughs> oh gorgeous yeah look at that isn't that beautiful yeah. and it com i think it comes with that um chain the, yeah the paper the paper clip chain, chain. Yeah. yes uh, which it, which lovely. is great because obviously um, it's easy to attach things too. I've put the little pearls on there. Definitely. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, now, nine o'clock. Hopefully Dave is going to be joining us. Oh, gosh, I hope so, because we have got some of the most amazing cameos. Honestly, literally life changing. Oh, oh my goodness that. me. <laughs> That's amazing. Look at the, f it's like fire. That, ladies and gentlemen, is an Australian opal cameo i don't even know where to start with these um i i am literally gobsmacked by the quality we've got they here, are Yvonne. incredible absolutely incredible and they if they can look nicer they're even nicer once they're set oh my goodness me look at that these are pretty much one-off pieces, um, uh, as I'm sure you'd expect. Um, you've, you've worked with one, which I have. What Yvonne has made with this. Oh my gosh, that's such a beautiful piece. What a treat. I was so pleased with that. I, I do bet have to you say. were. Yeah, I was very pleased. Did you really agonise over kind of how you were going to set it or did you know exactly what you were going to do? When no, you were I, was, I agonised, um, but I was very pleased with the outcome. I, I, I'm, to say. I, I, I bet you were. You yeah. must be so yeah, pleased yeah, with delighted. that. Delighted. Um, these are once in a lifetime legacy pieces that we're looking at here. They are coming up, hopefully, really hope, in the nine o'clock hour today. Um, we've got lots and lots and lots coming your way. The 10 o'clock hour, we've got, <laughs> I know, we've got the most incredible carved rose. Oh, my <laughs> word. <coughs> the definition, the depth, the quality you are getting here is off the scale. Look at this. Look at the quality of the jade you're getting. <gasps> oh my goodness, oh. It's, a it, it's a city. Oh my word. Incredible. They are off the scale. I'd love to have the talent to be able to do something. Oh, like that. so would I, so would I, Yvonne. They are, ab they're... look at that. Amazing. They're pure artists, aren't they? The people. It is. That. It yeah. is artistry. It, yes, is, it is incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Um, we've also got coming up um, these. Now you're going to love these. Um, these are beautiful peg bales, but look at the length of the peg on them. Look at the incredible size and shape of these. They are absolutely gorgeous, beautiful. So you can use this with your fully drilled gems, with your half drilled gems. Absolutely beautiful, really big, beautiful peg bales. We've also got chain on spools. We've got sterling silver findings. Your early bird today is this, which is 
a collection of 500 silver plated base metal spacer beads. Oh my word. So S useful. So useful. Yep. They can be that spacer bead. They can be that kind of punctuation mark, or they can be the main the main event. You can make the, you know your entire suite of jewellery just using these. Mm -hmm. um, it is an incredible collection that you're going to be getting as your early bird today. So we've got loads and loads and loads coming up today, and so much more that I haven't you know we haven't even mentioned yet. So fantastic! Oh, we've got the wall of fame and the wall of fame draw today. <clears throat> Ooh. If you go, so we'll do the wall of fame in a minute. If you go to our website jewelrymaker.com. Click on watch live, scroll down and look at all the deals. Now, we think viewer's choice is working. We think. <gasps> so we think the viewer's choice is working. So basically everything you can see on the website right here is available until nine o'clock and then it disappears. So if you want to get anything, please just go for it. A lot of these pieces, the prices are already set. So uh, just add them onto your order as soon as you can. Gorgeous hidden clasp bracelet, twenty four ninety nine. Larimar, look at that for twenty four wow. ninety nine. Three pieces. I know, isn't that lovely? Yeah. Wheels of jade, ninety nine ninety nine. Wrapping mandrel set, seven ninety nine. Oh, they're so useful too. Absolutely. Um, what's that? Oh, that's a um, another kind of um, a crimp bead cover kind of findings pack. We've got gorgeous citrine. That's a lovely strand. With hematite spacers, carnelian, <clears throat> oh, gorgeous black nephrite jade. Uh, yeah, the dragon pendant, that gorgeous hegu. We've got the beautiful pe um, peg bale with pearl. Um, loads and loads and loads. Uh, oh, South Sea pearl as well. And right at the bottom, those are your silver plated base metal spacers at the bottom of the schedule as well. So if you want to add any of those to your order, please just go for any requests that you've got. Number 48, number two, number seven, number 15, whatever it might be, just let us know. I've not been here for a viewer's choice before. Oh, there That's you go. That's exciting. So everything's going to disappear at nine o'clock, just so you're aware. So, so just, just, just go for it. Go for it. If you do want to send us a message, by the way, then go to our website and um, click on the uh, message to studio uh, button and, uh, and you can see send us a message we'd love to hear from you yeah but for now let's go to the wall of fame let's see some of your incredible designs So let's start off with number 200. It's Denise Wilson. She says, hello, uh, this is my entry for this week. I've tried so hard to knot these, but no matter how hard I try, I just couldn't. Uh, not to be defeated in using these lovely JM pearls. I got a topaz strand and used them as spaces. That's a lovely idea. Perfect. Denise. You've done really well there. Oh, and what did you just say? You like the way that people... I love the way that people are using the uh, photography props that we've been... Um, well, that we've had on JM. Yeah. We also had some lovely backgrounds and I got, I was lucky enough to get them. It just gives and the I, jewelry oh, a real... It just really gives them a It lift. just elevates it, really it does. doesn't it? Um, Jade Cousins, your number 201. Uh, she says, hi, JM, my entry to this week's Wall of Fame, silver plated uh, bead necklace, finished with a toggle class. Everything is from Jewelry Maker. Thank you very much, That's lovely Jade. Pretty. Really, really sweet, yeah. isn't it? Actually, you could use the space of these. That'd be wonderful yeah. um, that we've got coming up as your early bed. Jim Hall, your number 202. Oh, a very moody photo. Good morning, everyone. Here's my entry to the Wall of Fame. It's a necklace made with multicolored tourmaline slabs, purple garnet, and fresh water culture pearls. That's gorgeous, Jim. And I love those gorgeous watermelon colors. They're really, really lovely. Who's our next entry from um, Yvonne? 203, it's Anne Claw. Oh, with a cat! Oh, lovely pudding cat. Oh, look at that. Talk of using photography props. Excellent. <laughs> right, what Anne <laughs> says is, after watching Mark's anniversary show, I made this 12-foot necklace Ooh. from Ato's that I mixed and three sizes of Moo Cat. My cat, Arthur, oh. liked it, and I hope you do too. Everything was purchased from JM. I have ordered the bead soups in a few colours, but couldn't wait to try the technique. So thank you once again, Mark, for the inspiration. Fabulous. He looks like an Arthur, doesn't he? Yes, he, he does. Oh, yeah. he's just gorgeous. so handsome. He's gorgeous. <laughs> Who's our next entry from, Libby? It's 204, Melanie Kears. This is my <gasps> entry this week, a beaded, bow with eight o mayuki oh, seed beads wow. i have put on shoe clips to add to the shoes as well as hair clips to make hair accessories thought these would be lovely for a bride look oh, at the back of the shoe as i love what you've idea, done melanie isn't it? <gasps> yeah. so professional fabulous mm. um 205 oh sorry 
Yeah, go for it, Libby. 205 is Susan Wright. Ooh, sea who glass. says, oh, the joy of being able to amuse and inspire an eight-year-old <laughs> on a wet afternoon. Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Macarame bracelet knotted onto silver-plated wire with cobalt nylon thread and a few beads from the stash. Fingers crossed for a dry August. Yeah, we'll all second that, Susan. <laughs> Gorgeous. Thank you so much. Okay. And 206 is Amanda Disney. And she says, oh, hi all, lovely. please find attached this week's entry for the Wall of Fame. Two marlars knotted with the mark technique, really easy to do. One with multicoloured amazonite and rose quartz, the other with Dalmatian jasper, red agate and black agate. Love them both. Oh, thank they you so gorgeous. much for that. Thank you, Amanda. I've got Cameron, uh, Karen Romanovsky, who's number 207. Oh, it's got a dragon in the background. Here's my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. Dragon. <laughs> dragon. <laughs> one stretchy, one wire, <laughs> using AB-coated druzy quartz, various hematite, faceted glass beads, and bead caps, all, with, uh, all from JM, with spacer beads from my stash. The first of a few designs for my upcoming stall at a mini beer and music festival. So a bit of a boho uh, uh, style is needed, I think. Do you know what? That is really lovely. And that's going to fit in so well. Oh, make sure you take that lovely dragon with you, though, as well. Yeah. Um, Isabel Morgan, your number 208. Uh, hello, lovely friends. Here are my Christmas in July decorations using JM memory wire and seed beads along with some Mark Smith glass crystals and beads from my stash. I'm going to sell these at my charity high tea in a couple of weeks. Oh, good luck with that, Isabel. That's mm. going to be fantastic. How wonderful. Um, and last entry for today is number 209, Pearl Grove Merritt who says, oh, lovely, gorgeous. gorgeous. Here's my Wall of Fame entry with seed beads, bicones, rose gold findings. It's a few weeks since I made this, but I'm pretty sure it's Mark Smith inspiration. Mark's inspiring everyone today. I was thinking Thank that. Thank you, Jane, for all yeah. the inspiration and tips you've given us every day. To Thank Mark you Smith so much. Theme today. It is, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. Goodness me, I think he's with us next Sunday, I think. I think, I think, I think. It was on yesterday, yeah. yeah. Right, so we've got the Wall of Fame. Oh, we've got to draw the Wall of Fame now. Have you got all the names in front of you there, Neary? Oh, you will. <coughs> keep oh, Michael's going to do a bit of running. Just keep spinning. OK, Yvonne, you need to pick this week's winner of the Wall of Fame. Oh, the winner first. Mm. Okie doke. Thank you. Winner first. Here we go. Winning £100 credited to their jewellery maker account is number. Is number. I've got two. Mm. 152. Neil Jenkinson. Congratulations. Congratulations, well lovely done. Neil. Well done to you. And this week's uh, run out winning £50 accredited to their oh, jury maker. Again. Go on, Yvonne, oh, you do it. Oh, working hard today. You are. <laughs> Is number 165. Come on, Neary, here we go. <clears throat> oh. Molly Rogers, there we Congratulations, go. Congratulations, Well Molly. done, everybody. <laughs> Gorgeous, <laughs> fantastic. Well done, everybody, uh, for entering gorgeous, gorgeous entries this week. And uh, congratulations. Well done, everybody. Excellent. Well done. Right. OK, so we've got loads and loads and loads to get through. So we've got your space beads coming up as your early bird special. Shall we get going? Starting off with numero uno. Here we go. Oh, I see. I see. Here we go. Things are already selling, by the way, on the website, just to let you know. Got a gorgeous hands a hand, floating flower jadeite hands a hand. This is a really lovely, lovely piece. I love that. It's a gorgeous kind of almost an etching, isn't it? It's not kind of a really detailed carving. It's more of a suggestion, that lovely outline shape, isn't it? Is that the one by Susie? I believe it is. There it is. Yeah, beautiful. Designed by Susie Menham herself. Mm -hmm. She's here tomorrow. I haven't seen Susie for ages. I'm really excited to be working with her tomorrow. That'll be lovely. Uh, we're at 49.99 for your gorgeous hand to hand. Uh, and this is um, type A uh, um, uh, Burmese jade as well, which is absolutely beautiful quality. Gorgeous, gorgeous tone going through there. You've got your drill hole at the top there so that can hang down nicely. A lovely kind of protective... Um, um, uh, a, a protective kind of um, talisman to wear, isn't it? And so it? easy to wear. I mean, it's you, yes. you can dress it up, you can dress it down. It's just really lovely to wear. Absolutely. It really is, and it's isn't perfect it? size, isn't it? I think it is, yeah. yeah. Whether you're going to be wearing it as a, uh, as a beautiful pendant or, or as, as a... a charm um, on a bracelet. A charm on a bracelet. Yeah. yeah, it's not too big, is it? No, it's, it's just the right size. No. On the back as well, it's got that lovely kind of smooth quality. Yeah, the one, the one there's got loads of lovely greens going through, hasn't it? 
Anita You're Maker Cody, uh, Jennifer Jenny, well done to you, my lovely. Lots of people coming through. Great to see you all. Well done. Here we go. $29.99. Well done to you. So I'm kind of giggling. Um, I, I, I prepared a PowerPoint today uh, about a few different things, but uh, the main thing is cameos. And, uh, and uh, Neri just changed the font of the PowerPoint <laughs> to New Times Roman. <laughs> For the, yeah, it, it does make, it, yeah. <laughs> I guess you kind of have to be there. You kind of have to be there. Never mind. Twenty nine ninety nine. <laughs> well done, everybody. Do we have our favourite fonts? Do we have our go to fonts? I used to, I used to like curry new when I was uh, doing my GCSE and A level work because it, it's bigger, so it makes it look like you've written more. <laughs> <laughs> what a ploy! <laughs> I know it's so bad, isn't it? Do you know there's a, a computer? Um, there's a software system you can use now where you type in kind of what you want to write, kind of the main points, and it writes it for you. Sounds bad. Oh, nice. Talk about making life easy. I know. That's <laughs> naughty, though, isn't it? Yeah. Morning, all. Lovely to see your, uh, your, your sunshine's on TV. Uh, lineup looks amazing. This hour might be some repeat buys for me, including the ogle that doesn't, doesn't toggle, toggle, says Alison. <laughs> yes. Oh, yes, we'll come to that, Alison. That's great. <laughs> Well done to you. Gorgeous. Julie, you've sent in a request. We'll do that for you as well, my lovely. No problemo. Oh, yes. Lovely infinity symbol here. Um, gorgeous. Oh, yes. Look at this. Could use it as a number <clears throat> eight as well, couldn't you? You absolutely could. Yeah. I mean, as, as an infinity symbol, that's just a piece of cake to, to, yeah. to, to, to set, Yeah, just a lock's head, not each side. Yeah, just either side. That'd be a lovely yeah. piece to put in the middle of a bracelet. Uh, or a superhero mask, I'm thinking, as well. <laughs> or we've got the chain coming up, and you could sort of double the chain up, like... That's uh, a lovely the idea. On my pendant there. Yes, absolutely. So you could literally just kind of, yes, Yeah, just go through. around in a circle. How lovely would that be? 19.99, gorgeous, gorgeous quality piece here. Um... That's a good idea, actually. Yeah, using it almost as like a, a, a slider or kind of like a, you know, like a popping two chains or two kind of thicker cords through it, maybe. Don't know, see if it, it works. It would look nice as a connector on a, on a row of pearls, wouldn't it? Yeah, that it? would be nice to kind yeah. of break it up, wouldn't yeah, it? Yeah, it would. How gorgeous. Mm. 1999, well done. Makers coming through for that. Well done to you. Ooh, okay, here we go. Do you get the box as well? Here we go, next item. Well, off the back of the amazing storage box we did on Sunday. Oh, I got two of those. Did you? Yes. Oh, I, oh I, didn't, I didn't see your name. Fantastic. Yeah, I did. Mind you, we had so many people coming through. We did have 700. Yes, you're right. We did have 700. They're so I'm great. waiting for them to be delivered. Oh, they're going to be great. Um, you've got a little, you've got a little, um, a little storage box here with loads of anti-tarnish uh, papers, uh, which stops your silver from tarnishing and you get your uh, little bags to put rings, earrings in. Um, you must use these kind of anti-tarnish papers a I lot do. with your jewellery. It's around. amazing. Just leaving things out on display with the air getting to them, mm. you're cleaning them quite often. I bet you are. Say. And they really work, don't they, the anti-tarnish papers? They really do, mm. yeah. And they've really good closures on those bags as well. Yes. They keep the air out. So wonderful for things like rings, earrings, yep. maybe. Um, Even things... the rolls of chain that we've got coming up. That's a great, great idea. For that. Yeah, so look. Because chains we've... aren't that easy to clean. So we've got the, uh, so we've got these gorgeous spools of chain coming up. Um, absolutely. Right, what Yvonne says, you know, popping one of these inside one of these little bags, because they have got a really good closure on them, haven't they? Um, great for putting all sorts of different things in. You know, you can use the anti-tarnish tags with something else if you want to and yeah. kind of use this, uh, these little bags for something else. But yeah, that's just... That's just going to save you so much time, Absolutely. isn't it? And you can all, as you say, split them up and you can put your tiny little gemstones in those and use the strip in, in a bigger Great bag. Great idea. Larger. Great idea. Also, if you get loads of these as well, and let's say you sell lots of sterling silver pieces, you could, you know, if somebody spends over a certain amount on your stall, you could give them away or even you could... Um, you could um, you could sell them on you know a little bag with an anti tarnish strip and it's going to be it's going to be you know worth something to somebody isn't it fantastic seven ninety nine for you today you get um, how many of the bags did it say one two three <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 twenty twelve twenty yes there you go <clears throat> well done gorgeous right let's move those on. Lots of people coming through today. This is lovely. <gasps> now, these are really special. These are another one of Susie Menham's um, uh, gorgeous design beads. <clears throat> it's a Susie day. <laughs> it is, isn't it? Beautiful big chunks 
of your oh, jade yeah. with these two beautiful little <clears throat> excuse me drill holes going through them now what's your first thought how are you buttons. going to use these that's a lovely idea buttons, definitely buttons cufflinks maybe yeah. yeah cufflinks would be with the ogle that doesn't toggle with the ogle that doesn't <laughs> toggle absolutely <laughs> absolutely Yvonne and um, What's lovely about these as well is just how much of the jade you're getting. It's a really big a kind big of chunk. tablet of yeah. that jade, isn't it? It's just gorgeous. The quality is absolutely there as well, as you can see. It's got that really lovely, um, <clears throat> that really lovely uh, tone to it. That really beautiful um, consistency of quality as well. Oh, guest designer Susie, we love you. She obviously needs these. There she is. She's coming through to get these. Well done to you, my lovely. Oh, well uh, done, We've got Susie. Yvonne in Berkshire as well. Well done to you. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. And it's a really lovely way of using your jade. It looks like a quite an ancient kind of uh, kind of piece, doesn't I've it? I've never Something... seen, honestly, anything like that No, before. it's really And unusual. I love the chunky aspect to them. Me Gorgeous. too. I do as well. It's a really lovely statement, isn't it? Whether you just have to have whether you want to have one just hanging down, uh, you know, on a pendant or whether you yeah. want to use it as a as a lovely slider, yeah. maybe. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Well done. Um, oh, hang oh, on, oh, Neary. Oh. Come on. <laughs> 29 There you go, everyone. Absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous. There you go, everyone. Nice stacked up as well. They, I, I can't believe how on you well done Susie designing those they're gorgeous yeah. really lovely simplicity is the key with these well done 29 uh -huh. well done gorgeous number what sorry Libby yeah okay peg bale selecciano oh eight designs in your peg bales oh love 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 these let me just grab that quickly here we go Ooh. Oh, there we go so you get here let's have a look these are all sterling silver i believe yeah lovely there we go so you get your this one here with this lovely kind of almost like a a waffle kind of um a, a, a detailed top on it that's really lovely with the gorgeous peg there really really nice that one dainty yes it is isn't it it's yeah. not too clunky is it gorgeous heart one beautiful heart one oh, aren't they unusual Lovely one with split ears on it. This one here, which I think is quite Art Deco, actually. It's got that lovely kind of clamshell design on it. Really, oh, definitely. really lovely. Yeah. Isn't that lovely? They're all different designs. You get one in each design. This one here reminds me a bit of a peacock feather. Um, these, uh, oh, hang on. You get another pinch bell here, which is this lovely uh, star-shaped one. And then you get two uh, pinch peg bales. So you get one here, the peg is very, very oversized on this. It's for an obvious reason. It's so you can file it down and cut it down to whatever size you want. Um, that one's got that lovely kind of filigree. Um, uh, well, yeah, so it's like a pinch, a pinch bell with a kind of big oversized peg on it. Well, but yeah, that gives you such a lot of options, doesn't well, it? Well, doesn't it just? Yeah. And then you get this. So you get two pinch bells and the rest and, and six peg bells. And this one here, which is really, really lovely with little segments in. Isn't that gorgeous? Beautiful. So, um... Thirty-four ninety-nine, all sterling silver, beautiful quality, and you know you can use the simplest technique, the simplest way of setting your jewellery, uh, sorry, setting your gemstones, and it's going to look so different because you've used a decorative um, uh, yeah, bail. Absolutely, it's going to add that bit of. It's design. so nice to have a selection as well. Mm, gorgeous, hey, well done, everyone. Uh, right next, let's do. Oh, lovely strand. Oh, these are unusual. Oh, these are lovely. What are we just, how are we describing these, Neary? Vase and, vase and round uh, shaped jade uh, pieces. They're really lovely. Like little urns. They are little urns, yeah. aren't they? Yes. Absolutely gorgeous. 99.99. Do you do, do you do pottery? No, I don't. Oh, I'd love no. to. Do you know what? I was thinking the other day, I'd love to have a go at pottery. No, I, and unusually, I'm from the potteries as well, originally. Oh, there you go. <laughs> so I should do, shouldn't I? There you go. Maybe you'd be a dab hand at it, a natural. Yeah. Um, I'd love that shape, that lovely yeah. kind of, as you say, an urn Absolutely. shape. And the rounds are so yeah. kind of, 
it's that gem jelly quality that you get with the highest quality jade. You could beautiful. even split those up, couldn't you? You could use the round um, beads in something else mm. and put the silver spaces in. Yeah, see, that's a lovely idea, isn't mm. it? Yeah. You could get the look of your lovely yes. uh, stretchy bracelets that you're wearing today. <coughs> Excuse um, me. 99 is your price point. Well done. It's available to you on three split payments of 33.33. So do add it onto your order. With everything you get from Jewelry Maker, by the way, you get a 30 day money back guarantee, which is wonderful. Plus, you're only paying three ninety five p and p per order as well, which lasts for the whole day. So even if you add 20, 30 pieces onto your order, you're still only paying one p and p of just three ninety five. Good morning. When is the chain coming up? And is it sterling silver? So the spools of chain are coming up in the nine, and they're silver, aren't they? Yes, they are silver. Gorgeous. Yeah. So they're coming up in the nine, my lovely. I think they're a meter as well. Yes. Yeah. So you get these gorgeous spools of chain. Here they are. Here. These ones here, really, really excited about having these on the show today. They're going to be absolutely fantastic. Yeah, they're going to be coming up in the nine. And yes, they are sterling silver, so brilliant. And you also get little chain ends with them as well, which is really uh, exciting because I think a lot of people do struggle knowing how to kind of finish off these pieces of chain, how to set them properly. So that's really exciting. Uh, well done to you, Penny and Buckinghamshire. Well done to you. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's move on. Loads and loads and loads still to get through, which where are we going now? 14. Oh, some pearls. Oh, my word. Ooh, Three there. strands. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, my word. These are absolutely gorgeous. Yeah, these were launched at the um, these were launched last month. I can't believe that price. Can you see that? Twenty-six pounds. And look at the luster on them as well. Pounds. Yeah, we are not looking at substandard, no. rubbish kind of chalky pearls. These have got the most amazing nacre, the most amazing luster to them. I think you're um, right in saying we don't often get rice pearls anymore, do we? Not particularly not in that size. size. Yeah. Um, these are really large, yeah. aren't they? they are. um, Rice pearls are some of my favourites, actually. Yeah. We, 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 in, in my opinion, we don't do them enough. I love how they elongate the yeah. look of a design. Um, gosh, they are really... Look at them on that recording. They are really oh, good. Yes. 26.99. What a bargain that is. Not something, you know, you'd never think of the word bargain when you look at a recording like that or when you look at these three strands. Maker in Kent, Jan, Christine, Jennifer, Cody, Carolyn, well done to you. But it really is... Under £10 a strand, four chances remaining. That is and they are full fantastic. strands as well. They're 38 centimetres. Yeah, absolutely. So you've, got, you've got three necklaces. Oh, if, gosh. If you did, only did something simple with them. Yeah, amazing. See, that's exactly it. You are, you are, this is why I think so many people start their own businesses watch, from watching Jewelry mm -hmm. Maker because you can buy things at such a... Yes. Such a low price point. Yeah. Make the jewellery, sell it on and make a profit. Absolutely. Yeah, very easily. Yeah. Well done to Maureen, Natalie, Maker. Well done to you. Um, I'll, I'll take you back to the website in a second as well, because I believe that we've got some items which are selling out as well. Uh, so go to our website, jewellerymaker.com. Everything is on pre-order. We'll try and get through as much as we can, although we're not going to have a chance to play absolutely everything. Uh, so please, please, please just add as much as you can onto your order. Things will be selling out at nine o'clock. Every single item will be uh, disappearing. There's the ogle. <laughs> the toggle with the ogle that doesn't toggle or whatever it is. I don't know. Uh, your early bird special is a, a pack of 500 silver plated base metal spacer beads. They're going to be coming up. Uh, well done to you. Go, go, go. Lots and lots and lots of people joining us this morning so lovely to see you we've got so much coming up do you want to see a couple of the bits that we've got coming up <gasps> oh ollie can you show us what's coming up at nine o'clock i could just look at i could look at i could look at this all day what oh that. it's just yeah i had no idea we because i i got the lady cameo yeah uh, i had no idea <gasps> these were coming oh <clears throat> look at her hair oh yeah and they're all different. Yeah, they are. Yeah, the artistry is off the scale. But it's, a, well, well, this is it. Normally you get cameos carved out of, yeah. oh, I don't know. Oh, blimey, what's going on there? Almost not that off. Um, normally you get cameos carved out of things like, uh, um, oh, it can be anything from kind of hard stone to, uh, it could be forms of glass, it could be jasper. This is opal. This is fossilized water. The color in them is gorgeous. It's incredible, yeah. and I, 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 anybody, anybody who has even oh, just that kind of ability, my goodness me, master craftsman, absolutely amazing. 
Nerves of steel. Yes, I think you're probably right, Ollie. Because it, I mean, that could go wrong in one second, couldn't yeah. it? Here we go. The most amazing strand of gorgeous Baroque pearls. Aren't they gorgeous? Now you get here, freshwater Baroque pearls. 20 centimeter strands um, with, oh, oh, I was just gonna say with a gem set statement. So that's not on all of them. Just on this one here, you get a gems, you get gemstone set into the central pearl. That's got some peridot by the looks of it, some gorgeous black spinel maybe, some blue topaz maybe, and maybe even a pink tourmaline there. Um, and then you get all of these other baroques. Now, if you've already got loose gemstones, you know, the teeny tiny ones that we do, and you're feeling brave, why not have a go at, at uh, drilling these pearls and setting your gemstones in there? Because they're big enough to do that with. They They've are. got a big enough, yeah. kind of thick enough they surface are. area to do that with, should, you know, if, if you want to push yourself. But if not, these make wonderful pendants and earrings, don't they, just on their own? Just, yeah, I mean, just three. You've got a, a full set there. I don't mm -hmm. know how many is on the strand, um, but just three. And the one with the um, stone set in it, you could have that appendant, independent. Absolutely, appendant. absolutely. It's 11 on the strand. So, yeah, I suppose you could uh, yeah. Yeah, take yeah. that one out. You've then, then got you're 10 left with this, yeah. to work with to make that gorgeous suite of joy, whatever you want to do. And this is the very definition, isn't it, of... Um, of 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 the natural world being something that doesn't match and don't try and match everything perfectly don't try and go for that symmetry you know if you want to go for symmetry then go for either man-made man-made beads or go for or, or go for wire work or something where you can get it exactly right with gemstones don't try and force a uh, a square peg into a round hole you know with this the beauty is the fact that they are completely unique they do that with fashion don't they you buy a designer top and wear a, a a supermarket pair of jeans. No, 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 you're I mean, absolutely right. You can right. mix and match. You don't you're, have to have all the good quality. You're absolutely or all right. One type. Sometimes it looks a bit overkill, doesn't it? If you do do yes, kind of like the do. whole head to toe yeah. in, uh, you know, designer. Not that I, I don't, no, I'm not sure I could actually do that. I've no uh, idea. It's, it's nice to be able to wear one really lovely, <laughs> it is. one really lovely thing, isn't it? Look, these are seventy nine ninety nine today, and you can get them on split payments of twenty six thirty three. What's going on? Amazing. Add it onto your order, everybody. Well done. How lovely it is to have your company this morning. Send us a message. Let us know what you're up to. <clears throat> It'll be all, it, 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 it's, it's always great to hear from everybody. It's always great to hear your stories. How long have you been watching Jewelry Maker for? Oh, lovely Vera. Just wanted to say good morning, Carolyn. Oh, good morning. Good morning, oh, lovely. Messaging. How sweet. Oh, Vera. Where, where, where is Vera in the country? Tyne and Weir. Is it sunny anywhere today? <laughs> I just, <laughs> is it sunny, sunny outside? Oh, it's I, you absolutely know, pouring down when I came in this morning. I looked morning. at the Met Office website <laughs> and, and it was just, sorry, where are we going, love? Oh, Larima. And it was just, you know, the Met Office thing. And it was just that kind of red and yellow kind of yeah. clumps of rain kind of <laughs> spreading over. <Spressing>. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Apparently, according to the Met Office, our weather system is stuck. Oh, is it? There you go. That's a technical Why term. Why couldn't it be stuck on sunny? <laughs> I know, precisely. And so it's just kind of this kind of circle, this never-ending circle oh, of wet weather. Um, nice. I don't know. I don't know. Oh. Right. Oh, Neary, I don't want to hear that news. Unseasonably. Oh. Here we go. <laughs> now, this... Is the definition of Larimar crashing waves? This gem takes me to a warmer, sunnier climate. And we've got the perfect thing coming up for those as well. Oh, yes, we've talk got, to us. What have we got coming up? We've got up? bezel strip coming up, yeah. I think, in the nine o'clock hour. It is in which the nine o'clock hour. Perfect. You could literally, those. I mean, have, have, have a go if you want to, Yvonne. Just literally they just. Are... So, you, what would you do? Just literally. Form it round. Yeah, you just bend oh, it round. And, it, and so that is supple. a really unusual shape. You would never buy a setting, would you? That's No, that you shape. wouldn't be able to get a bezel, would Sorry, you? Sorry, I've got... Uh, no, that's great. See, isn't that lovely? That. Um, cut it down, tied it up. It would look beautiful. And that's the beauty with your bezel strip. It's so supple. Yeah, you can it, literally almost do it with yeah, your hands, can't you? You can do it with your hands. It's <gasps> fine silver. Um, so it hardly tarnishes Gorgeous. at all. It doesn't get fire stain on it. Uh, it's just lovely, lovely joy. stuff. Joy to work with. This incredible gemstone is from 
the Dominican Republic, the uh, the place uh, which is, uh, you know, you know, you know, when you think of desert islands, when you think of lagoon blues, when you think of beautiful white sandy beaches, that's basically the Dominican Republic. This incredible gemstone is just incredible and um, known as the Stone of Atlantis, known as the Dolphin Stone. Rain in Kent. <laughs> She's glued to JM. Am I? Yeah, perfect. Every, sil day. every cloud, yeah. you know, it's got a silver lining. Yeah. It's raining, don't worry, stay in and watch jewelry maker. Yeah, duvet day. Oh! <laughs> I literally cannot remember the last time I did that. Oh, I'd love a duvet day. Then it was day. before you had children. <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely, not anymore. Gee whiz, 24 dollars 24 Oh, gosh. Neary, what are you doing? Is that Wayne Del Paso I can? Is that Wayne Del Paso? Oh, come in here, Wayne. I haven't seen you for such a long time. Come on. Come on. Come on. He's not a dog. <laughs> oh, hello. hello. Oh, how are you? How are you doing? All right, how are you? Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. How are you? Great show today. Yeah, amazing. Did you like your cameo? I loved it. Oh, my gosh. Wayne, they're amazing. One-off pieces. Yeah. One-off pieces, One aren't they? Yeah, amazing. I, I literally, we, we were just saying with the, um, with, the, um, with the cameos, you know, you see people carving, I don't know, bone, uh, glass, stone. Opal, Australian, Australian opal. opal. Like literally, this is like must be one of the most challenging things in the world to to carve into. That's just the amazing. Features on that one, it's so good. <laughs> Look at his little face. Oh, if you could have heart-shaped eyes, you would. Deal of the day. I know, Ooh. deal of the day. I <laughs> deal of the day. What a day to be. <laughs> he is literally the world's most enthusiastic person. I love him. Um, so gorgeous. You've got your Larimar. I can't quite believe that price point. $24.99. What has happened? This is about as close to the Dominican Republic, I think, as I'm ever going to get. Yeah, me too. Um, so to be able to bring that to you, that is absolutely It's probably amazing. more expensive in the Dominican Republic. <laughs> totally. Oh, my gosh, absolutely. It's a really captive audience there. You'll, you know, go on these kind of organised um, excursions to the local jewellery stores in the area. And, you know, goodness me, good luck trying to get anything for 24 nights, even one piece, let alone three. Amazing. Are we going to do a star buy? I think that's a great idea, gang. Let's do a star buy on the Nephrite dragon thing. Oh, donut. Yes, let's do it. Oh, my gosh. Having a little look at what's in the boxes. Right, so we had something a little bit like this the other day on Sunday. And it was a Kotan, it was a Kotan dragon pendant of some description. And it just looked, it looked ancient. It looked like it had been, um, it looked quite masculine. It looked very simple. It wasn't as detailed as some other ones. This one for me, it really reminds me of this. Just, I, I mean, the artistry is incredible. Is it both sides as well? It's both sides, wow. yeah. What I love about this is how... I love the, the shine and the matte together. I think that works really beautifully. It's like a... It's not ultra shiny. It's not ultra glossy. It's definitely not uh, rough. But it's got that kind of almost licorice kind of luster to it. It's, it's a really, really interesting take on this stone. Um, Looks like an Ouroboros, doesn't it? Where you've got a serpent or a, or a dragon kind mm -hmm. of eating its own tail. Mm. Um, the artistry is amazing. The, the texture of that is absolutely beautiful. It looks like it's almost made out of tooled leather, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm just trying, oh, it's, it's just, I, I couldn't make my mind up if it was dark green or black. <clears throat> Isn't that just gorgeous? Isn't that beautiful? It's got that look of... It looks like that, I mean, look, it looks like the kind of thing that could have been carved, I don't know, a thousand years ago, doesn't it? It's got that real, yeah, that relic <laughs> look to it. Oh, my oh, God. It's got a drill hole there as it well. It does have a drill hole, which, I mean, I very, very roughly set this in. Tomorrow's early bird are a load of these pinch bales. Gold goes well with it, doesn't it? 
Isn't that incredible? Do you know, it's really unusual to get a donut with a drill hole. I don't think I've ever seen it before. I think you might be right, because I think I think normally the drill hole is that big yeah. aperture in the centre. Yeah. That's a great point, isn't yeah. it? Um, I, I would absolutely say, if you're looking for a donut for a... Um, Thank you for that, Michael. Uh, that's the early bird tomorrow, by the way, all those gorgeous pinch bells. If you're looking for something for maybe um, the man in your life, uh, then this, I think, is absolutely perfect because it does have that kind of... Uh, yes, it is a unisex look. I think it's actually more, more suited to guys or if you love your kind of gothic style pieces. I think it's got a really lovely gothic kind of edge to it, but it's, it's the texture for me. I don't know about you, Yvonne, but it's just got that really lovely yeah. kind of relic, kind of ancient feel to it. Absolutely. It's beautiful. And as you say, it's got a deep um, etching in it. Yes. But it's still smooth. Isn't it's it not just sharp gorgeous. at all, is it? It looks like it's been worn. It looks yes. like it's been handled by somebody for yes. years. Do you know what? And, and this is going to sound like a very boring thing to say, but I saw a, a, a photograph on Facebook of um, the oldest, I'm going to sound really sad now, the <laughs> oldest door in, the oldest door in the world, I think it is, or the old, definitely the oldest door in the UK. And it's in Westminster Abbey and it dates back to 10, 1050. And it's a door which is two metres high and it's the most beautiful worn mm. door. And it's got, um, it's got, it's got the most wonderful kind of smooth quality to it. I think it's made of oak. And it's oh, just, just, it's got kind of leather and kind of um, iron kind of struts kind of holding it together. And it's absolutely gorgeous. This reminds me very yeah. much of that. It's got that worn kind of feel, like it's seen something before, like it's lived before. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, and there is beauty in old doors. That's, oh, They're absolutely. used a lot in art, in, in portraits and things, aren't they? In yes. paintings. Yes, absolutely. Uh, so they've got a beauty of their own. Oh, they really do, don't they? Uh, £149, well done. Um, Maker, Deborah, Susan, Maker, Cody. Oh, it's on split pay. Look, 37.25. Well done to you. Do enjoy this. It's so lovely. Something a little bit different. Uh, I mean, this could have been from medieval times or it could have been carved last week. You know, it, it's, it's just, it, it's, got, it's, got that, it, it, it's got that timeline, hasn't it? Just beautiful. Isn't that gorgeous? Um, oh, hang on. What have you got the clock on for, Neri Nu? <laughs> what are you doing? Was it a star buy? I don't even... Don't even remember the star by thing coming on. Today's just literally, today's just, uh, it's just, I, I have no idea. Enjoy. It's on split pay. We're about to go lower. 149 is not your deal today. It does look a little bit licorice y, doesn't it? Or like leather. It just doesn't necessarily look like a stone, does it? Look like gorgeous black nephrite jade. Beautiful. Here we go. Come on, Neri. Do us proud, son. Don't forget your 30-day money-back guarantee with everything that you get from JM as well. Well done, everyone. Here we go. 99.99. Amazing. Four-way split pay of 24.99. There you go, everybody. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Maker's got two in the basket. Well done to you, Susan. Uh, do check out when you can. Yeah, you could make a Larry. You could make a lovely kind of... Um, um, it could be a lovely kind of toggle on a larret, so you know you wouldn't necessarily have it so that the uh, toggle would undo, uh, but you'd but it would make a lovely clasp, wouldn't it? Just gorgeous. It, it, it is just that you would expect that to be a one-off, wouldn't you? Absolutely, totally, yeah. Much like the cameos yes, today, you would yeah. absolutely expect that to be yeah. a one-off. So interesting, isn't it? Jeanette, well done to you in Nottinghamshire. Loads of you there. Please check out as soon as you can. Lots of people with multiples in their baskets as well. Um, so lovely to hear from you today. Give us a weather update. Is it raining everywhere? No, actually, probably easier to tell us. Is it, is it not raining with you or is it sunny? Mm. Is it sunny with anyone? Oh, sunshine in North Essex. Morning. Uh, rained all night. Oh. <laughs> Duvet day and JM for me as I travelled back from Crete yesterday, says Ooh. Anna. Oh. oh, I hope you had a nice time, darling. I hope it yeah. wasn't too hot for you. Have a yeah. duvet day. Look after yourself. How gorgeous. Yeah. Well done. Stay with us. <laughs> oh, yes, definitely stay with us. We've got the most amazing show today. Uh, a couple more messages. Here we go. Any minute. Any minute. Very temperamental, these. They're stuck. They really are stuck. Last day of my holes. Not raining here yet, but threatening. So spending the morning watching JM. Love the cameos, says Sharon. I know. They're works yeah, they of are beautiful. art, aren't they? <coughs> Absolutely. And Debbie, good morning, lovely ladies. It's been raining in uh, North Hants. 
Butchers is... I really... I, I think that might be predictive text. <laughs> North Hans Butchers. Uh, but there is hope, maybe. But there is hope. Yeah. Uh, there we yeah. go. And beautiful sky. Oh, Debbie, best for you and all the butchers in Northamptonshire and everywhere else. I know that there's a lovely lady watching whose son works in Barry the Butchers, where I uh, where oh, I live in Stratford. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's my nan watches it. The, oh. the best butchers around. Oh, God, yeah. they are. They are good, aren't yeah, they? Yeah, they are. Oh, they're good. great. Yeah. Well done, everybody. Yeah, they are good. 99. But it well did done. rain on St Swithin's Day, so that's 40 days and 40 nights, isn't it? Is that what it means? Mm. Oh, if I'm, come on. <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> Do you know what? It's like my, my my grandpa used to say things like, "Oh, if the trees are, if the if the if the if the crows are roosting high in the trees, it means you're going to have a, a fair winter." Or whatever. There's whatever. a lot to be said for those old wives' tales. Rubbish he used to come out with anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Was he, well? he was the most <laughs> Scottish person. He got more Scottish as he got older. Oh, you know, that kind of thing. Right, here we go. Beautiful. Oh, MacBangle. There you go. It is an opportunity. Oh, it's an absolute beaut. Well done. I love the D-shaped ones. They're gorgeous, yeah. aren't they? This colour. Absolutely amazing. Look at this beautiful blue quality. 499 Mrs. and Cornwall makers there. Well done to you as well. Absolutely beautiful. The most gorgeous bangle here. 225 carats of your Olmec blue. Isn't that just outstanding? Well done, everybody. Go, go, go. What a gorgeous <laughs> piece. Do you know what? I saw a video the other day of somebody putting on a bangle. Um, and what that involves, kind of, is this, if it's a very, very, you put your hand in a bag and then put kind of what looked like WD-40 or something. Oh, it oh so that like, it's It reminded slides. me of um, All Creatures Great and Small yeah. with James Herriot when he's about to, <laughs> you know, with a cow. Uh, that's what it reminded me of. Don't need your bracelet on for that. Thought, what am I watching? Uh, and it was a lady putting on a bangle. Uh, and it was just, yeah, it was, oh, I mean, it was dear. challenging to get on, but she managed to get it on in the end. Oh, I do love these that pieces. That matches just... your dress beautifully. Oh, I need to have it then. Yeah, definitely. I need to have it. I shall, yeah. I shall be leaving the building with this today. Go in your Four, wardrobe. Nine, nine. Yes, exactly. Ma uh, Mrs. in Cornwall, you can check out my lovely, we've got Maker there. Well done to you. <laughs> Amazing. 0800 655. Well done. How many do we have, Neary? <laughs> How many do we have? One left. This is the actual one you're going to be getting. This is the one you're actually going to be getting. Well, it's on a four-way split pay. Well done, which is absolutely brill. Gorgeous. Well done. Right. Really pretty. Oh, oh I can't get it off. I need to keep it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if only it was that Nice box, here. too. I know. Shall we do the early bird special, which is, of course, your pack of 500 silver-plated base metal spacer beads. These are so useful. Um, uh, there isn't a jewellery maker out there who doesn't need these. Nope. They are absolutely incredible. Don't go anywhere. Early bird coming up. Here we go. So um, the, the humble spacer bead, something which it's... Mm. Almost impossible to make yourself. Would you agree with that? Uh, I would definitely. I would. I mean, you're a silversmith. I, would, I couldn't make them. There we go. Definitely couldn't so make them. So something that's kind of almost impossible to make yourself. Something that... Because sometimes you look at things and you think, well, I could make that. I could make definitely. that. Definitely. So, so, so why would I bother? No, no, yeah. no. I'm going to make my Easy own. Easy to make. Yeah. But, uh, you, and why would you bother? Precisely. Yeah. I mean, Precisely. you could be making far more interesting things, couldn't you? Exactly. These are basics. Exactly. They are basics. They are absolute essentials. You know, when we think of essentials, we think of things like crimp beads or earring findings yep. or chain or whatever it might be. And those are the things which really help hold your jewellery together. But I'm with I'm with um, Yvonne here. I, you know, these are these are basics. These are essentials. These can make your jewellery, these can um, uh, highlight your jewellery. Yep. They can be the punctuation marks in your pieces. Yep. They can separate out pieces. Uh, we had a lovely Wall of Fame entry from a lady today who was saying about um, 
you know, she tried to knot with the pearls that she had. Uh, she found it challenging, so she bought a strand of gemstones and mm -hmm. used those as spacers. You could do that with these, yeah. um, so they can they can look like knots. Uh, you can make beautiful articulated pieces. They can be little features that you pepper throughout your uh, jewellery. And, and they are for everyone. Sorry, Cara. No, they no, are for fine. everyone. Wire workers will use them. Totally. Silversmiths, beaders. Um, Pearl knotters. Absolutely. Every, everybody will use these. Absolutely. Yeah. And I think that, um, you know, they, they can be those little, that little bit of seasoning, or it could be the entire piece. There are companies like Links of London who, who uh, you know, famous for making the Sweetie Bracelet, which is basically a, a, a bracelet of jump rings. Lots of companies out there will make um, uh, 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 bracelets, be them sterling silver or silver plated base metal like these just using spacer beads and mm -hmm. it's it's lovely high-end commercial jewelry and they're expensive precisely <laughs> make it yourself and it's handmade now the start price is 29.99 500 spacer beads 500 okay that's a lot yeah now you are getting crimp tubes which are these ones here you are going to be getting uh, 50 of those. So 50 of your crimp tubes. There you go. These are the kind of things which can um, hold your jewellery together. It's kind of the glue almost which holds your jewellery together, which is great. So crimp tubes are absolutely invaluable, or you can just use them as spacer beads. You've got your three mil round spaces, which are going to be these ones here. Uh, your three mil. Oh, can I have the details again, please, Libby? That's okay, don't worry. Yeah, there you go. Th a plain three mil spaces, 50 of those. You then get plain four mil spaces and you get 50 of those. I think that's going to be these ones that's here. the biggest ones, will it? Yeah, lovely. You then get corrugated beads, which are three mil. You move these ones out of the way, which are going to be... Oh, blimey. They're <laughs> going to be these ones, I believe. You then get corrugated beads, which are three and a half mil. Oh, man alive. Uh, which are going to be these ones here. <coughs> so 75 in each one of those. You then get stardust beads. You then get uh, stardust beads in three mil, three and a half mil, 75 in each one of those. You then get your oval beads, which are these beautiful you ones You rarely here. see ovals. Very rare. It's a bit like the rice pearl. Yeah. A bit like the rice rarely, pearl. There you yeah. go. They're lovely, they? are they? gorgeous. You get 25 of those. You get fancy beads. You get 25 of those. Oh, there's some more of those ones there. These, these are your fancy beads here, which are almost like little bead caps. Um, which are really, really lovely. So you've got in total 500 of these spaces. Now, they're all silver-plated base metal, which is wonderful, which is why we're at $29.99. Um, and as, oh. as, as Yvonne quite rightly says, uh, if you're into, I don't know, macrame, mm. these make wonderful ends on the um, uh, stoppers on the ends of your sliding class bracelets yeah. with, you know, the little yeah. bits of cord coming down. You can put them into your macrame design if Kumahimo. you're a wire worker. Kumahimo, beaded Kumahimo, perfect. If you're into your wire work, these can really um, <clears throat> accent your, your, your wire like work. People like Rachel Norris. She sort of sews her components together. She and does. she slips beads on, onto the... Yeah. And those would be perfect. They would, wouldn't they? <clears throat> yeah. um, simple, stretchy bracelets. Yeah, yeah. Stretchy bracelet with these. Absolutely gorgeous. You're wearing your um, oh, yeah. bracelets today with yeah. gemstones in. You've just separated them out with the yeah, space little beads. Yeah, little jades with, um, with spacer beads Isn't in Isn't that lovely? Yeah. Do, uh, just show oh. that to Michael again okay. and we can just see how you've used it. little poppy and jasper if, and jade if, there. If and they've was, got the um, little spacer beads, two if, mil spacer beads. Yeah, if it, was, if it was just jade, it would be absolutely beautiful. But doesn't that precious metal flash just yes, kind of it does. add something? It lifts it, doesn't it? We're at £20. That's £19.99 for a pack of 500 silver plated base metal spacer beads. That is absolutely phenomenal, isn't it? Incredible. Well done. Lots of people coming through. Now, we do have a big quantity of these. Do feel free to multi-buy these. Speak to the call centre team if you want to add three, four, five, six packs of these onto your order, please do. Um, just alter the quantity you check out in your baskets on our app or if you're shopping with us on our website. Um, but also, just, just take into consideration as well that if you do buy multiple packs of these, they're not going to take up a huge amount of room. You know, they're not big and bulky like the big storage boxes we bought you the <laughs> other day. You know, they're really sensibly sized, so they're not going to take up too much room. But you will use them again and again and again. You will come back to them again and again and again. Well done, everybody. Yeah, you might not know what you want them for now, but to have them there, Believe, it's yeah. amazing how they come in. If you've, made, if you've made a bracelet or a necklace, which is just... 
a centimetre too short or just Absolutely. half an inch too short yeah. or whatever it might be. Yeah. Or you just think it just needs something, a little yeah. accent. Try these. And I'm sure Jan Dwyer, at the end of her pearls, doesn't she put little see, uh, little she bit, silver beads? That's a beads? good point. Yes, I believe she does. At the end, to, to make it look very neat by the clasp. It looks neat. It looks professional. Yeah. It looks finished. These are your crimp beads, these ones. Uh, but, the, you know, the rest are beads. Um, I, I'm surprised. I thought I would have seen more people coming through for these. We've got Berkshire, yeah. Greater London, Flintshire, North Yorkshire, Middlesex, West Yorkshire. Ah, oh, there we go. Hampshire, yeah. Swansea, Lancashire, Worcestershire, Fife, Manchester. Loads of these sitting in baskets at the minute. Um, £19.99. pence. We're not done, by the way. We're going to give you one final price. So you're going to be getting 500 beads in total. I would be multi-buying these. I'd be buying these by the bucket load. They're silver-plated base metal. And by the way, when something says vermeil plated uh, or whatever it might be or if something says silver plated you know on a website chances are it's going to be silver plated base metal yep. or silver vermeil plated base metal um so you know this is the same silver plating that you know you know almost everybody else will use it's probably even better you know we want it to come back to us time and time and time again 14.99 for 500 silver plated uh, base metal coppers. That is um, uh, uh, copper space beads. That is absolutely amazing. Well done. Loads of you there. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Loads of people coming through. This is so well, they're like fourteen ninety nine. It is a great deal though, it is, isn't it? Yeah, Come it is. on. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Honours bought two. Claire's bought two. Barbara's bought two. Well done to you. And I think it's a really valid point that um, Yvonne touched upon there, saying you know whatever kind of jewellery making you're into. Yeah. Uh, whether you're a wire worker, a macramis, whether you're into threading, whether you're into um, uh, kumihimo, whether you're into, um, oh gosh. If you go through the guest designers, I can imagine every single every guest single designer one. finding these really useful. Susie would use these in her gemstone yep. tassels on, yep. a, on a mala say. Yep. Mark would use these kind of uh, to highlight his um, to highlight his seed bead work. Monica, probably exactly the same, yep. using them to yep. um, highlight her seed bead work. Alison with her wire work Alison and Natalie. Alison with her wire work. Uh, Laura Binding would probably use these as well, kind of on the end of chainmail pieces yeah. as well. You know, these are just such useful, yeah. useful, useful pieces. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Debbie Kershaw, again, she'd, she'd find her... A, uh, yeah. a wacky way of using yeah. these. You know how she is. She's <laughs> just kind of crazy with, with some of the ideas she comes up with. But it always works. And then again, look at the kits that we've got today. Look at the, look what we're bringing you. We're bringing you the gorgeous electroplated pearls. You can use them with that chain work. You know, if you don't mind mixing your precious metal with your plated precious metal, then absolutely go for it. And if um, you make your own ear, shepherd hooks, you can put, you, you know how shepherd hooks have? Oh, they yeah. They have a great, little bead. Great shout, yeah. Yeah. Hang on, what are we doing? We're not done. Uh -oh. We're not done, everyone. We're gonna go lower. I thought 14 99 I did. I price. thought that was good. I gave you the big guns there, Neary, at 14 99 thinking, yep, that's the deal. I know it's the number on the star by sheet. Do you know what, though? I have to say, have to say, with Neary's star by sheets, I wonder why he gives them to me half the time, because honestly, it, it, it means absolutely nothing. You may as well use them for, I don't know, firewood. It's, uh, it's absolutely ridiculous. Oh. Do you know what? There we go. <laughs> use them to light your fire. Use them for kindling. Use them for, I don't know, use them as scrap paper. Use them to write your shopping lists on. Because I'll tell you what, the star by sheet's not useful for anything else, Neary. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> He's saying, we've got to be reactionary. Lisa's got two loads. Well done to you. I like that idea, Ollie. Make a really, 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 really long necklace. Yeah. <laughs> nice one. Why not? Twelve ninety nine. Well done. But you know, that's the <coughs> that's the that's the thing. When we're and that's the great thing about jewelry maker because we are live. It's eight fifty nine and twelve seconds on Wednesday, the second of August, twenty twenty three. Because we are live. Um, and uh, it, 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 we have to be reactive. And if, and if things haven't sold out, well, we've got to go lower. We've got to go lower. Uh, so that's exactly what we've done. £12.99. pence. Well done, everybody. Everybody pays that final low price. And whether you came through to get these at 29 99 or coming through now, everybody pays that final low price, which is just absolutely fantastic. So, right, so you're doing yourself a massive favour 
by getting involved nice and early. Debbie's got two. Well done to you, Claire. In Dorset's got two. Well done to you. Loads of people there. Um, well done. 500 spacer beads in total. They're yours. Take them. Enjoy them. And as Yvonne quite rightly said, you may get them now and think, oh, I don't really know what I'm going mm. to do with them. But believe you and I, you will you will find a use for these. You definitely will. They're always come. It's one of those things. It's, it's something you always have to have in stock because you know, they're always useful. Absolutely. Absolutely. They're the kind of things as soon as you run out of them, you go, oh, yeah, my Yeah, I wish life. I had some. And 500 sounds like a lot, doesn't it? But you will get through them. Well, because they're all so different as well. Yeah, precisely. Yeah, it's not as though you've got um, 500 one, of one two, type. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Because you're going to get well, effectively 10 different designs. You know, you will, you will end up um, uh, kind of finding your favourites or using one for a particular yeah. time. Morning, Kinga. Hello. Ah, oh, there she is. The light of my life. Well done. 12 99 for you today. Well done. Pam and Uxbridge. Julie. <laughs> oh, Ollie, I've worked with you for so long now. Ollie's like, my, I don't know. <laughs> my conscience. Ollie, I don't know. Ollie, I, Ollie and I have worked together for many, many moons now. I don't know. Sometimes good, sometimes not so good. <laughs> We're one big happy family, aren't we? I learned something about Michael this morning, Michael on cameras. Apparently you're very useful in a pub quiz. Tom Neary said. He just knows lots of random stuff. Oh, I'm just trying to recall some of the uh, some of the some of the pub quiz questions that there were. How long is the term for the American presidency? How long is the term? Four years. Four years. Well done. Um, where would you find your cruciate ligament? What? Your cruciate ligament. In your leg. Yes, in your leg. Well done. Whoa. Um, um, oh, what was the other one? Uh, Oh, there were lots of other questions. I knew some of them. Tom knew some of them. We thought we'd form a little team. Uh -huh. We said, well, you want Michael Groves on your team. Did you, <laughs> did you win? Oh, we were just doing it. We were just doing it this morning. Oh, I we'll see. Oh, well, <laughs> we, need to form a little, we need to form a little team, a JM team. Oh, OK. Right, anyway. Um, <laughs> anyway, don't go anywhere. We've got loads and loads of those coming up in the next hour, including a lovely demo from um, um, Yvonne. We've got um, these. <laughs> Hilarious, well done. Beautiful cameos, once in a lifetime pieces. That's estate jewelry right there. We'll see you after the break. knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day 365 days a year if you have a question or query contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2 alternatively you can email or drop us a direct message on our facebook page jewelry maker happy to help Lovely jewellery makers, we have an incredible, incredible weekend planned for you. Kick starting this Friday, the return of the absolutely, utterly exquisite hand carved type A black jadeite crosses. We've had them before, they sold out in a nanosecond. Make sure you don't miss out on your opportunity for the return of type A black jadeite crosses. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? 
Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. We're back, we're back, we're back, we're back. Um, look, we've got the most amazing, amazing, amazing um, uh, nine o'clock hour, 10 o'clock hour, 11 and 12. I wanna show you very quickly what's coming up in the 12 o'clock hour with Yvonne. Um, beautiful kits, electro-plated pearls, and um, just uh, lovely, lovely jewelry, which uh, it looks kind of, it looks like the kind of jewelry you'd see in an art gallery, I think. It, it's, it's got simplicity to it. Yeah, I've um, never seen anything like them before. It's so lovely. You've really made the most of these gorgeous Yeah, well, with the earrings, the I um, <coughs> the reason I did the earrings like that was because, oh, yes, they're, because nice. they're double sided. Yes. And I just wanted them to be able to just oh. keep moving and, um, and for you to be able to see them from every direction. Just imagine if you've got a lovely kind of pixie <coughs> haircut or something and wearing yeah. those earrings. They're yeah. just going to... They're really lovely. They're going to be absolutely incredible. Yeah. Um, yeah. So they're coming up in the 12. Really lovely. And isn't it nice to see a very uh, uh, kind of a contemporary modern take on a pearl? Yes. Nice to have that sometimes, to isn't say it? That. Yeah, yes, lovely. it is. So a really contemporary take on, mm. on the beautiful pearl. Uh, that's coming up in the 12. Now, we do have a selection of black jade, which I really hope we can play at some point today. Hopefully in the 11, it might, we'll just have to see how things uh, pan out. We've got um, these cameos coming up, which are once in a lifetime. Can't wait for the cameos. They are, without a shadow of a doubt, some of the most impressive gemstone carving I have ever seen in my life. And we've bought you some of the most amazing pieces of carved jade. It, it doesn't look real. It's genuine Australian opal, Australian opal carved cameos. It should not look this good. You know, some of the Australian opal that we've got, um, you know, that we bought you kind of right in the beginning of us bringing you Australian opal looks, for want of a better word, just looks like potch, looks like stone. That. Don't you think it's the, the way that these have been done? It's sort of modernised a cameo. Oh, I'd like to think so, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, the pink, like the pink so. ones uh, really went out of fashion, didn't they? The old-fashioned pinky Absolutely, ones. Absolutely, I don't yeah. know what they were made of, actually, those I'm just pinky trying to think ones. maybe like a rhodochrosite or a rhodonite or something, mm. or or the old kind of ones which were almost kind of like a Wedgwood blue with the with the white yeah. on top yeah. or something. Yeah. You know, they're yeah. beautiful, or, or the carnelian yeah. background. But they, uh, with all goodwill in the world, they fell out of fashion, those. But I think this really modernises oh, them. Yeah, I, I can't wait to see what people make with them. Um, Coming up now, uh, oh, we've also got some chain as well. Spools of sterling silver chain, meter long spools. That's really exciting as well. So really exciting. Uh, now, which, which, what are we doing first, lovely? Yep, yep, yep. I reckon I've got it here. I reckon. So let's have a look. So chain wise, we've got a Rolo chain. We've got what looks like a twisted chain. What? 
That looks like a... That's a curb chain. Yeah. It's going to be this one. Yeah, that's the curb. That's Rollo, isn't it? Yeah, I would say so. That's a curb. I th uh, that's curb. That's twist. Yeah. Oh. No, it is that one, isn't let's it? Have a look. Gosh, so fine, isn't it? Gosh, let's have a look. Mm. Yeah, they are a metre. Oh, that's the twisty one, I think. Yeah. Okay. So this one is... The Rollo chain. Now, what's so lovely about these is, A, you get them on the spool. B, they're sterling silver. But C, and I think most importantly, they come with these end caps, which are um, invaluable. They are invaluable. These are the kind of things where, um, you know, these are the kind of chains where what we get asked most often when we bring these kind of chains to air is... How do I connect it to a clasp? How do I finish it off? How do I finish this chain off? And what's so great about these end caps is it eliminates all of that. You can simply feed the chain into the cap uh, and crimp it. And, um, and, and there you go. There's your kind of finished item, which is absolutely beautiful. Now, the, the great thing about this particular chain, the Rollo chain in particular, is because the links are a little bit... Oh, thank you, um, Yvonne, that's great. Because the links are a little bit more open, if you wanted to use your 0.2 millimetre gauge, your 0.2 or 0.25 millimetre gauge sterling silver wire, you Absolutely. could weave it through you the eye of that link and you'd save yourself the caps for another project, maybe. Here uh, they are. And I... Yes, you can crimp them. If you're adept, you can solder them. Um, How do you... Get I glued those. Did you just glue them yeah, in? Uh, I used the hypo cement. It's just perfect. Yeah. Isn't that wonderful? Look at that. And look at that professional finish that you get. Absolutely professional. Was it a bit of a trick to get it into the... Into the, into uh, the yeah, chain? I actually got a pair of pliers and just crimped it yeah. a little bit. And it, then it went in quite easily. So if you press those links a little I th bit, I think so. It. It's much yeah. easier. Yeah. A little piece of... Actually, I know what I used. A featherweight head pin. Yes, to lovely. push it in. Yeah. And... Uh, a bit of hypo cement and we're Perfect. away with it. Yeah. See, that's just wonderful. And it gives you such a wonderful finished result there. Isn't that great? It's all 925 sterling silver. Now, does it give us the gram weight on here or not? Oh, hopefully it doesn't. Oh, well done. 2.89 grams of sterling silver. Now, let's talk about this. Sterling silver. Who uses sterling silver? Well, we use it a lot here. 925 sterling silver is 92.5% pure silver. And then you've got other alloys which make it up to 100% to make it workable so it doesn't, so it doesn't um, tarnish as easily. So it's stronger. So it's stronger. Absolutely. You use silver a lot, don't you? All the time. And yes. presumably you've got sterling silver from Jewelry Maker, but you've obviously sourced sterling silver for years from other people as well uh -huh. it's all the same isn't it of course sterling it is. silver yes it is so if you're it's all nine to five uh, precisely yeah. so if you're buying sterling silver from tiffany's or boodles or de beers or or whoever dior it's all nine to five sterling silver this is the same product this is the same item how can we bring you these kind of deals so we, unfortunately, here at Jewelry Maker, we don't have the luxury of buying sterling silver at the lowest price point and stockpiling it and, you know, f you know filtering it through uh, and bringing it to you over the, over the months and years. Um, we have to buy it pretty much week on week. Uh, and that's because we use sterling silver so much. We have so many sterling silver findings, so many components made out of this precious metal. Um, but because we make so much, uh, so many, I should say, sterling silver components, because we use so much of it, um, yeah, we can bring and we've got our own silversmiths. We've got our own uh, chain making machines, for instance. Um, we can keep those costs down uh, where the production and um, where the cost of production is involved. So the manufacturing costs are a little bit lower because we do it all in house. We outsource as little as possible. And because of that, we can bring you these for some of the most competitive prices you are going to see globally. So you've got a meter of sterling silver Rollo chain. Great thing about this being on the spool is you can cut exactly the length that you want. Exactly yep. um, the length that you want. Um, I, on this necklace, I decided to do um, a double strand um, because I, it, although it's not a heavy pendant, mm -hmm. um, I thought one, one uh, strand would, would not set it off properly. Uh, and, and that was my choice. I to, think that looks to lovely. To put a double too. strand on there. Yeah, I think it looks so really lovely. So that enabled me to, to do exactly what length I wanted. You see, and that's it. Yeah. And that's it. That's the wonderful thing about working directly off a spool is you can cut exactly yeah. um, as much as you want. 
Now, you get your meter of sterling silver Rolo chain. You get your... Uh, and, and the good thing about a Rolo chain as well, because it's a one-in-one -one round link, it's very, very strong. Um, it, the, the chances of this chain knotting as well is much, much less than, say, a curb chain. A curb chain will does have a, ten, does have a tendency to knot a little bit more because it's a little bit finer, whereas this is really kind of cast iron quality you're going to be getting here. Here we go, my lovelies, all the way down. So you're getting a meter of your sterling silver Rollo chain and you're going to be getting your end caps as well. Here we go. Price point wise, amazing. £24.99 for you today. Well done. That's for a whole meter of your chain. Fabulous. Absolutely wonderful. And also you're, you, the spool that it comes on as well, this metal spool, really useful. It's like a bobbin. It is for like a, a sewing bobbin. machine. Yeah. Yeah. Really useful little spool that you're going to be getting here for you to, you know, if you want to use it again. Um, and great, yeah, professional supplies um, uh, that you're going to be getting here today. And at these kind of prices, these are kind of pretty much wholesale prices that you're going to be getting here today, which is absolutely brilliant. Um, fantastic. Well done. So you've got your meter of chain. You've got your end caps. Um, uh, and it's all 925 sterling silver, £24.99. Well done. Um, what we're going to do, we're going to bring you a 30-second clock. We are going to go lower. Now, this is... This is mm, with things like buying gemstones, for instance, you saw Wayne, Wayne Del Paso, our incredible, uh, our incredible um, uh, head gemstone buyer earlier on. Now, Wayne is very, very good at buying gemstones. He's very, very good at spotting a great deal. He's very good at identifying great quality. He's very good at doing that. With gems, when you're buying gemstones, there's always movement. There's always movement. With sterling silver, with precious metals, it's dictated by the market. So it's very, very difficult to say, oh, well, can I get a better deal on this sterling silver? It's just not possible. We're at 19 pounds and 99 pence for a meter of sterling silver. This is something where there's very little wiggle room. The, the, you know, there's wiggle room with, with all of our gemstones when we're buying them, but with precious metals, with precious commodities, mm -hmm. you know, we are, you know, there are lots of other people buying these precious commodities as well. And that price point is definitely set. You can track the price point day on day, month on month, year on year, if you want to. We're at £19.99. We've got, we've got people getting involved. That's great to see you all today. Well done, everyone. Um, Do you know, if you're making jewellery to sell, mm. you can, instead of doing 14, 16, 18, 20, the, the standard size yes. chains, some people like them made to measure, basically. Absolutely. And you can make whatever length anyone wants, to be honest Great with you. Point. Yeah. Great point. Great um, point. If you do your own chain tassels, these are wonderful. And also, what I will say as well is that with sterling silver, these, this, this pack of findings that I've got here will probably have been made uh, in a completely different place to where this chain would have been made, maybe a completely different uh, year, month, country, whatever. It matches. And that's really important that the sterling silver here matches the sterling silver here. Because what you don't want is to have, you know, bring these two components together and for them to look completely um, uh, different. That's what's so wonderful about the precious metals that we bring you here on Jewelry Maker. The sterling silver, silver plated base metal, gold plated silver, all looks identical I to each other. I did some um, drop earrings there, oh, a new sweet. chain, you see. Yes, lovely. Um, and just put some little stars and a moon. Well, didn't put the moon on, but the little stars, the dangly yeah. ones. Yeah. I put those on. How lovely is that? So lovely to be able to bring, uh, so, so lovely to be able to make pieces like this. And you can see they're slightly different lengths. You know, you yeah. get to kind of and they move so well when you're wearing them. That's exactly it. And when you've got a metre of chain to be able to use and to cut that, cut that length directly off the chain. You can get exactly the length that you want. 14.99 for you today. Well done. Patricia, Teresa, well done to you, my lovely Elizabeth, Deborah, Natalie. Well done to you, Bernadette, Anthony. Well done to you, Maker, Angela, Patricia, Sheila, Lucy, Maker. Natalie's got two loads. Well done to you. Um, Absolutely fantastic at £14.99. Well done, everybody. OK, we've got a couple more chains to bring you as well. Glenda, Richard, Maker and Cornwall. Gosh, there's loads in baskets. Check out as soon as you can. Well done, everybody. Bernadette's got two loads as well. Well done to you as well. Richard in Nottinghamshire and in Cardiff. Well done. Really great to have you today. And like I said right at the beginning, because it's a lovely Rolo chain with a slightly open uh, links... You can weave onto it, much like with the paperclip chain that you've used in the necklace Absolutely, there. Absolutely, yes. I've got some little, little pearls on, little yes. seed pearls on mm. there. And that's the lovely thing about being able to use chain like this, mm -hmm. is you can add on to it. It's the perfect chain to be able to do that with. Or as you said, to solder onto as well. Yeah, 
I, I mean, they, it is just endless, the things you mm. can use it for. Um, I mean, you can do multi-strand bracelets oh, with just chain lovely. and they look gorgeous. Gorgeous. 60 seconds, uh, very, very, very limited. And then we're going to be moving on. Well done, everybody. Uh, gorgeous. Well done. Pembrokeshire, Staffordshire's got three in the baskets. That's you, lovely Catherine. Check out my loves. Well done, Teresa. Oh, gosh. Catherine in Staffordshire's got six in her baskets. Check out my lovelies. Well done. We've literally got a dozen chances remaining. Mrs. Maker in Manchester, Sandra. Mrs. Mrs. in Cornwall. Is it Mrs. Cornwall or Mrs. in Cornwall? Mrs. Comma Cornwall. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Mrs. Comma Cornwall. <laughs> Gorgeous. Well done, everybody. Lots of people still uh, coming through. Great to have you all with us today. We are into single figures. What a deal. Absolutely fantastic. When you when you think what uh, Gemma Crow used to do with Chain. Oh, she, oh my she gosh. She just was um, um, an artist with Chain. The most creative mind I've yes, ever met. Absolutely. I agree. I just yeah. she, she would look at that and go. Yeah. I'm going to make a car out of yeah, that. No, so she, yeah. was, she is she incredible. Is amazing, she? she is absolutely incredible. wonderful. Yeah. Wonderful. I lady. love her. <laughs> Me too. Uh, Sheila Lucy, well done to you, my lovely. You've got two gorgeous. Well done. Right. <laughs> yeah. Should we do the curb? Curb. This is, yeah. This is a really That's lovely. That's really smooth chain isn't it it is it's yeah. like liquid isn't yeah. it it pulls yeah like that, liquid. that's not one you would really try to add into i don't think is it that one no i think no i well i mean you you can see through the links can't yeah. you but I, oh. the others are a little bit more open aren't they i think you'd need amazing eyesight yeah <laughs> to be able to do I, I, I would end up going cross-eyed i love that oh. one though it's nice and smooth it really is isn't it mm -hmm. And you get a different kind of look. It's a really uh, glossy, kind of glamorous yeah. Uh, yeah. look that you get with it. It's slinky. Oh, <laughs> Yvonne! <laughs> slinky. <laughs> Absolutely. Can we say words like that at 20, 9 21 in the morning? Well, Yvonne just did. <laughs> Yvonne did. I'm thinking of kind of the night, a lady walking down some stairs in like a, a satiny nightgown with a pair of those I mean, awful uh, slippers with the kitten heels and the fur, kind of the, uh, the feathers on the toe. Yes, definitely pink. Fluffy. <laughs> Wonderful, I love it. Oh, there you go. Right, here we go. Your slinky chain. <laughs> Nineteen ninety nine. Well done, everybody. And your end caps as well, which are just an absolute revolution, aren't they? Again, it's not something that you have to use the end caps with these. You don't have to. Uh, they're very, very useful, but you don't have to. Um, here we go. We're at nineteen pounds and ninety nine pence. Again, solid sterling silver, which is just great. Um, here we go. And just look at the way. If I just kind of drop this it, on the yeah, on it the, drapes, doesn't it? Lovely drape. There you go. Aren't they gorgeous? Aren't they I'm lovely? I'm just wondering, you know, with, that would look nice with um, a pearl just with a chain through it. If you could get it, I mean, I'm not sure if it would go through it, but some of them have got bigger drill holes or you could, dri or you could drill them out a little bit bigger. <laughs> but just one hanging in the middle of a chain would look Oh, it would look absolutely stunning, wouldn't it? Yeah. Or uh, 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 as uh, Ollie's saying, the slider beads that we've had, um, uh, you, could, you, you yeah. could fit that through. I'm just trying to work out how you'd be able to do that. If, if through the end link, you might be able to get some wire or, or the very like. Very fine wire. Through. Very, very fine wire. Uh, yeah, gorgeous. That yeah. would be so nice, wouldn't it? Well yeah. done, 19 .99. We're going to take the price point down. Here we go. Great if you want to get that really high end. And, and just look at it as a really simple little bracelet. It's such lovely drape on it, isn't it? Wouldn't that be nice for a little girl? Yes, I think so. A really lovely, delicate little bracelet. Yeah, you wouldn't want anything too chunky, would you? No. Really sweet. Well done. At 14 99 absolutely gorgeous. Right, Beautiful. Made. Yes, bridesmaids, flower girls, and oh, yeah. mind you, I was a bride. I was a flower girl. I think when I was three, I hated it. Oh, did you? Uh, well, I was walking down the aisle in front of my auntie, and I was kicking my dress up, trying to trying to walk <laughs> down the aisle. Kick. Oh, it's just oh. I, I can I, imagine and then, that. And then they had outside the church. It, it was in the church. 
kind of as 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 my uncle and auntie were coming out and you know they're standing in the art in, in, yeah. in the archway of the thing and we're all standing behind them and everything and there's a photo of them kind of like this together and I'm peeking round her dress and <laughs> the photo of the day oh yes with a lovely <laughs> he-man haircut and oh it's gorgeous <laughs> 14.99 well done, everybody. Natalie's taken two of these. Well done to you, Beverly, oh, uh, Lillian. Well done, everyone. Absolutely fantastic. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Let's move on, my lovelies. Let's do the final Take one. Take that one away. Yes, please. Finalement. Le finalement. Here we go. So this is your, oh, hang on, cable chain. Is that right? Is it cable? Cable. And again, it is that really lovely, much like the first chain, that slightly more open, open yeah. uh, chain that you're going to be getting here. So easy to uh, add into that. All sterling silver. This is so lovely. We are spoilt yeah. uh, with all these components and findings. Uh, we're so, so, so spoilt. To work with sterling silver, let's not, let's not kind of, um, you know, underestimate the value of that. I can imagine most people when they go to a craft stall, you know, a craft fair maybe, or something at a village hall, or you know, something, uh, you know, at a, at you know, a local, a local kind of jewelry event, where I can imagine a lot of people just don't expect they're going to be able to afford sterling mm -hmm. silver, they, or that they're going to get silver, that it's going to be plated silver. Um, and uh, it's such an honour, such a privilege being able to use precious metal, isn't it? I, well, I use it all day. I know day. you do. And I just, I love silver. Mm. Absolutely. It's, I, I'm in my element today to see all this uh, silver yes. set around. Us. Is, it, is it your favourite precious metal? Yes, it is. And why, yeah. why is that? Is it the colour? Is it is usability? What is it that works I think it's for you? accessibility. Yeah, nice. Because most people can afford yeah, maybe yeah, yeah. to it, it's affordable yes. for most people and I to be able to wear and i think as well sterling silver is ageless as well yeah. whereas i think yellow gold isn't wouldn't ne i wouldn't necessarily think of yellow gold being for someone who's young yeah i would think of silver being you know one of those kind of anybody would wear it my mum me yeah. my you know my daughters would you know Absolute. you know sterling and silver you can is afford to one. use it and you can afford to gift it oh, or yes. or so, you That's know so or nice. do mates rates or yes, you know anything like that just to do just to enjoy it and hope other people enjoy it as well. Mm, it's yes, lovely. absolutely. Gorgeous. Fourteen ninety nine. Well done, everybody. Right, bezel strip. Now, this is oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. And then we've got bezel strip coming your way as well. Oh, sorry, we've got a uh, demo coming your way as well. Let's do the bezel strip. I wonder, have I... Did you steal mine, Yvonne? I don't... <gasps> I've got it. <laughs> right. I don't think I did. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yours will be longer than mine. It is. <laughs> Considerably longer than yours, Yvonne. Uh, here we go. <laughs> You've got to get, you have to get this. This is the, I mean, I'm not going to mess with it too much, but it is the most pliable yeah. silver. It's just malleable, isn't now, it? Now, this is an absolute essential for your cameos, for your cabochons. Now, Yvonne, this is 999 silver. It is, yeah. It's, fi it's fine silver. It's... Um, as I showed earlier, it's it very easily mouldable around mm -hmm. your stones. You can cut it um, if you've got lower stones, not necessarily high bezels. Ah, so yeah. you can cut it not just like that, but you, you can it cut that, it a length way. If you take, uh, yeah, okay, you, yeah, you show us, you you okay, demo though. away. Well, Yvonne. Okay, let's explain as we go. If you've got, I've got some little um, bits and pieces here. Oh, we've got some gorgeous I've stones brought, there. Brought some stuff in for you. Oh. Um, Lovely. Right, if you've got a lower or a tinier bead, yes, or gemstone like that, you can use the dividers uh, to measure where. What you want is, when you've got a cabochon, mm. it's domed, mm -hmm. and you want to bring your metal just as the stone is starting to go over right you don't want it too high you don't want it too low mm. if you get it too high it'll sort of pucker mm. uh, and you'll get a wavy edge around the yes, top yes. but if you take your dividers and you measure on your stone where you would like your bezel to start and finish you can then and then you can take your bezel strip and you can run it down that edge 
and leave a mark. Can you see that oh. silvery mark there? Yes. And then you can get your scissors and you can, um, there it is. And you can just trim, trim that off. So you can make to measure wow. what yes. size bezel strip you want. You can- um, Great way of working that Yeah, out. you can buy it in three millimeter and five millimeter mm. uh, widths. Uh, and you can just uh, okay. utilize them to whatever size your your stone is. Perfect. Okay, brilliant. Okay. Yeah. So what I've done with these, uh, oh, lovely. I I've got a demo to show you how to set a stone, but I just wanted to run through a few things um, before we get to that stage. Please do. Um, as I say, if you can trim. Trim your um, bezel wire yeah. and get your stone, as, as we've shown before, you then mould it. Let's take that stone out of there like that. Let's show mm -hmm. you on there if we can. So we would mould that, cut it to the right height, mould it round the stone, hold your stone. It's very, very malleable. Oh, and then go wow. all the way around. I, I'm doing it very quickly. You could obviously take your time doing this. And then what you want to do is when you've got it in the right shape, you need to make sure your two ends mm. are... Let me bring that in. Get your two ends and make sure that they are level and yeah. that they join. And I'll use this as though it's... A, because it's harder on the little bezels. Let's use this as though it's a bezel for a, for a big cabochon. Yeah, OK. So what you would do is then you manoeuvre it. You know how you manoeuvre a jump ring? Yes, yes. To get it to sit yes. right? And if you sort of work it like this, you get tension. It probably won't in this one, in this instance, because it's such a big one. Mm. But you get your tension there. And what you want is that those two ends of the bezel Just, to meet yeah. perfectly. And then you would... Put it on your so I've just taken that one off there. So mm. let's take that back a stage. You would then end up with something like that. You would put it on your soldering block, mm. put a little bit of solder underneath that join, put that on top, and you'd you'd get your torch and heat that, and the solder will travel up that join. Brilliant. And that's where you end up with that. And then you put put your stone in. Let's try and get it back in the right way. Mm. There we go. You put your stone in like that. Make sure it fits. Then what you do is you get your back plate to get mm. to the stage that I did the cameo, really, mm. and, and this one that I'm going to show you how to set. You then get that piece, and you need to clean... Now, there's many, many ways you can clean your silver. Um, I've just got this for today sometimes I will pickle it use sand uh, wet and dry wire wool loads and loads of things Lovely. but what you need to do is make sure that's flat and mm -hmm. make sure that's flat because what you want and that that isn't in this instance what you need to oh, do yes, is so you can put that on your on your metal block hit it with a hammer and also with this if it's that that's uneven you can get it and you can just rub it on a oh, piece of sandpaper. Brilliant. But yeah. you need to make sure that they're both clean and flat and that you've got a good connection between them both. Mm. And with that one, so pretend I've done that all, you will stick that on there. Now, where you place it will depend on, obviously, if you want to do a stone like that, you don't need a lot round the edge. You mm. just need enough to tidy up and make it smooth. Yes. But if you're doing something like the cameo, you would leave yourself a, a big um, ridge of... Yes, what, yes. Not ridge, ridge is the wrong... Um, um, a bigger amount of excess. Bigger amount of excess yeah. round there. Yeah. And then you can add all your adornments on there and then shape round your adornments. Mm. Uh, and what I would do is... Let me see if I can... Oh, here's this. I would then put my solder inside there. Do you put you, it on the inside? That yeah, you would flux it. You'd, you'd put it on the inside and then 
you would get your torch, heat, heat both of those up to the same. Now, your, your bigger piece will be at the bottom. So what you want to do is keep your heat mostly on the bottom piece. You don't want to put all your heat on the fine bezel because that could melt. So you want to, you get the residual heat onto the bezel from the back plate. And once you've done that, you then, obviously I can't do it all because we haven't got time to That's pickle okay. in, etc. Yeah. So you would then drop it in your pickle cut it down to the size you want and uh, and away you go on this occasion on that one i have actually taken a jump ring oh, let me turn that over That's so you a can lovely see. setting you've made I've, there i've just That's made a, a, really a little jump ring setting. and soldered it onto the back now is that a piece of dental tape it is oh and, you're so clever and then it's okay to put the blue one, as you saw, I was getting in and out uh, very easily. It doesn't matter because there's no back on it and it's not going to get stuck. But when you've got your back plate on, you've got to be very... Uh, when you hear that click mm. and you need to get it out because you've got to do more soldering, it, it, your heart sinks, it yes. really does. So if you put a piece of dental tape underneath your stone, if you can Good call. try and keep my fingers out of the way, it's so tiny and just pull on the dental floss oh, and, uh, legend. <laughs> and out comes the stone so so then <laughs> so then you end up with this oh, what i want lovely. i don't know if i can show you this let's get rid of that the join on this one mm. I don't know michael if i can show you that the join to this is there oh uh Oh, no, 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 can, you can see it there. Can you see it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The join is there. Yeah. But when I finished filing and polishing and making it all look as pretty as it is, if you, if I can take you back down to the outside of that, mm. you don't see... Totally, the, You yeah. do not see the join. What you want is to, is to polish it up, and make it smooth so that you actually <clears throat> cannot see the join at Ooh, all. So that is, that is perfect for me. Um, they don't always go like that. Um, and I'll be perfectly honest with you. But uh, yeah, this one did in this on this occasion. There's also one there that I've done that I've set. Really And lovely. that's got... Um, what I originally did was join this one onto the bottom of there, and then there's a little jump ring at the top to oh, put the chain sweet. through. So that made a like, little movement, a uh, little one that's moved. Also, before you set your stone, what you want to do is, most cabochons are not the same both sides. Yes, or that. interesting, uh, yeah. What you need to do is make sure that your silver is filed down. I think that's a lot lower on that side than it is on that mm -hmm. side. And so what I did was, if you can see on this one, the silver is higher on that end than that end because I filed across there to make it fit. So so that you've got the same amount of silver yes. coming over and it looks level all the way around. Mm. So what we're going to do now is bite the bullet and push that in. Yay! And, and that was the click. That was the click. So I've got, I'm being told that uh, we need to move on a little bit. So what I've got here... A bezel pusher, yeah. which I use. You can use other things. You can use a piece of wooden doweling mm -hmm. if, you, if you've got a very um, sensitive stone mm. that you're frightened of scratching. You mm. can use a piece that will not Good scratch. Idea. And then I'm using a burnisher for after. So I will quickly show you how I would set a stone. I would put my finger onto that. Yeah, lovely. And we do north, south, east and west. Makes so we go for, and what you do is you don't push it all over in one go. You just gently, it's what you would sort of, if it was sewing, you'd tack it in, wouldn't mm. you, first. Mm -hmm. So we do south and then a little bit north. There's the east. There's the west. And then what you do is do in between those points. And you always go opposite. So we go there and then we turn it round and we go at 10 Lovely. past. Lovely. And the same. Because what you don't want to do is push your stone down in one part and it'll 
push the stone yeah, down. It, sh it okay. shuffles the stone, so, doesn't it? Yeah. So basically, you would just go around that, then you would burnish it round with the burnisher, and hopefully, at the end, you would end up with something like that. Ah, oh, we're born. <laughs> Beautiful jewellery, <laughs> gorgeous. So um, thank you so hope, much for that. And if you if you didn't if you need more information on that, I'm available. Just ask questions. I'm, I'm no problem in helping you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you so much, lovely. Um, oh yeah, someone asked yeah, if they could use you the can. Argentium yeah, flux. You can. Yeah, no problem at all. Lovely. Yeah, yeah. good. Lovely. Yeah. I always learn something when new when Yvonne is on the telly. Oh, oh it's lovely Natalie. Oh, oh lovely Natalie. Gorgeous. <laughs> I think Natalie's with us next Saturday, I think. Yes, uh, she is on soon. Yeah. Gorgeous. Thank you so much. Thank you, lovely. You're um, welcome. Right, do not go anywhere. We've got the most amazing cameos coming up. These are once in a lifetime pieces. These are legacy, legacy pieces. They're coming up after the break. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. 
Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. <laughs> I'm so glad you're here, Dave. I'm so thrilled to be here. I wouldn't <laughs> have missed this. Um, I, I, honestly, I'd even been, if you were like literally even if I was, in your pajamas. If I was on my deathbed, I'd have been video calling uh, uh, this show because it is incredible. It's something we've worked really hard on. I know that when, when I'm with you guys, I'm usually kind of bringing you pearls or jadeite. Yeah. Uh, but I do have uh, a very close connection with, with opals. Um, I was very fortunate. Oh, God, how long ago now? Oh, Maybe years. seven or eight years ago, yes. I, went, I got to go to Australia. And we did this amazing tour of Australia. We went uh, to the sapphire mines in, on the East Coast, you know, the Capricorn yes. colored sapphire mines. And then we went uh, down into Cooper PD. And when we went into Cooper PD, we, we met with the, the head of the mining association there, a gentleman called John Dunstan, incredible guy. I, I, any article that you find on Australian Opal, where it, whether it's The Guardian or the BBC, he's been featured in all of them because he is the guy, he's the personality of Cooper PD larger than life and uh, generationals you know generations has been there and you know they they prepare you for Cooper PD they tell you what it's going to be like and you're like yeah 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 I've been to many mines I've been here I've been there and when you get there you think you you know what it's going to be like but you have no idea so they live underground they actually live underground and I know we've seen the pictures but it is incredible mm. they have a church underground mm. a pub underground where I spend a lot of my time <laughs> uh, I'm joking um, and there's, there's this wonderful hotel it's literally underground and they said to me make sure you've got a torch because the minute you shut the door it's pitch black and you're like oh yeah 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 and you I walked in and there's the bed and it's just all like cave walls you know it's like actually just carved oh, into the wow. ground and i was like okay there's my That's bed cool. put my suitcase down shut the door couldn't see my <laughs> Tripped hand over. couldn't see my yeah. hand there yeah. because it's lit there's no light Underground. There's zero light um, so that was uh, amazing and then John Dunstan took us out to some of the Opal claims but the amazing thing is when you fly into Cooper PD it's obviously it's an internal flight but it's a propeller flight it's not a tourist center so it's a tiny I've never been on a plane like that before it's like the planes you see in movies a tiny shack of a plane really yes the, the boarding pass is handwritten okay? <laughs> genuinely amazing. I got my own luggage off the plane <laughs> right? that's the truth I and, love and it. we landed but when you're flying into Cooper PD the most amazing thing is the anthills they call them and this is where yes. they've dug 100 foot pits, 100 foot pits over you know, 100 years. And the mounds, like a molehill, the mounds are just pulled out. So, and as you're flying in, there's like one single road and you're, you're flying in and there's a million of these, a million they say. I mean, it's an estimate, but there's about a million. And they're like mountains. They're, they're, I mean, from the sky, they look like anthills, but when you're down there and I've done lots of, you might have seen me next door where we've got some great footage of me stood literally in front of them and they're, Obviously taller than me. What isn't? We live in taller <laughs> than me, but they're they're huge. They're mountains really? of, of uh, you know just opals, and some of the some of them have got names. And you think about like uh, you know old English countryside, people carve their names into oak trees. You know you think yes, about yes. The, all of these as as you're flying in from the the air, they've written the name in the earth of oh. the, each each one. Like there's there was a really famous one in 2011 called Donna's Rush. They all have their own names. That you know how productive they were. But the, the sad reality is these opals are running out. The best-selling opal in Australia is Ethiopian now. And I know it sounds crazy, but there is no rhyme or reason to opal mining. It's, that's why they call it opal fever. It's like there's no seam you can follow. It's a dried-out ancient seabed, Scaramanga, that's you know, fossilized or opalized over millions of years. And there is no seam. That's why you don't get big, big companies like Gemfields. You, if you could guarantee opal, you'd have everyone because the price of it. But it is just literally potluck. Even when I spoke to John Dunstan, who's very tenacious, he's out there all the time. 
he's the guy that sold just for, for pedigree. He sold the, the most expensive opal in the world. The, yes. the, the Virgin Rainbow, million yes. dollars. Yes. He sold it to the South Australian Museum. His father before him had the most famous find uh, in Andamooka, which is also in our British Crown Jewels. And like, you know, that's how lucky his father was. He's got these black and white pictures in his shop. And um, you can just see this table full of opal and he talks about it really fondly because that's his, his father did oh. that. But it is just look. And he said, I haven't found opal. Um, and he told me for like 15 years when I was there, he hasn't found it, but he still goes out every day. And the, 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 uh, the machine that he's got, the excavator, if, if that's what it is, mm. it's literally half the size of a house. It's massive. Like I'm, I'm smaller than the wheel. It's, mm. ma it's mm. a huge mm. machine. I don't know what it is. And this is what he's got. And he says it costs a thousand dollars a day to run it. Wow. And you think he hasn't found Opal for 10, 15 years. But still, that cost is being acute. That's why Opals are so expensive. They're so expensive to find. Good. And that's not including uh, the maintenance. Now, he said, look, I'll take you to the, the pits and he was showing us all around. He's like, he took us to some really historic ones. We didn't get to see Opal coming out of the ground. Um, there was BBC were very fortunate to go out there just after I went and he did find some opal. It wasn't like a big rush. It was like he found some opal. And if you, if you look at the article, it's probably from 2013, 14, 15, 16, somewhere like that. Um, he just found one that's the size of an egg and he broke it open and it literally says subtitled, this will be $38,000. That's the price of opal now. Like we need to get out of our mind of Ethiopian opals, well, which are more it. abundant yeah. and you know, which is great for us because it makes it more accessible. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But when you're talking about top gem kind of Australian opals, which are from Mint to Be, which the mining towns shut down. Yep. The Guardian just did an article three days ago saying that it's the end. This is the last generation of opal mining. Oh, they've just um, stopped mining in Lightning Ridge and uh, anywhere in New South Wales. Um, Mint to Be's closed. Kuba PD is still active, but. There used to be thousands of miners there. It used to be, like I said, there used to be a church. There used to be a real community. What, and why is that? Is it because they're just not finding? One, it's way too all. expensive now. Yes. Far too expensive. Too expensive to mine in the in the modern era. Yeah. Um, two, it's so isolated. It's so isolated. Um, you know, even I, I make it. Maybe I make it sound romantic. There's a church there and this and that. But yes, yes. There's no Wi-Fi. I know. I know. Hey, <clears> first world problems. But I'm serious. Like they they live in the first world. They're choosing to live this isolated lifestyle when they could go to a city. They could go to a town. They're in the middle, they're in the desert, right? It's freezing cold at night. It's baking hot in the day. I yes. know this sounds trivial, but it's their life. Mm -hmm. You know, I know it's not, they can't separate their life from work because they always have to they're live there. They're living it, yeah. Um, yeah. And so, for instance, I met John's wife. This is crazy. Her name's Yoko, right? John and Yoko. Oh, my gosh. And their store, yes. their store is called John and Yoko, right? <laughs> oh, and oh, she's amazing. It. And she's like, you know... Uh, this woman who's just been taken out into the outback, yes, right? And yes, lives yes. there for years. Whether she years likes it or like, not. Oh, <laughs> yeah. And, and uh, basically, the, he built his own house because, oh. you know, there's, there's, no, there's no builders out there, yes. there's no plumbers, you know, it's just that there's about Dig a dozen people that live there. And he literally dug out his own house. Yeah. And he told me, oh, he took me into his house, it's amazing, literally underground, you just see a chimney poking up. Everywhere, you just see these little chimneys. And he said, I dug this out, and it took him God knows how long, months. And he had the, the foot plan, the blueprint <coughs> of how it was going to be. And then he'd finally finished, you know, torturous, boiling hot, underground, doing this. And his wife said, oh, if I'm going to live in this house, I want a pantry. And he was uh, cursing it. He was like, oh, <laughs> my God. Just and then he dug a pantry. This is years ago. He found a million dollars of opal. No. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That's, that's amazing. The, that, but that's how haphazard it is to find opal. Oh. You just have to be lucky. There he you says that you can ask him questions. You know, no one's going out there because there's no... Oh, I know where the little claims are and things. And he says, you could peg a claim. You, you peg a claim. It's, I can't remember how many meters by how many meters. And you can buy like small, medium and large. And you peg it out and you can find, someone could find, you know, $3 million, $16 million worth of opal. And then obviously everyone starts pegging claims around the outside. Yes, of course they do. But there's no opal. It's, that's how strange it is. It's just, there's no, there is literally no rhyme or reason. Now, it's so expensive that it's sold by the slice. There's no other opal that's sold by the slice. The, you know, Australian opal or Lightning yeah. Ridge opal, you think about the mosaics. Yes. You think about the, the, the incredible kind of um, uh, doublets or triplets. Yes, yes, yes. You know, th this is the, the value of the opal, crystal yes. opal, top colour. We know the red is extremely valuable. And, and we are talking about the, the last generation of opal miners in Kubapedi, which is sad. It is the opal, 95% of the world's opal comes from Australia, and it's about to just be gone. 
And you've got the opportunity right now to get, and I stand by this, the finest opals we've ever acquired as a business in nearly 20 years. This is what Australian opals look like. This is incredible. So this is like a Harlequin opal. Yeah. Um, this is back in 2019. It won a tier for Kuba PD. It, it was a JCK winner. Um, and you can see all the wonderful, incredible colors, you know, this kind of mosaic pattern. This is the, the mining areas in, yeah. uh, in Australia, in the whole of Australia. Mint to be, let me just explain, that's gone. There is no more mint to be. Uh, Andamuka is mined out. You've got Yowa, um, which again is mined out. Kuba PD is the last of the kind of white body color opals. Further north in New South Wales is obviously Lightning Ridge, which is, ex is suffering exactly the same fate. That's what the Guardian was writing about the other day. And this is what they're looking for. They're looking for opals that look like this. They're incredible. Oh. They're, you, can, you can call an Australian opal just by sight. You know it's different to any other opal. Absolutely. This is what they look like, even in the finest grade. Mm -hmm. And oh. this is, this is the, the world's most expensive opal. The Virgin right? Rainbow. Virgin oh Rainbow, yeah, mined and sold by John Dunstan, who I met. It's about the size of your, your little finger. Um, the, the incredible thing is, I know they say it glows in the dark. That's because opals, I didn't know this before, but opals don't like light. Okay, opals don't like light. You know, unless they're super, super fine grade, no one wants to show them. So that is a million dollars the South Australia Museum paid for it and they literally have a special lighting setup for it to showcase the colors of the best of the best, right? And it's in the dark room. Today, these opals in, in daylight or in studio light are gonna perform. That's how incredible they are. When I walked into John's uh, shop, he, had, um, he opened up two matchboxes, like, you know, the big matchboxes, they're about yeah. big, you know, the, the, the long matches, the cooks and matches, I think Cook, they call them. Cooks matches, yeah. Cooks matches. He had two uh, matchboxes, he goes, I'll show you something really special. He had lots of fossils and things. And he goes, I'll show you something really special because we have the camera there. And he got out these two matchboxes and he switched off the lights. Not like there was lamps on and things, but he switched off the main lights. And he goes, I'm going to do that because opals don't like light. And he pushed open uh, the matchboxes and there were just shards of opal, like <sighs> slices, little nuggets, tiny bits. $60,000 each matchbox. 180000 US dollars, not Australian dollars. That's the value of top wow. gem opal. And what we talk about top gem opal is top color. You remember, Carol, you know, when we started years ago, when we were on different channels, but here, you know. Yeah. Um, do you remember when, like, we used to show opals from Australia? Yes. And we used to just be, we used to get excited about if there was a patch of colour. Yes. Do you remember? Like, yes, we used absolutely. to have to shade it. I don't mind telling you this. You guys watched, maybe. We used to have to shade them, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hand yeah, yeah. Or yeah paper. Hand over and we'd go, yeah. look, opals, look, the light's washing it out. And it used to be a nightmare. And we used to say things like, to get play of colour on 30% of the surface of an opal is incredible. That's what we used to say. Mm. Used to, if you just get it on like a portion, how incredible Any is that? Any play of colour. Today, you're going to get the best play of colour you've ever seen. That money can buy, by the way. Mm. And uh, uh, an incredible skill. These are uh, the, the kind of matchboxes I was talking about. $60,000. Yes. Open miners struggling to meet Asian Ooh, demand. Wow. And this is the problem. When I was with John Dunstan, I was trying to do an interview with him. And he said that he's got, he gets people calling him every day yeah. from China. And they're asking to be put on a waiting list just in case he finds Opal. And they're not just asking to be put on it. They say, well, why are you $20,000? Just if you find Opal, can we be the first we people you call? Yeah, yeah. That's it. And he said oh, the main demand is coming from the Asian countries, India and, uh, and China. And China is obviously geologically quite close. And he says, we can't keep up with demand. And as I was talking to him, the phone rang. And it was someone else no. asking to be put on the list. And he says, he's, he's, he's a man of integrity. He said, I'm not taking any money. When I find Opal, you'll know about it, but I'll call you all. You know, that's the reality. Good grief. Um, this is, over the past 18 months, the value for top quality uh, black opals has doubled. Doubled in months. Good grief. With some buyers reported to be paying up to $12,000 per carat. Per carat for an opal, which is you know, a, a light gemstone. India and China are buying heaps of opal. They're just about begging for it, and we can't find it. That is my friend John Dunstan saying that. We know that Lightning Ridge, the, the, uh, the, uh, the industry is in trouble, um, suffering the same fate as Cooper PD. Opal Capital Cuba PD is on knife edge as the desert uh, town faces big water problem. It's very hard to get water out there. And uh, this is the problem. When that happens, they have to leave. They just have to leave. South Australian government formally acknowledges drought for the first time. This yes. is what's happening right now. Oh. Opal costs rise on international market amid mint to bees in certain future. I can now tell you that mint to be is closed. There is no more mining. That was the only other place that produced Cuba PD grade opal. Um, and, and they say that the demand now is more than ever is high in the American market. Prices yeah. have jumped 50% depending on color, quantity, type, and location. Um, this is just the last sentence here. The price increase has brought the price of Mintsby Opal in line with Lightning Ridge Black Opal. Mintsby is, is identical to Cooper PD. It's, it's, a white, it's a white body color. Yeah. 
you can get transparent, you can get top crystal, but they're the two locations to produce these opals. We've just heard from someone who's paying $12,000 a carat for Lightning Ridge, and Mint to Be is in line with that. So people for top Mint to Be, top Kubapedi, top white body color opals, they're paying, can pay $12,000 per carat. Good, great. This is the, what it is, happens at the top end. And this is the Mint to Be town now closed. This is done. So there's only one location that brings these opals. Oh. It's Kubapedi, where yours are from. Those are those uh, ant hills I talked about. Yeah. The largest trees, you know, they're huge, and there's a million of them. Uh, Mint to Be leased to be terminated. This was back in 2019, so now this is the ultimate location. And this is, uh, because of this show, I reached out to um, John Dunstan. And I asked him what's, what's going on with opals, because obviously you want to be plugged into the source. And he said, howdy, David. Yes, opal is very scarce. That's why the prices keep climbing. We are down to about 100 opal miners, and that's why the production is down. Opal is sold before it can be found. That's how in demand opal is. They just, like I said, he gets these phone calls. And even today, 2023, he says there hasn't been a new opal field found since Donna's rush in 2011. My gosh. I hope that puts it into some sharp perspective of why we are bringing you the most limited opal collection ever. These are just one of a kind. And we know the, the, the absolute demand is coming from China. They're buying up everything they can, anything that's found. There hasn't been a significant rush since 2011. But we went to China, where you have the, the world's best carvers. And we've basically married that, that incredible <laughs> relationship. The finest opals from Australia, carved by the most skilled artisans oh in my gosh. the world. Hand-carved, incredible cameos, legacy opals. Yes. The most, I'm sorry, but that's, if that's not the best opal you've ever seen, don't call. Opals, I've never seen opals like that anywhere. I haven't seen them in Australia. I haven't seen them in uh, Tucson. I haven't seen them in JCK. That's about as good as opals get. That's about as good as opals get. There isn't a better opal I've ever seen. Uh, maybe apart from, you know, the, the Virgin Rainbow. That's the reality. And, and do you know what Ollie's just said? And I totally agree with him. In the 14 years that he's, he's, he's been here, that's the best thing he's ever seen. Uh, yeah. And I have to say, and I, Ollie's seen, I, I think you're pretty... Uh, I'm I'll pretty be honest with you guys. Ollie's seen there. more jewellery than me and Carol combined because, you know, he re records everything. Yeah, he views everything across the every show. the best thing. To, and, and, and this is... And, and we, we focus primarily on the material. That's before we even talk about... The well, skill of just carving. just literally mentioned... The carving. Yeah, and we talk about, you know, these people are the, the best carvers in the world. We know that. We've got no, you know, you're going to see some jade carvings the next hour by the same types of people. Yeah, beautiful. But jade is harder than stainless steel. Yes. Opal isn't. This, this is, is so difficult yes. to do. It's almost, you, I mean, the only other place I can think that might attempt this is Edor Oberstein. I was just about to say yeah, Edor Oberstein. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. But you would pay for it in Edor Oberstein. I, I don't even think you'd get an opal that good in Edor. No. But you, you'd get carving probably that good. But that would probably be five figures. That's absolutely. The, I've, I've been figures. to Edor. And, and maybe you think that's ridiculous. I saw an obsidian carved gorilla, right, about this big. Oh. And it was $80,000. That's obsidian. obsidian. But, but yeah. you're paying for the carving. Of course you are. And, and this, it doesn't get better. You can see the feathers in the, in the headdress. I mean, you this would be amazing if it was carved out of soapstone. You're right. It's opal. It's an Australian opal. Yeah, it's the that... best of the best. Now, I am going to say, what is it? Four pieces we have. Well, they're all one-offs, but yes, yeah. four pieces. Yeah. So we just have four opals for you today. Oh, right? my gosh. There isn't, like, unfortunately, guys, we can't say we'll take oh 80 of them. Gosh, 80 of it. those don't exist. 40 of those don't exist. 20 of those don't exist. These are the final four, the famous four. And they're going to be on and gone today. But I just wanted you to understand why this is so significant for you. We may <laughs> never see anything like this again. And you know as well as I do, Carol, red, the most expensive colour. It is red. It's, it's completely red. And, and we've got Neary and I've got Ollie, both kind of very animated in the gallery because they love watching Opal Hunters on, on the TV. Oh, yeah, great. And show. these guys get... And, and that features um, John, John Dunstan, Dunstan, doesn't yeah. it? And, and these guys get stressed when they're cabochon cutting an opal, let alone carving a Native American out of... You know, this yeah, is yeah, just... It is incredible. This is... What is this? At any time, you could just carve the colour out of it. Yeah. You could smash into a million pieces. What has been done here is the unthinkable, is the unimaginable. The, 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 I mean that. I mean, I know it's a cameo, but that is a brooch. Oh, it's I it's mean, phenomenal. Yvonne has, who is an, an outstanding silversmith, has been given a cameo to work with, and just oh, look at wow. what she's created. Yeah, absolutely I mean, this is beautiful. it. Yeah. This is you know, it's a brooch. It's a uh, necklace. It's oh, it's yeah. just it's a piece of art. It's a legacy. It, it, it is a piece of art, and it's, it's it is a legacy. There is just four people 
you can get involved today. Yeah, that is it. This is as good as it gets. Are we going to start with the Native American, the largest piece? Oh, my gosh. I think this might be one of... Uh, one of the most important shows we've ever done, Carol. It's this one. Thank you, uh, Janine. <sighs> I love this and I... We should be in. Uh, we should. We should be in like a gallery. Somewhere. I feel like I, should, I feel like I should be wearing gloves. Yeah, I. I agree, and yeah. I feel like we should be sat down. Uh, you know, over a table talking about something like this. Yes. Not, not on you know national TV or. But it's you know how amazing that we have that opportunity. Oh my gosh. Just prepare to be amazed. Oh my oh word. My word. Have you ever seen? I Anything. Haven't. I haven't. This, okay, could be, this, is... this could be Geronimo, couldn't it? One of the most famous Native Americans to have ever lived. And this um, is a crystal opal, which is the most valuable from Cuba PD. What I mean by that is it's, it's translucent. The colour doesn't just exist on the surface. It's, it's within. Inside. Yeah, and you remember the first opal. Well, the majority of opals we bought many years ago mm. from uh, Cuba PD were yes. just... Opaque white. Oh, with... A, Opaque white with faint colour plate just with on With something the on the top, yeah. maybe. The, the, def the, the profile you are getting there, yeah. the, 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 the face, his nose, his nostrils, his Everything. lips, yeah, I mean, his it, eyes, it, it, eyebrow, the feathers. It feels three-dimensional. You know, even though it's almost... And it is kind of three-dimensional, but it feels like there is something on the other side because it's that alive. Yeah. Okay, this is the largest, isn't it, Neary, ever so slightly? Yes. What's he say? I, um, I wouldn't even be able to begin to put a value on No, I mean, I was, like with, um, <clears throat> I was with Joanna Hardy from the Antiques Roadshow. Oh, wow! Yeah, um, for a whole week. Oh, Amazing lady. Of course. Yeah, she was, she's incredible. <coughs> uh, she worked at Sotheby's for many decades. And, uh, you know, this is something I can imagine her witnessing yeah. on the Antiques Roadshow. Something like this, historically significant, very special, talking about the skill needed to be able to produce some of this, the value of Australian opals. Yes. And she spent a long time, her husband's Australian. She spent a long time in Australia, uh, touring Australia. So we had a lot to talk about. And um, we hope to maybe work with her in the future, but she oh, is incredible. Wonderful. Okay. Should we do a 30 second clock? I d I've, I d nothing's going to prepare us. No, nothing. It's not like can. this 30 just, seconds is even going to prepare us. Like this but we, we have to um, we have to start somewhere. So in 27 seconds this will be available. The interesting thing is, I'm racking my brain to try and think of anything that I can compare this to. And you know, the, the huge, beautiful, one-of-a-kind jade sculptures that you've bought to Air Dave, which are wonderful. Yeah. And I can this go on This is on Sotheby's. that ilk. This is on that calibre. Oh, absolutely. 100%. But, you know, I can see those on Sotheby's websites. You can see pieces which have sold, you know, 50 years ago. So I've never seen... No. And I've seen cameos before. Yeah, yeah, But sure. nothing like this. Never out of uh, uh, Native America. Never out of Australian crystal opal. This no. is... The value is just all <coughs> We are about to bring this live for every single one of you. Please, if this is something you've fallen in love with. There's one. Oh, my gosh. What is that price? Yeah, I mean, that's ridiculous. That's, that's incredible obscene. value. I mean, we, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if we'd started at 15, 20,000. No, I, 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 I am amazed. We're starting at what, just under four. And we're going to be nowhere near that. And you guys know that. There's a, a lot of you on the phone lines. Please make sure oh that this is the one gosh. you want. This is the one you're going to be getting. The actual one. It comes yeah, to you the in only a beautiful one. presentation box. Um, I, 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 Let's I, do a 30 second clock. We'll give oh. you a price that you're not paying. But, but a price that, realistically, the price on your screen, we could all That's I think, take away and think, yeah, amazing value. 29 by 24 mil, huge, elaborate, incredible, detailed carving. For it to be an Ethiopian opal is one thing. For it to be Australian opal is something yeah. uh, remarkable. And for it to have any opalescence... Mm -hmm. I mean, that's, it doesn't, it's, the opalescence doesn't get better. If that was just a cabochon with those uh, beautiful colours. Yes. Of this size, it would be absolutely world class. Yep. Let's start. Let's, in fact, you know what? I'm going to put a price on your screen that will sell this out, and I'm going to tell you I'm not done. 
I'm going to straight down to a thousand pounds. Oh my I am. word! I'm going to take. I'm going to take thousands off. Straight down to a thousand, and I'm nowhere near done. Oh but gosh. I just wanted to let you know oh if you're serious, because there is only one. I wanted to take you closer to where we're going to go. Margot, thank you so much. I completely agree. Words fail me, really. I, I, I... With this, with the quality of this carving, you're not looking at it and squinting and going, oh, what is that? Oh, I don't know what I... It's like a photograph. Yeah. It's, it's like it's been Debbie's lifted. hit the nail on the head. Yeah, she says cutting yeah. an opal is bonkers. They are so soft. The danger is they're going to snap, yes, shatter. Yes, absolutely. Fracture. But this is amazing to see. And this is the world's best carvers working with the world's best opal. It's the marriage of both, you know, pedigree in terms of the, the, the raw material and the skill set needed yeah. to be able to produce this. I'm going to give you a minute. I'm going to give you a minute. I'm going to take hundreds of pounds off the price. Please, I mean, you've got five interest-free split payments. Yes. You're about to acquire <coughs> a legacy piece of jewellery for your heirloom collection. And I wish all of you the very best of luck, but only one of you can own this particular incredible Opal cameo. This really is a legacy. Yeah. This really is something which is collection-defining. Yes. Um, Something which, uh, uh, you know, I, it is like being in a dream looking yeah. at this. It is like something... I didn't know Opal's got this good. No! Yeah, I mean, I did, I did in museums. Absolutely. I did at the, the, the top end, you know, a million dollars or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like on Jewelry Maker, we should never see Opal's oh this good. gosh. And you're about to acquire it. I wish... The best of luck to any single one of you. There is only four Opals that we have available for you. We've got Lancashire, Gloucestershire, Devon, Greater London, Merseyside. Oh, you're there's on the phone loads line. of you there. 10 seconds and you're going to get the most incredible deal. Remember I said hundreds of pounds coming off. Only one available, everybody. One chance of it. We're taking only real confirmations on this. Yeah. Neary, for this one, the largest one, go 699. You knew it was going to be in triple figures. I don't think anyone thought it was going to be oh this low. Gosh. We are providing you with the split payments, oh the interest-free split payments. It, it seems to have sold. We're not 100% sure at the moment. We want to make sure, but that is the largest piece. You know, that, you know the, the wonderful, oh, it's almost like face really? paint, isn't it? The, the wonderful kind of scarlet like colors. Like war paint. Yeah, almost. war paint. Yes. Okay, congratulations. We believe to it has the collector sold in out. Lancashire, we think. Yeah, we think. Um, what do we, where do we go from here? Do where I, can we go? Uh, do you want to do the so other that one? was 29 by 24 mil. I know we have a 30 mil. 30 mil, so it's slightly longer uh, by 19 mil. Yeah, so it's slightly longer. But Again, now. a one of a kind. Sensational. Oh. Good luck. Well done. A, a, a 10 or 12 of you missed out on that last piece? Yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. I mean, this is Look perfection. At the orange. Yeah. Across his eyes. And the transparency, the crystal, the blues, the yes. greens, the reds, the flickering flame colors. This is practically the same size. Yep, yep. Same attention to detail. It's the last of the Native Americans, isn't it, I believe? Yes, it is, yeah, unfortunately. Okay. So if you missed out on the last one, and there was a significant numbers of you that missed out, this one is created in the same vein. Yeah. It is natural Australian opal. More of the reds uh, 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 on this one, as, as you just saw there in the picture. Wow. Absolutely. Wow. I mean, the vibrancy of the colours. Yes. Is, is, is also a value-adding factor. It's not just the colours. They can be dull. These are like neon. Yes, they really are. Super bright. Again, I'm going to take you straight down, actually. No clock here. I'm going to take you straight down to £1,000 because there's so many of you on the phone lines. Yeah. We don't want to mess around. I want <coughs> you to have the confidence to be able to jump in and trust us. We are still not done. We have a huge number of you on the phone lines. If, if this is the one oh. you want, we're going to do something spectacular for you, but you're going to have to be quick. It, it's like... I, I, it, it, it's, it's, it's living, isn't it? It's alive. It is moving. Yeah. It is those colours are the thing We always talk about it, Carol, don't we, with, with opals. It's one of the few gemstones that seems to have a personality. Absolutely. You know, it, it, it behaves differently in different lights. It showcases different things. You can intimately know your own opal. You know, yeah. I've got an opal at home. It's an Indonesian opal, a black opal. And it's got, to my eye... In certain lights, it's got a horse's head oh, in the patterning. Awesome, it, I love it. And, and, you know, I just know the colour play and, and when the light... Is, some people can't even see it. I'm like, it's right there. But, you know, it's like looking at the clouds. You know, when you lie there and you look at the clouds and you might see a dolphin and someone else sees a dog or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When you're creating the shape. Yeah, absolutely. It's your imagination. It's the way we view it. Look at that. 30-second uh, um, clock, Neary. I'm still taking hundreds off. It has sold, we Amazing. believe. Collector in Devon. I'm still going to give you a huge discount because this is why we wanted to bring you these opals. Carvings like this are, are 
so rarely seen. And, you know, whether this was, you know, if this was carved out of Peruvian pink opal, you know, something completely opaque with no opalescence whatsoever, it would be world class. For it to be carved out of not Ethiopian, but Australian crystal opal, Yep. The Australian legacy, you know, coming to an end yeah. <clears throat> is something which... Neary, the same size, well, longer actually, but match the price, 6 dollars Oh, More reds, yeah, word. it is what it is. You guys Enjoy. are seeing this. Just sensational colours. And the way the colours undulate um, over one another shows you it's crystal opal. There's blues over reds here. You can really see how whoever has carved this has really studied the gem. Yeah. To, to get the most out of it, which must be an almost an impossible task. You, you mean, but... Margot just messaged in and said, you know, <coughs> the, the details on the feathers. Yes, absolutely. And you can see his it. His chin, his, yeah. his neckline, his... Oh, look, at it's three-dimensional, yeah, Dave. Yeah, it really is. It's like, as, as I turn it, you can see, it's almost like he's... <clears throat> but I agree with you, Carol. That, that in just soapstone is incredible. Yeah. Look at this. You know, we've seen the oh. most sensational cameos of this kind of depiction in Shell. Yes, yes. And they go for thousands. Yes. This is in Opal. Yeah, yeah. yeah. With the play of colour, which adds a whole oh. new dimension. Half of the show is sold out. That's the reality, isn't it? Oh, that is... Half the show is gone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I want to say massive congratulations yeah. to Lancashire and to Devon, who got the Native American <gasps> uh, cameos that we've just bought to you. You are lucky, lucky. There is lucky. two other beautiful... Incredible. First thing that happened today, Beautiful I name. came into the gallery, which, as you know, is where our producer and our director sits, and they've got the computers and everything. And Ollie, our, our veteran director, said to me, <laughs> ha have, have you seen these cameos? Yeah. And I said, yeah, I've seen them, because I have seen them. He said, no, no, no. Have you have seen, you seen, have you seen the recordings of them? And I said, no, and he showed me. I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> that has to be the best thing you guys have ever seen. Certainly the best thing I've ever seen. Uh, we're all excited. I hope it comes across. And we're about to move into... Uh, a new realm of detail, of, of perfection, of detail. Oh, my God. Oh, the crispness okay, of this. Just here, that one portion there, that's oh. known as Harlequin colour play. Yes, That's the most valuable colour play Look in the opal the world. Face. Yeah, that's pinfire on the face. Yes. So there's different the patterns cheeks. going on. Yeah. So on the cheeks, that's what's known as pinfire. And you can quite clearly see why. And then on her breast, as it moves down, you've got this incredible yeah. harlequin display, yeah. which you may never have seen before. We've all seen it in the, the, the books. Yeah, yeah. That is like a moving Monet. It's absolutely world class. The detail in her hair, you know, the detail in, in the, the whole portrait. You can see the strands of hair. You can see her braids. It's this gorgeous Roman or Grecian. Okay, remember, there is this only one available. Oh, it's I'm going. Stunning to give you a 30 second clock. These are all you know, masterpieces in their own right. In 30 seconds, this will be available. If this is the one you want, I'd recommend getting on the front end early. Wow. Good grief. Yeah. She's there. That is special. It's breathtaking. It really is breathtaking. That's glorious, that is. Oh, wow. This, this came out of, you know, an opal field in Australia many, many, many years ago. Yeah. And has been taken to the Far East, where the masters have hand-carved these incredible depictions. Look Graphics are now live. There's going to be a, a, you know, we talk about the opal rush. There's going to be a rush on the far lines. Absolutely. Absolutely. Because this is awe-inspiring. A more traditional, I would say, um, yeah. depiction of a cameo with yeah. this one here. Um, it is absolutely on point. The, the, the crispness, the mm -hmm. detail. You have to keep reminding yourself, this is stone. This isn't icing. Yeah. This isn't uh, clay. Nope. This is, this is, this is fossilised water. Yeah. This is, this, is an, this is Australian opal. The, the, the original opal, the ultimate yes. opal. Yes, yeah, um, absolutely. Look, to get these moments of intense, incredible, dazzling colours for which this material makes it supremely valuable. Yes. Is really important. Um, 30 second clock, please, Neary. Um, how do we even begin to put a price on this? Yeah. Good luck. I, I think you're right, Dave. I've never seen Harlequin fire like this before. No. This is, um, I've seen, I, I've seen, and that's it, it's difficult to know whether you've seen it in real life or you've seen it in a, in a you know, in colour magazine or something. I, I think I've just seen it in a magazine. I don't think I've ever seen yeah. actual no, proper no, Harlequin. Harlequin, Harlequin colour play. We think that we've seen it because we talk about it all the time. That patchwork. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. 
But that Look is, at that. we know what we're looking for. Yes. We've never seen it. Precisely, yeah, in yeah, person. yeah. You're about to own it. Um, Neary, this the level of detail on this one, you know, I know we saw the feather headdress, but this is that cascading, beautiful locks of hair and that Harlequin portion. We are looking at a premium offering right now. Go down to 1,500 pounds, and I am gonna do something special. I really am, Look just because of the excitement on the phone lines. We're gonna go straight down to 1,500. We should be paying a premium for something like this, but today I'm gonna do something special for anyone. Look at the depth of it as well. I know you say it's sold by the slice, but that yeah. is a decent, that's a decent amount of... Oh, for sure. Right, Neary, 30 seconds incredible. This seems to have already sold. Yeah, it looks I like am gonna take a huge amount off. Hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pounds off this one, even though we're dealing with an absolute masterpiece. Look at that. The absolute pinnacle of gemstone carving. Carving, you, you know, your jades, and we've got beautiful jades coming up next. Carving your beautiful jades, something harder than steel is, is, is one thing, but something so delicate. Okay. Shouldn't do this. I'm probably I'm going to get in trouble for it, but you guys have trusted us. You've come on, got involved. Yeah. We've set a kind of tone. Yeah. They should be priced independently, individually. Thank you so much, Sally. I agree. Just do it. Match the price. Six nine nine. Oh my yeah, yeah, yeah. word! Just match the price on this one. Um, well done to the collector in Nottinghamshire. Goodness me. I'm over the moon for you. Shouldn't be doing that on this piece, but I am going to do it for you. <gasps> Harlequin color play, pinfire color play, two patterns in one incredible. Very awful. rare. Um, and of course, the, the legacy depiction. Let me know what you do with it. Is it going to be a brooch? Is it going to just be stowed away in the, the collector's box? Is it going to be an heirloom piece that you pass down through generations? I hope it is, yeah. Wow. Piece. Oh! I literally couldn't sleep last night thinking about these. It's I amazing. literally was just kind of <gasps> just so excited. Just Anything. To see it, you know? Oh. Just to have the, just to be in the presence of these is, is 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 amazing, isn't it? This lady is she's lovely. She's so pretty. Again, remember this is a one of a kind. Wow. Oh wow. Oh my gosh. Again. <sighs> you know, although Goodness red is me. the most valuable colour, blue <laughs> or violet is the rarest. And this is just all throughout her hair, you've got these blue and violet colours. Violet is rarely ever witnessed in Australian opals. Wow, she's beautiful. Wow. Okay. And you can see that, you know, the master carvers have been inspired by the original kind of Grecian, yeah, or Roman, Roman yeah. cameos. You know, they used, to be, they used to depict gods and goddesses, religious kind of aspects, and were worn as kind of amulets and talismans. And oh, thank you, you Linda. They, they, oh. Let's do a 30-second uh, yes. clock. Let's do a 30-second clock. Oh, I think many of us are just in awe of, of seeing these. How smooth that kind of alabaster-like skin yeah. is. It's just gorgeous. They've really brought this opal to life. They really have. And every time you look at it, you notice something slightly different, don't you? You see, you, see, uh, you know, the It's so the daring necklace. as well to do this, to take a world-class opal yeah. and to, to carve something this detailed, this ornate into it. Absolutely extraordinary. Right. If, if you want to own this, please... Be fast, trust us, we're gonna look after you, we're gonna do something special. Wow. That is beautiful. That is just sublime. Yeah. Okay. Let's do a 30 second clock. 30 second clock for the first wow. crash. I wish you the best of luck. Do you know what? And I'm sitting here and I'm thinking, you know, what are the chances of us ever getting anything like this ever again. I've never in my wildest dreams even imagined or entertained that we'd ever be able to do anything like this. Look at that. Isn't that just astonishing? Absolutely phenomenal. Okay. We're at 3988. Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna just let you know how crazy this one's going to be. I'm going to take it down to 699, and I'm not done. This is going to be the one. I had a message in from someone saying, I could never hope to own one of these. Yes. If this is the, the one for you, we're going to make it happen. It's the final cameo, isn't it? 
Yeah. The final it, piece of our incredible oh. offering. Six nine nine is not your price. We're going to put it there, and then I'll give you thirty seconds to get this. Isn't that just beautiful? What a moment this has been. What a moment. Absolutely. Absolutely incredible. It's a very good question, actually. Ollie's saying, you know, it does make you wonder how much something like this would be elsewhere. I mean, oh, at least five figures, I absolutely. think. Absolutely. Well, usually they would put it into a market and, and let the market decide, you know, put it into an auction. All right, 30 second clock, your final deal's coming in. Um, make sure you're confirming on this. I'm going to take hundreds off. It is going to be the, the most affordable of the show. Nothing, you know, there is nothing, it's still the same material, still that same incredible crystal opal, still the wonderful patterns, the ultra rare violet colors through the locks of hair, incredible hand carved, perfect cameo in the legacy Kuba PD opal. In seven seconds, this is going to be available um, to any one of you that wants it, but there is only one, I must stress that. Neri, I'm going to do the unthinkable, we'll take it to 499. There's been lots of people missing oh, out. Oh, wow. Show. This is our final piece. Oh. We want to give you the most sensational deal. And here it is, 499, I can't believe it. Amazing. And you still get those incredible split payments as well, interest-free. Yeah, there it is, what a deal. Five interest-free split payments, 0% interest. <coughs> and that takes the, what is the split pay on this? Well it's done, under loads, pounds. so many people with this in baskets. It's yours today, well done, four. I don't know who's gonna nine. get it, we do only have one. Um, so I can see about 10 of you trying to check yep. this out. That's yours today. Well done, 499. Lancashire, you know, Northampton, yeah. uh, Maker, Lincolnshire, Kent. Good luck. Just incredible. Well done to everyone who's come through. And I think what we'll do as well is we'll definitely, because um, uh, we've had so many people miss out today as well, we'll keep, mm -hmm. we'll keep an eye on all of those pieces yeah, and let you know. over the next hour or so and just let you know uh, what happens with them. Uh, but 499, incredible opportunity. Well done. There's so many people there. We've got Lancashire, Northamptonshire, another maker, another maker. Uh, Lincolnshire, Kent, another couple of makers as well. Gosh, wow, Good amazing. Luck. 499, well done. Um, Right. Right. Fresh back from uh, my tour of the Far East. Yes. Um, I wanted to talk to you about this spectacular offering that we've got coming up for you. Something like this right now is about as rare as it gets. We're going to be doing Jewelry Maker Incredible Value. You're going to hear from some of the most notable authorities in the Jadeite world. We're going to go to a very small break, but you're not going to want to miss this. I know what we're all tuned in for. I know uh, what we've been seeing all, all week being, being promoted. You're about to own it. I wish you the best of luck. I'll see you on the other side of this. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Hello everyone, it's Mark here. I'm delighted to be inviting you to join myself, Eleanor and the crew this Saturday, 5th of August. Come and join us on our safari. We've got an amazing lineup, including eight o'clock show opener, the most incredible elephant pendant. Nine o'clock, we couldn't be going on safari without Botswana Agate, I've got five incredible kits to show you. I'm not gonna tell you about the deal of the day, that's a bit of a secret, but at 12 o'clock, keeping the safari theme, I've got three kits, including the most incredible tassel toppers. We've got a leopard, we've got a lion, and we've got an elephant. So join us all this Saturday morning, the 5th of August. You heard it here first. <laughs> Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show.
You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Oh, this, this, is... this is it. This is it. We've got the most insane carvings to, to bring to you. I'm, I'm grinning like a, a Cheshire cat. They're gorgeous. Ian, uh, Carol, we're just talking about my time in China, which yes, is amazing. absolutely fascinating. And I got to go with the most incredible group. And I, as I said to you before, it was a gentleman called Mr. Yu who was doing uh, an incredible museum uh, unveiling in Shenzhen. And uh, we got to be part of that. And he invited the Financial Times, who had done stories on him previously. He invited Joanna Hardy of the Antiques Roadshow. Um, he invited um, Andy Lucas, who's formerly of the GIA, one of the most respected gemologists in the world. Gosh. And um, uh, a gentleman called Robbie, who was the head geologist at Gemfield. So he had oh, the, wow. the, the authorities of the world. But he invited just two jewellery houses. Just two jewellery houses. One of them was he, us here at Jewellery Maker uh, in the West. So he chose one, not Asprey, not Musayef, not uh, Tiffany or Cartier. He chose us, which is amazing because he loves what we do, the education element, talking uh, to you guys so you really understand Jim. <clears throat> and then he invited one from the East, which is Ilya. The, uh, Ilya is, their jade offering is literally second to none. Mm. Like, there is no one that carries better jade than Ilya. They were only, look, they were only formed in 2020. Oh, wow. A flagship boutique in central Hong Kong. But they've been in the industry for generations before that, selling business to business. So the most incredible JDS that have ever sold at auction with you know, brand names attached to them came from, from uh, the Chu family. So this is one of the articles that was written in 2020, how Ilya is paving the way for jadeite jewellery oh, to wow. shine. Oh, wow. And this is the gentleman that, his name is Stanley Chu. He's incredible. He was the, the jewellery house Ilya. Um, the founder of uh, the, the jewellery house. And he's determined to change people's mind about Jada through contemporary designs and education. Now, he's the guy you'll have seen quoted by Sotheby's, by the Financial Times, by everybody. Yeah. And he says, look, while my classmates were pl playing with cars, toy cars and Lego, I was played with Jade. His family have been in the industry for over 60 years in the often unseen side of it, which is business to business wholesale. So selling the finest jade to the biggest luxury jewelry brands. And he, he by the way, he speaks better English than me. He's educated in <laughs> America. So he's, he's, he's an amazing guy. It's not like, wow. usually when I speak to people in the industry in jade, it's kind of broken English. Yes. We're, we're trying to, he could, he's, you know, he's English. And we're yeah. chatting, um, incredible guy. And he was saying, look, when I was a kid, me and my sister used to play this game. Like guess the value of the jade. We'd be sat there with like $300,000 jade <gasps> beads or something. And they'd be like, I think it's this, I think it's that. And like he's had that real incredible education. Oh, wow. And he said, look, he's the next generation. His family have been involved for years. And he said, look, I get we're selling to the biggest luxury jewelry brands on earth. Let's create our own boutique. Yeah. We've got an unfettered access to the best jade in the world. And he, he talks about it, inheritance of experience and achievement. He is the creative, creative director and co-founder of Ilya. He was born into Jadeite family or Jadeite royalty. Been trading in Jadeite raw materials and finished products for over 60 years. And their top Jadeite collection is second to none. The family has always been focused on purchasing only the top Jadeite raw materials for decades. And he's the, the authority. He talks about having this price advantage. You know, he's got a one-stop sourcing production and sales model because he sources it. His team carve it yeah. and they bring it to market. This, this bangle, for instance that sold in 2021, as you can see, for 30 million Hong Kong dollars, or 3.8 million US dollars, he sold it. This is a guy that's actually sold the fifth most expensive bangle of all time. <laughs> this is it, the Circle of Happiness. Circle of happiness. Number five wow. in the, the fifth most expensive bangle ever sold. It's sold amazing. for 3.88 million dollars. This is the pedigree we're talking about. That's great. And he, I consider him like a close friend now. Like we, we chat on WhatsApp, he's incredible. And do you know what the most, because oh, I always talk to you about you know, price of jadeites through the roof. And yes. We always, we always say, why are we doing these deals then? I'm going to show you something, because I don't mind doing this. Um, I reached out to Stanley, because I wear, I don't know if you know, I don't wear any jewellery. The only thing I wear is this chain, right? It's just this chain with like a, what, a crucifix or whatever yeah. on it. My parents bought it me for like my, I think it was my 21st birthday. Yeah. So I always Absolutely. wear it, sentimental value. Yeah. Uh, and, you know, it's, it's the only thing I'm never without. I don't wear a watch, I don't really, I collect jewellery. My daughter's collection, I've got a wonderful collection of jewelry, but I don't really wear it. Mm. But I was like, do you know what? I, wanna, I have lots of jade, but I want a piece of jade to wear every day. Yeah, right? okay. And so 
I'm here with Stanley Chu, who has access to the finest jade ever. It's the guy that sold the fifth most expensive bangle of all time. Good and I said to him, I'm after a tiny, tiny slither of jade. Yes. But I want super fine quality. Yes, And I kind nice. of know what I'm looking for, as you guys do, transparency, top color. And so I was like, um, would you be able to help me out? And this is a friend, this is not wholesale, this is not trade, this is not business. He doesn't think I'm selling it on. He's like, I'll go, I'll go back, when I because we were traveling China together. He goes, when I get back in the office, I think I've got just the thing for you. I was like, amazing. And so he reached out to me um, and he showed me this. And I'm going to show it to you. It's 56 points, half a carat, Taipei Jada. Yeah. See? This is it. Just on the finger. Oh, okay. Right, stunning, beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay, and he was like, this 56 is, points. Yeah, 56 I points. Wouldn't, I wouldn't know what to value that at. Go on. Four grand. There it is. Uh, look, I've got a problem showing you this. Like, I'm not, it should be that. You know, 40,000 Hong Kong dollars, which is about 4,000 pounds. Hi, David, this is Cabochon. Four, 56 points. This is the reality of Jade. And that's like a friend. That's a friend. Like, so when I'm telling you that Jade is, is, has risen thousands and thousands in the market, I want you to know that that's, that's the reality. That's what's happening. And we're about to offer you some of the Gosh. finest Jade that you can get your hands on. No, we'll go through it. Look, we know there's huge demand right now in the West. Here's uh, a selection of, I was with a financial times uh, journalist. Yes. She actually wants to come and do a story on us. I think I mentioned that before. Oh, wow. She, she was there at the Asprey unveiling in January. Yes. And she, was, she understands Jadeye. And she was there on this trip. And she was like, hold on, you, you, you sell Jadeye. And I was like, yeah, we, we offer Jadeye to our collectors. And um, she couldn't believe the deals we do, obviously. Yes, of course. But she was like, Jade is the most expensive gem in the world. I've seen the 18 million. I was like, trust me, we do it. And she was like, well, it can't be natural. And Stanley was with me, Stanley Chu, and he was like, no, it's natural, because I showed him all the certs. He's like, no, you're selling natural. And she's like, I need to come and do a story with you. The Financial Times want to come here to do a story on what we're wow. doing. Wow. That's how incredible. Cool is that? But here's a selection of their articles over the last 12 to 18 months. Yeah, amazing. Uh, which you can see. Uh, Jade Gemstone starts to win admirers with their complex beauty. Chinese investors ditch property for Jade in search for high returns. The power of Jade. I know we've gone through these time and time again. Yeah, that's okay. This is the Aaliyah booty that Stanley In Hong Kong. Yeah. Yeah. Millions of dollars oh. of Jade. Oh. Just sensational, incredible that's Jade. Beautiful piece. And, you know, you go in, you sit at that table, and you talk about the Jade. And then, obviously, it can be millions of dollars. But I was talking to him about, you know, why Jade has exploded. Why is it so valuable? And um, he said, look, there's three factors. And I'm going to read them to you. This is the guy that knows more about Jade than anyone I've ever met. Mm. Stanley Chu. Family have been involved in the best Jade in the world. Auction record breakers. And he says, he's got this article where he says, why high quality Jade keeps increasing in value. And he said, um, it's risen five to ten times in so, so long. And he says, and quality Jade I has constantly been rising since World War II for three reasons. By the way, Stanley Chu offered me a 56-point jade for £4,000. Says jade's still severely undervalued. He thinks we're nowhere near where it's going to be. So here, here's the reasons why it's, <laughs> it's, it's growing so fast. So he says, in Myanmar, the supply of top jade grade rough has been depleting in recent years. In order to protect the environment and also protect the rough jade resources, the Ministry of Natural Resource and Environmental Conservation has announced that from summer 2020 on, mining will be suspended until further notice. And that's still Gosh. the case today. If the current mining rate maintains, the already finite resource will be completely depleted within 10 years, just like Kashmir Sapphire in India. Because of this, the appreciation in value for high quality jade has been growing constantly and the growth will continue. There's an increased demand. He says, starting from half a century ago, Chinese people around the world have been gradually accumulating wealth, which has led to a huge increase in demand for jadeite. Due yep. to low supply and high demand, the price for jadeite has risen exponentially in the yep. past decades. Jewelry experts predict that jadeite will enter the global market in the next 10 years, just like our ruby, sapphire, and emerald impacted the jewelry world. And I was with Johanna Hardy, who worked at Sotheby's for a long time. And in the 90s, she said, look, 1995, 1997, so these didn't even want yeah, rubies, emeralds, sapphires, unless they were from like a Elizabeth Taylor collection. Yes, yes, yes. They just wanted diamonds. They didn't yes. really understand the coloured gemstone world, Isn't right? That interesting. And we've just seen the Estrella de Fura ruby from Mozambique break the world record in the auctions in the West, over thirty million dollars for a ruby. It has turned the industry on its head. If you go to the auction um, uh, results, the diamonds are the ones that are left unsold. Mm -hmm. The rubies, the sapphires, the Colombian emeralds. Flying out. And this has happened really in the last 10 years, yeah. 20 years maybe. 
Jada, although it's still you know, supremely valuable because of the 1.2 billion people that absolutely can't get enough of it in the, in the East, the West is waking up to it. And soon it will be right up there with the rubies, the emeralds and sapphires. And we'll just continue like this. And this is what he says. When more and more con uh, connoisseurs all over the world begin to collect jade, as we know they are, the demand will increase. Thirdly, cultural heritage. He says, compared with other gemstones, jade is not only rare in its own way, it's also believed to contain auspicious meanings, and we know in the Far East that means a lot, you know, keep away evil, uh, prosperity, good health, good wealth. Coupled with the theme rich in Chinese culture, the implications are expressed in the form of carving. He says carvings are the, the one. And he says, um, turning it into the world's only gem-level art piece. Mm. And he says, it's the perfect combination of nature, culture, art and craftsmanship. There's no other gem that does that. Yeah. And that's why, after hearing this from Stanley Chu, who, like I said, is the ultimate, I wanted to put together this carving showcase for you. Because that's what he says. So look, there's strands, there's bangles, but he says the carvings are what separate this from anything else. The carving of jadeite is what turns it into that singular, incredible gem. Those are the three factors that are driving the price of this. Why half a carat is £4,000 to a friend. Um, and he says, look, appreciating the beauty of jadeite um, is something people can, cannot learn easily. It's something I believe that's instilled or passed on from a parent to a child in his case or from an experienced craftsman to his apprentice. <clears throat> I love jadeite and it's in my blood. Mm -hmm. right? And this was him quoted in Prestige uh, magazine um, in Hong Kong. And it's true. You, know, you guys have an understanding of jadeite that no one else has. I was with Andy Lucas, who's genuinely one of the most respected and published gemologists in the world, with the GIA for 20 plus years, maybe 30. Now um, is with the Guild Laboratories, a new laboratory uh, in China. And he was like, I don't get jade. This is one of the, the world's authorities on all gemstones. I was with the leading geologist at Gemfields, the K-Gem mine, the Kariba mine, the Montepuez mine, you know, billion dollar uh, uh, mines. And he was like, we, we don't understand jade the way that they do in the forest. It is something you can't learn in a book. But you guys haven't learned it in a book. You've had the, the, the industry expertise that I've brought to you as, as like a vehicle for talking from these people. And you've handled jade. You've looked at jade. We've studied it with torches. We've looked at it. We understand it. <coughs> this is me and, and Stanley Chu. We were at one of the mines. Incredible gentleman. It's like Top Gun. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> they let me keep that top. I love it. Um, but he's, he's you know, and a wealth of knowledge. I spent six hours on a bullet train with him. All we talked about was Jay. I bet, I was yeah. just making notes all the time. His camera roll on his phone is just full of, like, millions of dollars a oh, day. I bet. He's just showing me, this has oh, just come wonderful. in. We just sold this to Switzerland. We got this. And I was just like, oh, oh. God. Stuff that you could never know about. Uh, and this is the gentleman that I was with. But I wanted you to understand... Um, the, the, the kind of, you know, the, the, the quotes that I want to bring you verbatim from Stanley. He says, look, we specialize in fine quality jade, bangles, necklaces, and carvings. That's what he offers to his collectors. And he says, the hand-carved pieces are very little in the market now, and we're one of the very few to still have inventory. Buddhas, guanyin, and flowers are the most in demand because of their auspicious meanings and detail needed to carve. And this is his offering. Yeah, this is wow. incredible material. The office, all of those are price and application. All of those are going to be, I don't know, six figures minimum. Oh and he says, God. the material with good crystal, transparency, is some of the most valuable in the market because big carat weight hand-carved pieces are rising faster than anything in terms of price. And we've got big carat weights, top crystal, type A, natural certified oh, jade wow. hand-carved for our collectors today. You cannot buy this anymore. You cannot get this anymore. It does not exist for like mere mortals like us. We, we shouldn't be able to afford it. This is part of deals that were done months, in some cases years ago, that we're about to bring to you. And I, was, I, I wanted to just be completely plugged in. When I was in uh, China, I looked at, I went and saw some jadeite. I wanted to buy some jadeite. This piece here. Oh, wow, that's stunning. This is wholesale price. That's beautiful. Top crystal jade flower. There's only one available. Yeah. This particular carving. Hand carved Taipei, two grand. And like, they sell that somewhere else. It's going to be eight, ten. Yeah. And then I found an actual parcel of Olmec material. When I say parcel, I mean 12. And this is them. Hand carved oh. jade flower, Guatemala. There's only 12 available. Taipei, natural. And if we wanted to take all of them, it's $1,500 each. Each? And that's only if we took all of them. If we only took one, the price soars. Yeah. 
And this is the reality for any deals that we're going to be looking at in the future. And we've got a Guatemalan jadeite flower today, hand carved. We have more than 12 available. And we're not going to be this is amazing. 1,500. But I just want you to understand, it's now or never. Because those are the deals that exist now. I've just come back from China. Those are the deals that exist now. And we have, we have to put a mark upon that. We have to, otherwise, what's the point of us bringing it? So maybe we sell them to you for 1,700, 1,600. That's the reality. You know, I'm about to showcase an Olmec jadeite hand-carved flower, giant carrot way, and with sensational color. Um, Ollie, do you want to show everyone what we've got available? Take a look at this. Yeah. We talk about the detail here. My talk about the incredible hand-carved detail that we're me. talking about. That is... The quality mm -hmm. you are oh getting. My oh, God. my gosh. I don't, I, I look, all I'm going to say is, I will give you 30 seconds before I bring this live. But if you don't multi-buy, you won't get the chance again. I've this, only got, I've got less than 50, just so everyone knows, Carol. This is so lifelike. It is absolutely... It's like a photograph. It, 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 it's, it's so lifelike. Mm -hmm. It's not a depiction or an impression or a representation of, it is, it is. I've got 48 available just to manage it. Wow. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. This is so lifelike. 50 carats. Can I pop a, can, can I pop a light behind it? Please do. It, it, honestly, it is absolutely incredible. Yeah. Top just gem. look at that. Top gem. And I, like, I, I love the fact that I've just come back from the markets in, in the Far East. Guangzhou, uh, Donhao, Shenzhen, Hong Kong. And I got to see those. There's a parcel of 12. And I was like, Good yes, that's reef. what we want. That's what we're after. Okay, look well, if you, if you want to buy all 12 of those, it's $1,500 a piece. But only if you take all 12. You take, if you want to take one, you want to just take one of those. And you can see they're all hand-carved. You look at those 12, they yeah, differ ever so slightly, yeah. but you've got the most skilled, incredible artisans. So I'm going to save you thousands today. But I'm going to say, look, at any price, this is a piece of art. It you know, really when you've got the, the, single biggest, the single biggest authority on Jade, Stanley wow. and the Chu family saying, it's so severely undervalued. And he's offering me 56 points for 4,000 pounds. Yeah. And you've got 50 carats here. Look at that. It's got a drill hole at the top. Um, it is, it is, yeah, the, the stamen in the center mm -hmm. is so, is so it's, detailed. It's, it's, it's like a still life, isn't it? It's like, Absolutely. you know, the unfurling of those petals that we're looking at. I'm, I'm sorry, but just look behind Carol. Just look at that on that screen. You, you, that, that's natural. Taipei, Financial Times couldn't believe it. What we, Jane, you've just got four of these. Oh my gosh, well done, Jane. 50 carats. Good grief, that's incredible. You know, I wish, I wish the Financial Times are here right now. So, so do to I. To see this auction. To see this. Because we may never get to do an auction like this again. We may just have to show them a recording of it, that it happened, and they can write about it. But I wish they could see it. I wish they were here live to be like, these guys are selling 50 carats hand-carved. She was there with me. She saw the value of Jane in how much, China. And how much each again if you bought them all? If I bought all 12, $1,500. Oh. A piece, oh. not, not the total price. $1,500 each times 12, if we take all of them. Look at that. So that'll be 18 pounds. Neary, Neary, straight down to 1,500 quid, right? Oh, it. there it makes sense, goes. doesn't it? Makes sense, let's go straight down there. Nowhere near them. Nowhere After near them. After stock's gone. Yeah, well done, by the way, congratulations. Oh, that's Look. the shot. Look at that's that! The shot. That's a floating lotus flower, right? It's like isn't I'm it? holding a floating lotus flower. You're absolutely right. My gosh. Four-way split pay. Absolutely. Can, sorry, Carol. Can, I love that shot. Can we just put it on that for a sec? Yeah, just, of course. Just seeing it, just sitting upright like that. I don't know if it'll look good, but I just want you to see that. Just as it's unfolding. I wish we had like a, a light, like an LED panel. Yes, you yes. Just put it on. Yes. Oh, my word. Yeah, look at this. Phenomenal.
phenomenal. Oh, I wonder if I put it on my phone. Yes, Honestly, yes, this is, yes. yeah, that might work. Ooh. I don't know, it's not strong. Mm. It's okay. I can see the light penetrating. Yeah, so can I. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, I was just about to ask for that, Ollie. You're a hero. Look at that. It's absolutely That's amazing. That's the unthinkable. That's just a phone light, by the way. Um, I did bring in the other day, I think I misplaced it. I must, might have left it in my car, but I was gifted uh, by, by the team an actual jade torch. The oh! Real special. It's like, they, they cost a lot of money, but they save you a lot of money. Like, if you can judge jade with it, it's worth its weight in gold. So, so, or so is it so very it's, bright? Or? Yeah, it's, 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 if you've seen it, it's, it's the size of, I don't know, a cigarette mm. packet, which is a terrible uh, description to use, but it's like that, and it's got a, a, a lens on it. And it is, yeah, it's super, super, I mean, you can feel the heat on it. Oh, really? Yeah, and that's what they use. You're using a phone light, which we know isn't great. It's, isn't going to be great, weak, yeah. And it still penetrates all the way through. 30 second clock on this one. We're about, I'm, uh, by the way, just for those of you that are on the phone lines, you've got four split pairs. I'm taking more than a grand off this. I'm taking more than a thousand pounds off. Wayne, Wayne, Wayne Del Paso. Oh, yeah. He's in there saying, yeah, it should be the price. Close it. 17 seconds and we'll close it. Absolutely phenomenal. Look at that. This is a sculpture, yeah, a piece of art. Incredible. Take a thousand pounds off, please, Neri. And I'm not done. Hundreds still to come off. But just want you to know how crazy. Oh! Said I'd save you thousands. Jane, I've saved you thousands. Jeanette, I've saved you thousands. Nottinghamshire, I've saved you thousands. It is. Yeah, it is absolutely awe-inspiring, isn't it? Yeah. I mean, the deepest saturation of colour we've ever seen. In an yeah, Olmec. deepest saturation of Olmec I think we've ever had. We, we, is, yeah, when you get it in the daylight, it's, that's, it's borderline imperial green. Yes, like yes, it shot is. behind you, Carol, yeah. in the studio. Super, super bright. Ooh, goodness Four me. interest free split payments. I'm taking hundreds off this. Well done. Maker in Nottinghamshire has got three. Jeanette's got two. Worcestershire, you've got four. We had 48. We don't have 48 anymore. Yeah. 30 second clock, Neary. We're about to give everyone the deal of the year. Having got up to date market information straight back. Exactly, yes. You're about to see what a replacement cost on this would be. So many multi bidders coming through to get this. And Carl. This is just amazing. Top gem. It would be great if it was just ornamental grade, if it was opaque. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. Uh, this colour, but opaque. Wow. Absolutely. But what did Stanley Chu said? He said, can I go back to his quote, if that's okay? He's got his incredible carvings on his website. But he says, this material with good crystal, transparency, which you've seen on the phone line, yep. is some of the most valuable in the market because big carat weight hand carved pieces are rising faster than anything in terms of price. There you go. And if you just bring yours in on, on top of those, uh, uh, Ollie, you, know, you look at that selection that he's got, those eight impressive pieces, all on just cord. Yes. All of them are going to be six figures. And then you look at our incredible carving. Oh! That wouldn't look at a place on that website. It'd be price and application. Ready? Hundreds of pounds coming off. I'll give you your clock. I'll give you the deal. Yours right now. We're already £124.97. On, yeah, on split pay. He's weighing in there still. He, he is. He is. Wayne, you know the replacement cost. Me and Wayne have had a lot of sit downs since I got back from China. He wants to know, as the head buyer here, is like, well, what's available? What can we do? This makes no sense. But when we get a great deal, you get a great deal. The great deals don't exist anymore. They don't exist. Oh, but yours today for 299. 299. Leslie, you've got two. Devon, you've got wow. three. Wow. Nottinghamshire, you've got three. Jeanette's got two. Uh, Jane's got four. Two yeah. nine nine on four individual split payments today, interest free. Seventy four pounds. Seventy four seventy five. Are you having a laugh? Honestly, you know, imagine if I'd have said to Stanley Chu that 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 fifty six point gem. Yeah. Forty thousand Hong Kong dollars. Hey mate, can Run. I just give you seventy four yeah. pounds a month, but you send it now? <laughs> uh, God knows how long would I be paying that off for? Exactly. Yeah. Years probably. That is absolutely astonishing. Can't quite believe that. Well done. 299. Jenny's just come through. Leslie in the West Midlands has just bought two. Maker in Devon looks like they've just bought two as well. We've got six. points. This is 50 carats. How many exactly. times bigger is that? 
Over 10 100, times 100 bigger. 100 times bigger? Yeah. 56 points. Uh, sorry, uh, 10 carats? times bigger. No, that would make it 5.6 carats. Oh, gosh, yeah, 100, 100 times. times bigger. Ooh. This is unbelievable. And I bet if we weighed this, this is going to be more oh, than that. Oh, we know uh, it. We know More we, than 50 carats. We're ridiculous. We but, are I mean, ridiculous. Look how specific he was. 56 points. We're like, this is about 50 carats. Might be yeah. 70. We don't know. Might be yeah, 70. That's exactly. Re, like, that's 0. 0.6. That's so if you don't probably massively. We totally outdo ourselves. Let's take a look at that recording again in the daylight recording, which is so, so <laughs> incredibly saturated. Yes, yeah, 71, oh, 71 carats. What are we doing? I know, 50 carats. It's 71. Around 50 carats, guys. What are we weighing these by 71.3 Have we got someone carats. in goods in, just quality control, just going, uh. about 50 carats? <laughs> Give or take. Give or take what, 20 carats? Give or take 20 carats. This is insane. Yeah, this guy was like 56 I mean, points. Yeah, 56 points. Give or take 20 carats. <laughs> yeah, imagine <laughs> if I'd have paid four grand and a 20. I wouldn't mind if a 20 carat gem took Oh, no. Out. Let 30 second clock to close this out. We've only got well three left. Done. Good luck. Well done. Congratulations. Supreme. 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 Look at it behind Carol. It's, in, it's insane. That's it real. Really it's is. happening. It's happening. 25 seconds. It's happening. If, we're probably going to beat the clock, but good luck. So smooth. So beautiful. Olmec material. Baskets are, we got 40 in baskets for the last three. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. 40. We have baskets. got to get a handle on this though, guys. This, this carrot weight issue, because it's mental. I know carrot weight. What do you mean? It's, it's, not all right. it's not all right, Wayne. Hey? It's fine, he says. He says it's fine, the customers are winning. Yeah, we're losing the well, weight. We're like massively doing ourselves out of this. But this is a classic case of us saying, you know, the carrot weight just. Yeah, when we matter. say we underpromise and overdeliver, that's a joke. That's a joke. That's like going into a car dealership, paying for like a, a people carrier and then them turn up with a Ferrari and going, <laughs> give or take, mate, it's got four wheels on it, there you go. Give or take 200 grand, okay. yeah, exactly. What did you pay for? Uh, four wheels and a wheel. Yeah, wheel. We've, got, we've, got, we've got a Ferrari. Got a roof. Uh, yep. Yeah, you got a steering wheel. Engine. Good, yeah, no problem. What are we doing? Off you go. Well done, honestly, congratulations. I'm absolutely thrilled and over the moon for everyone. <coughs> well done. managed to, to acquire that legacy. Legacy 50 or 70 carat right. Olmec Jadeite hand car where do we Where do we go? Where do we go? This is a whole show. <sighs> Next one? Yeah. I hope you're ready. This is a beauty. Oh, oh. my gosh, we're doing that no, one. No, we're not. We're not. That's insane. This Let is like see. a city. Where is it? Here. La, 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 la. Right. You know, we do kind of landscapes and it's like a temple and a waterfall. This is like a village. Oh my word. This is like a village. Temples. And just to show you this, you probably have to dim the lights. Cherry blossom trees, pagodas, mountains. If you just dim the lights, you've obviously, my phone light's not great, but you can see this light just perfectly. Oh yeah, well that's exactly, oh that's amazing Dave. To get that's this incredible. on this depth. Yeah. That's this incredible that is, material. Cheers, uh, Ollie. Thank you. That's what you see when you show us the um, yeah. the jade lights in, kind of in action. If I wish I had my jade torch with me now, but... Where have you is, left it then? I don't know. It's probably, I hope, I hope please it's, don't tell me it's, oh, in, oh. it's in your car on, that, on the road. So this is an incredible landscape. Oh, this is beautiful. Superior depth. So much detail. You're really, really crammed into this piece. Bicolor Olmec Jade Eye, a figure on the bridge in the foreground, the yeah. mountains, the temples, the foliage, everything. How many of these? 50. Okay. I mean, we should, we, this should be. This is amazing. This should be for sale with everything we know right now, coming back from the Far East. Look, you've got your coins at the bottom as yeah, well, your lucky coins. I've counted four. 70 carats. Temples. Is it though? <laughs> Is it? Four temples. Look at the look at the trunk of the tree as yeah. well. It, of the, the trees. Branches. It's so knotted and twisted. It is a journey. There's your figure on the um Well done, first one in. Congratulations. Bridge. One of the most important pieces we're gonna offer. Yeah, the other colours you're getting in here are really, really beautiful on the um on the recording there, that's absolutely yeah, So we are at a much bigger count weight. We should be far higher in oh. price. Go on. This is a lot bigger. 
This is 165 carats. You are joking. No, I've meant right. to Can we just go to a quick I've got break? The wrong one. Can we just go to a quick break? Genuinely. 20 second, 30 second break. This is like nearly, this is closer to 200 carats than 70 carats. We're going to go to a quick break. We're going to come back. Uh, we'll just talk about it. Um, good luck. See you on the side of this. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. <laughs> Well, this is all slightly uncomfortable. Um, we've got, we had to come back, obviously. We don't want to leave you hanging. Um, <laughs> oh, I'm not a body language expert, but that is, there's a lot of pointing going on. There's a lot of head scratching going on. Okay, well, I. Oh, here he is. Uh, sorry, That's okay, don't worry. <clears throat> um, Go on, talk I'm to just going to say to you right now, and, and you, you, I don't know if you could hear what I was talking about in there. No, not really. It was all very hush. I'm going to say to any single one of you right now, you multi buy. If you trust me, I'm serious, we've just weighed it. We weighed another one as well, which came in at 147 carats. These are, this one's 165 carats. Yep. It's listed as 70 carats. That's not even the most insane thing. I went uh, in Guangzhou, there's a place called Jade Town, which is literally a whole town of jade art vendors that have been in the industry for hundreds of years. And I saw carvings <coughs> like this. They I mean, this we sell as a pendant or whatever. These are on plinths. They, they, these are usually sold on plinths and they command incredible, incredible money. Now we're not gonna be able to bring material like this going forward. No chance. Yeah. Uh, yeah, there you go, Nira. You've just found this one. This is what they're sold on plinths, right? Oh, wow. So this is, this is white jade. Oh, uh, white nephrite jade. Oh, 31, 31,000 pounds. And I'm about to offer you over 100 carats, closer to 200 carats, of Olmec jade, jadeite, carved to unbelievable detail. And I don't, I, look. We can put the pound signs there and that. I'll tell you what we should be doing on this. Like jewelry maker price, crazy deal. Two and a half grand. Two and a half thousand pounds. We should probably have one of these available. And I'd like to just put that price on the screen because that's where we should be at. Uh, there's no, you saw a flower, a flower, a 50 carat flower in the current kind of market is about $2,000 wholesale. This is, this is three beyond three anything like that. Weight. Same gem, old yeah. jadeite. Yeah. A landscape, though. Yes. And over 100 carats larger. Precisely. We should be in the thousands. And we're going to let this go. I don't know. I genuinely don't know if this is... We've just looked. I don't know if this is a computer error, an input error, or we just got well, the I've best got the deal we've ever here. had. It's 100... No, I, mean, I, mean the, I mean the price we're going to do. Yeah. The price we're going to do. I don't know. The fact that we can do Oh, like this. the details a bit. Yeah, yeah. I don't know oh, if, if... I don't know if we actually can do this. The computer says we can. I don't know if that's a human error. So it's, I'm so serious. We should never, ever, ever look to be doing 170 carats, 160 carats 
but carry weight's immaterial. It is. That level of detail, yeah. that saturation of color, that translucency, that crystal, that incredible uh, depth and detail and everything. We're going to let this go outside of four figures today. And, and look, Goodness I don't know how thing. many do we have? I forgot, lost my train of thought. 50 or something. Well, we had 50. If you have the budget, oh, multi buy. It's all I'm going to say. It's all I'm going to say. Over 20 in baskets. Because this makes no sense. And I know we always say we do it because we can. You I don't know if we can do this. We're going to honor it, but I don't know if we can. So I'm just going to say to you right now, uh, 30 second clock, please, Neri. We have 50. We don't have 50 right now, but you are, what you're looking at is you're, you're about to achieve something that I don't know we should ever be doing like this. Look at this. It's probably a genuine mistake. Yeah, I mean, this could be, you know, priced totally incorrectly. Yeah. Oh, my word. Um, yeah, there you go. I said about two and a half grand, didn't I? Yeah. There you go. Oh, is that on first dibs? Okay. About two and a half thousand pounds. Yeah, perfect. Oh, well done. Bang on. Yours has way more detail than that. Go on. Take this to 799 and I'm going to take hundreds off that still. And I shouldn't, but I will. I did say multiply That's if you crazy. can. That's bonkers. Can, um, Ollie, would you be able to put this next to that one? And I don't mind, Neri, if you want to just show the picture. I don't care about the price of that one. We know it's two and a half grand, but if we just zoom in on it or whatever and put it next to this, because I want you to Get see the, the detail. detail. The detail that you are picking up here, that you are getting. Because that's what, because... Perfect. We've spoken about this before, Dave, haven't we? When people buy a Monet or a Van Gogh, yeah. they're not buying the canvas. How much does the canvas cost? No. What is the size of the canvas? It's the artistry. Yeah. And that's, you know, really a, a, a valid point, especially with things like this, which are pieces of art. The carat weight is, it should be irrelevant. I mean, the, the fact that we have got 165 carats yeah. here, we're actually going to be giving you, you know, we're giving you a price. This is all met blue pounds. as well. It's crazy. All met um, blue jade eye. And the level of carving you are getting on ours is remarkable compared to what you're getting on the right-hand side for two and a half grand. There's so much detail. There's okay. so much story. I'll give you a 30-second clock. I did say I'm taking hundreds off and I will but you're going to have to be so, so... So quick. Because so this is what... Sh there. This should never happen. This isn't just exciting. This is you either get it or you miss out. It's huge. It's, it's incredibly detailed. It's translucent. It's that wonderful bicolour natural jade out from Guatemala. And we are at 799, which is already bonkers, already way too low. Yeah. Yeah. Well over crazy? half the quantity's gone, Dave. Yeah. Here we go. Best of luck. Take 500 pounds off 299. Oh my gosh, go. I'm going to do Woo! it. It says we can. We're going to do it. I'm not going to question it. We're going to make it happen, but I want you to know how crazy that deal feels to me right now. That is amazing. Um, from 799 to 299. I know it's bigger than the last one, Neri. I know. Yeah, we know. We all know. It doesn't make sense. It's crazy. Brilliant. Well done. That is absolutely phenomenal. That Just so you know, incredible. we weighed this. It says 70 carats on your screen. What did it come in at? 165, this one. 165 carats. Yeah, that is, that is just our gift to you. That's our gift to you. Yeah, absolutely. Look, here we go. I'll, I'll, I'll show you the carat weight. So my scales are in grams, ounces, TL. I don't know what that means. Uh, and uh, CT, which is carat. So if I pop it on the scales, 165 point something carats. Wow. Yeah. Crazy, hey? Ridiculous. Almost three times the amount. <clears throat> yeah, that is, yeah, that's incredible. 100 carats more. Yeah. Yeah. Lunacy. It is. Caroline. It is, it is Caroline. <laughs> Alison, you've got two. Jane, you've got two. Debbie, Leslie, Alison, Dorothy, Maker in Kent, Maker in Nottingham, Linda, you're there. Eric, Jeannie, uh, Irika, Sharon. Uh, we've got collectors in Essex, County Durham, Keith, Jenny in Bristol, Maker in Greater London, Merseyside. £74.75 money interest-free split payments should well never entertain that deal.
You've got your 30-day money-back guarantee, but honestly, you're going to be getting this home and, and, and thanking your lucky stars. You know, if you go into somewhere like uh, First Dibs yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and you look at, you know, the really lovely, really beautiful premium pieces which are for sale on there, mm. um, uh, yeah, this is this is a far cry price point-wise. It is absolutely incredible. All verified as type A, complete... There's a minute to close this one. I don't know how many we have available. We only had 50 to start with. I can see the phone lines. Huge minute clock to close this one out. We've gone far too long. Yeah, absolutely. Well done. Uh, you've literally got 50 odd seconds of it taking the details away. Well done, Eric, just jumping in there. Well done to you, my lovely. Uh, more people with it in their baskets. Please check out the intricacy you are getting here, the quality you are getting here. The kind of, as um, Ollie pointed out, actually, when you look at it that way around, it's almost like a step formation. It almost gets thicker as you go to the bottom of the carving, as in height-wise, not just kind of as in that trapezoid shape, but as in the kind of height-wise, the thickness of the physical carving. Absolutely amazing. Very much like the willow pattern kind of story, yeah. storyboard, storyline, if you like. Mm -hmm. Just incredible. Um, 20 seconds, guys. Make sure you're checking this out. You've got your interest-free split payment. So, you know, I think definitely make use of those. Um, in around 10 seconds time, this will be gone. Well done yeah. to everyone strolling along the bottom of the screen. Well done. Absolutely fantastic. Gorgeous. Okay, right. Tina, check out my lovely... Maker in Surrey, Maker in Hackney and Gloucestershire, check well out. Done, well done, move this on. Well done. Way Gorgeous. too low. Okay, so. The final Olmec, right? Yeah. You want to talk about detail? Oh. You've not seen detail like this. This is, oh, it's double sided. Yeah, double sided carving. Incredible levels of detail gone into this masterpiece. Oh, it's a He's dragon the, in the middle. Yeah, the, the incredible dragon in the center. Look at all the swirls around the outside, double-sided oh. carving, extremely important, very translucent. How many of these, Neary? 50. Wow. 50. Oh, yes, look. Oh, isn't he gorgeous? Oh, this material is absolutely gorgeous. That top crystallization you talk about, Dave. That wet look finish. Yes. The, the incredible levels of, of transparency or translucency here. Um, minute crystals, you know, coming together to create this fine, fine jade. It's the only way you can get all that incredible cutout done. And the dragon in the center of a circle of heaven. Oh, gorgeous. I love the symmetry of this piece. Mm -hmm. Well, kind of near symmetry. Isn't that gorgeous? Swirls wow. of kind even of more impressive here, in the, almost kind of serpent-like yeah. shapes on the outside. Isn't that gorgeous? Yeah. Right, thirty-second clock to graphics on this piece. Only fifty of these available. Um, big carat weight, impressive detail. The final Olmec piece. Make sure you're in early on this one. Isn't that gorgeous? We're going to do a crazy deal. For anyone who's missed out on the Olmec pieces so far, this is going to be the piece that you put into your collection. Yeah, this this part here, we're just looking at this edge here, mm. almost looks like the belly of a, another dragon with oh, its yeah, head the kind of around here, almost like oh, the dragon. Oh, yeah, it's actually, um, it's almost like a, a phoenix. Oh, it is, isn't it? Yeah. Gosh, there's so much to look at with these, and it's the same on both sides. Twenty carats. Mmm. You know, that serpentine, incredible free form uh, um, detail. 20 carats, or is it? Yeah, or Give is it? Give it away in a minute. And uh, again, that transparency that we're seeing. Beautiful Guatemala material. Well done to five to Middlesex. Anyone who's missed out, this is your deal. Uh, the final of the Olmex. Gorgeous, look at that. Elaine, Maker, Maker. Devon, you've multi bought, well done. This is over double the carrot weight that, uh, that, that we're advertising this at, by the way. Oh my God, are you joking? 46. 46 carats again. Yeah. You know, under promising, over delivering. Neary, just because I know the anticipation, I can see it on the phone. I'm going to start. Loads of people there. Not in the thousands, we're going to start at 299, just so you know. Oh, wow. The pieces yeah, that you missed out on, this one you can afford. I'm going to make it the piece that you can get into your collection. If you want to multiply, you can. I'm still, by the way, I'm going to start at 299, which is where we finished on the previous two auctions. We're actually looking closer to 50 carats on this piece. And I'm taking hundreds of pounds off your price, even though you've got four interest free split payments. I'm taking hundreds off the price on your screen. Make sure you're on the phone lines or on the app or on the website. This is going to disappear. This is going to go absolutely nuts. I've got a feeling about this one. 
It's just going to go absolutely bonkers. We're starting at 299. We're starting under 300 pounds. Yeah. Absolutely phenomenal. Look at that quality. Oh, we've already got multi bidders coming through in Devon in five. This is absolutely fantastic. Well done. Can you put the phone light through this if you can, Kelly? Yeah. I just want to show you that crystallization that we talked about, how gemmy this material is. It really is. is. Supreme. Yeah. It's very special. Yeah, and it's got this incredible uh, blue kind of tone to it, which is unlike yeah. any other. Oh, yeah. my goodness me. Uh, 30 second clock nearly. We're going to give everyone a crazy deal on this one. Good luck if you want to own wow. it. If you've missed out. West Midlands, you've got two. Fife, you've got two. Devon, you've got two. Don't miss this opportunity. The legacy dragon in the center. The swirls, the serpentine uh, forms around that yes. circle of heaven. This is the piece that you can get. This is the piece you can afford. And in 14 seconds, we're going to show you how crazy low we're going on this. Oh, piece. look at that. It's Brand that new, type A, 100% natural, Guatemalan, that wonderful blue glow. Mm. Ken, Isn't you've it? got two as well. Just gorgeous. Oh, yes. Well done, Ken. Lots okay, of, lots you ready? of people coming through. Take yeah, go 200 on. pounds off, Neary. We're going double figures, 99 pounds. Good luck. Four interest free split. Wow. 25 pounds. Oh, my goodness me. This is amazing. Oh, Wayne's just piped up. Oh, what? I thought he wasn't in there anymore. What? What? Yeah. He's absolutely. Yeah, I know it's on a four way split pay, yeah, Ollie. Yep. Yeah, we well know done. that. Well done, guys. 24 75. They're pretty much gone. Pretty much gone. Well done. Absolute. Absolutely amazing. Oh, Wayne's not happy. We didn't think he would be. No, he's doing his rumple stilt skin thing. He's not happy. He's jumping up and down. Lots of choice language. Well done. Look at this. There's so many people there flying like a bird. 30 second clock to close it out. If, if we've got, uh -huh. it might sell out before that, but multi buyers in oh, Bristol, in Yorkshire, well in West Midlands, in Manchester. 11 chances remain. Yeah, do you know what? You're absolutely right, Wayne. Wayne's saying, gosh, we could have sold hundreds of these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If we'd have had, oh, can you imagine but that? You just can't find hundreds. I showed you uh, the, the Olmec flowers. There was 12 yeah. available in the market. Oh. Yes, this is even more intricate, even more detailed, even more time consuming. Yeah, that's amazing. Well done. Oh, my word. Uh, this next piece is, um, oh, I don't even know where to start with this. This well, has got... This okay. has got it all going on. Well, you've got that link. This is all carved from one single piece of jade. Yep. Which you know is the most impressive art form one can deliver in type A jadeite. Um, how many of these? 50? Yep, yep, 50 yep. Of these massive carat weight. Sensational detail. Oh, oh my way. gosh! What's the carat weight? Oh, 245. Okay, that's oh. incredible. That's a massive, monumental carat weight. Mm, that is not 245 carat. Well, it might be. I might be completely wrong. Okay, well, no, no. 299. 300 carats. <laughs> Just the 50 carats different. Wow. Wow! 30 second clock to bring this one live. Make sure you're ready. This is with that wonderful link, the bale carved out of the jade itself. The most time consuming thing to do, the most elaborate, the most dangerous thing to do with Jada. You need top crystallization to be able to do that. Any fault lines, any imperfections, any fissures that will break, it won't be um, you know, uh, uh, suitable for, for the jewelry. This is the ultimate piece. It's massive. I mean, how, isn't it incredible how a piece of jade, how a stone can look so fluid and like silk or satin yeah. or petals? It's absolutely amazing. For sure. Gorgeous rose. Yeah. Shape. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Just make sure you're quick on this one because this is the one that's not going to hang around. It's not going to hang around. It's incredible. It's got... It's just incredible, isn't it? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And it's all... It's got that wet look one, finish as well. One piece of jade. It's got Top crystallisation. It's got that incredible wet look, hasn't yeah. it? Just beautiful. Look at that. Isn't that stunning? Such a... Such a substantial piece. Look at that. Beautiful folds of that, of that gorgeous, gorgeous top crystallization. 
so lifelike. Go on. That level of detail is sensational. Margaret, you're in. Hazel, you're in. Rupal, you're there. Uh, Gloucestershire, yeah. you're multibank. Arika, you're there. This is one of the most impressive pieces I've ever seen on the channel. It's absolutely monstrous in terms of its carrot weight. The depiction that we're all witnessing right now yes, is sensational. It really is. Um, and you can see that, that wet look. That's not wax. That is down to the crystallization of the jadeite. Absolutely. And remember the link as well at the, yes. the top, which is carved from the same jade. It's massive. Isn't that incredible? And, and as you said, Dave, to be able to do this with um, jade, which has got no fault lines in it. Is, no... There's a carving even on the link. I know. Wow. Beautiful lotus um, flower on the, on the link wow. as well. It's absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. 0800, 644, 6, already starting to go. Absolutely gorgeous. West Midlands, Dorset, Hampshire, Middlesex, well done to Worcestershire, Gloucestershire. Absolutely stunning. Isn't that just incredible yeah. proving extremely popular yeah really line. popular you know what we're, even though it's the biggest carrot weight we've seen let's start at a thousand pounds we're going to start there the only piece so far that, that, that features the, the incredible moment of the link carved out of the same jade I, i've seen these in the, the the far east you know i've been out there in the market and they command significant premiums and it's really clear to see why yeah absolutely quarter of the stock gone it's sad to see this one leave. It's a beauty. It's a thousand pounds we're going to start at. Goodness me. A thousand pounds, Neri. He's not listening. He's not listening, He's Dave. glued to the screen, isn't he? He is. He's glued to the screen. Absolutely. We can't take our eyes off this uh, particular carving. It is you know, very different to the carvings that we've bought yes. before. Um, never seen this depiction. We've seen the Guan Yin. We've seen the Buddha. We've seen the Pixu. Never seen this uh, particular carving before, and it is, like we said, proving extremely popular. On the Very planet. popular. N none of you will have this in your collection. So we're at 999. Yeah. Look at that. Right. Beautiful. So Neary, 30 cool. second clock. I'm going to do something crazy on this. I'm going to do something unthinkable because so many of you have trusted us. There's a ton of you on the phone lines. It is a free phone number, but the reality is this isn't going to be here in a moment's time. I just oh, can't get over wow. the size of it. It's absolutely incredible, it's enormous, isn't it? Enormous, yeah. Beautiful. Keith, you're there. Maggie, you're there. Jacqueline, you're there. Gloucester, you're trying to get three of these. Congratulations. Yes, go for it, Gloucestershire. You got your interest-free split payments as well. Just incredible. We're at 999. We're on interest-free split payments. About to take this all the way down. Oh god, yeah. Um, right, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to give you like a moment to get involved. Straight down, 199. You have to be super quick. Look, we're talking 300 carats. What are you doing? Jade eye. What are you doing? That impressive wet look finish on the surface of this incredible jade, which is testament to the quality of this material. Goodness And me. the link carved out of it as well. This is maybe one of the best deals we've done this morning. You've yeah. seen the incredible deals yeah, we've done. That's Even amazing. the link itself is carved, which is that just outrageous. Is. I mean, that link is alone is probably 20 plus carats. <laughs> Now that's it's how amazing, is. isn't it? The most time-consuming piece we will have seen this morning. Uh, you know, when you see the movement there. Yeah, isn't it see, beautiful? Yeah. Absolutely. You know what? I'm going to give you a minute clock movements. to check this one out because it is outrageous. I don't even want to. I don't want to see this anymore at this <laughs> price. So I'm going to give you a minute clock to get it. Oh my gosh, that's absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, phone lines have gone absolutely wild. Yes, they are. This beautiful flower-like quality. Isn't that gorgeous? And the unfurling of this as well, like I said, it is something that is sensational. Gorgeous. Well done. Individual split payments of £49.75. and pence. Just incredible. What a deal. Look at everybody coming through. This is... Well done, Oh, no, guys. they're baskets. Baskets are absolutely... Testament to the carvers as well, just how yeah. lifelike this is. Um, it, and, you know, you're going to get this home, you're going to appreciate it, get a torch through it. Um, good luck. Yeah. Well done, everybody. Good luck. Lots and lots and lots of people coming through. I can't believe that price, 199 That's absolutely ridiculous, mm -hmm. but well done. I think it's gone to your head, uh, Dave. Oh, this is crazy. All we can't even find things. anything that, that kind of uh, replicates this No, online. I know, we that's it. can't find a comparison. There's nothing else. Um, so, you know, very few and far between these carvings make their way to the Absolutely. Mark. Jane's got three of these, well done. 
Yeah, gorgeous. Well done to you. Sandra's just come through. So it's Leslie. Well done. Okay, let me get this off. Gorgeous. It's one of well Wayne's favourites. Done. Congratulations. Um, well done to every single one of you who managed to acquire that. Excellent. Well done. Right. You've seen how busy it is this morning. You've seen how I know. Busy it's busy crazy. <clears throat> oh, yeah. Oh, this is beautiful. This is so, this is, yeah. This is the, the eternal jadeite rose, isn't it? Yeah, this is so classic. So wonderful. The, the motif speaks to all cultures. You know, a lot of the, the carvings that come out of the Far East, you know, are, you know, Chinese-inspired, the cultural depictions. This is something that means something to everyone. The, 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 the legend of this incredible jadeite rose. Look, What's this is the, the back. Oh, my word. Isn't that sweet? Yeah. And then you turn it over. Yeah. Oh, Huge a spiral of petals. It, yeah, isn't it lovely? It's so impressive, isn't it? What's the carrot way here? Wow. Two hundred and ten. Taipei jadeite. Yeah. Top Amazing. crystallization. Two hundred and ten carrots. And again, I just want to share with you, you know, the the jadeite that I was offered just last week in the Far East. I'm um, seeing, you know, the single flowers are like two thousand dollars. Yeah. Um, exactly. With a torch through them, uh, a light, you know, you're seeing the kind of value that these are commanding in the marketplace because who's going to tie up 200 carats in a single carving? Hand carved takes many hours to do a depiction like this. And we've seen uh, the, the prices that they're commanding in the marketplace. Mm. This, this one just here. Yes. Top beautiful. crystal, jade flower, one available, only one, hand carved, type A, 100% natural, just like yours, $2,000 wholesale, trade price. And we're going to do something crazy for you today from the same location, from Manmo, from Burma. So 210 carats. This one here is 267. It doesn't surprise me anymore. Yeah. Oh, there you go. 267. 267.65. Um, this is a... This is a... What I think is so lovely about this piece is um, some of the carvings that we've done today, not all of them, but some of them have been, you know, very odd, uh, very obviously kind of um, Eastern inspired. Yeah, yeah, What's yeah. so lovely about this is it's... It, it, it has universal appeal. Universal appeal, that's exactly it. It's that beautiful... And you see the light through this as well. You see that level oh, of transparency, bet, yeah. that crystallization. Look at this. Oh, wow. It just glows. Yeah, it does just glow, doesn't it? Wow. Oh, look. Okay, I that love, changes oh. everything. It's like tracing paper. It's like a it's stained exactly glass window. It. And that's jadeite. Yeah. This is the best of it. There you go. Two grand of one on the right. Goodness me. Yeah, I wanted you to see that so you could understand yes. you know, what, what the, the deals are going to look like in the future. Yeah. This is 250, 260 carats. And look at the, look at the size of what we're getting compared yeah. to what, um, what Dave's... What was on Dave's PowerPoint, you know, that, that guy was holding it in, literally in between two fingers. There's no way I could do it with this because it's so large. Such a significant carrot weight. Oh, look. Look at this. Because the petals are nice and smooth as well, you get that really lovely wet look to them as well, don't you? That really lovely, smooth, glossy appeal to them. They're just gorgeous, aren't they? Beautiful qualities. Isn't it stunning? Look at that, you've got your drill hole at the top as well, so if you do want to make it into a pendant or have it as a guru bead, um, it's got that lovely kind of mandala feel to it, hasn't it? Pop it in a box frame, that's a lovely idea. Put it in the uh, transparent boxes we bought you the other day with the kind of, um, with the filming. Yeah, lovely, that would be really lovely, wouldn't it? Carol, we're going to do something crazy on this one. Go on. Okay, so this is going to be the, the best deal we've seen all morning. It's the best deal for this carrot weight. The deal I'm about right. to do is going to be unmissable. So the reason I want to let you know that is because that isn't just some random piece of found on first dibs. That is, you know, in the marketplace in, the marketplace. in Asia, the best yep. price you're ever going to get. These aren't. These used to exist in deals of like you could get 100 of them, 250, and you could get great prices. Now they carve them one at a time, essentially. Yes. And yes. there's one here, a much stronger light source. Okay, much stronger light source, and that's why they're saying it's top crystal. You can see the size of it. It's probably about 150 carats. One available. One available. Hand carved just like ours. It's $2,000 wholesale. We'd have to bring that to you closer to £2,500. Yeah. With all the transport costs, everything else. Absolutely. With the airtime. Today, first price on this. First price. We're going 299 Wow. I, I want you to know why we're doing a show like this. When we hear from industry experts, authorities like Stanley Chu, 
who's saying, you know, these carved pieces, these legacy pieces with top transparency are just about the most expensive things you can acquire. And we're fortunate enough to have this jadeite rose. Yeah. Over 200 carats, closer to 300 carats by our own estimations with the, the carat weight yes. scales. And I'm at 299. And I'm nowhere near done. No, 30 second clock, please, Neri. Multi buy if you can. We are going to do the most sensational deal this morning. Look at that. Isn't that just exquisite? So smooth. Devon's so got decadent. two. Nottingham's got two. Rupal, you're there. Dorothy, you're there. Maker and Fife, you're there. Look at I'm going to say to all of you, whether you're here now or at the very end, you're all going to want it, but only, what, 50 of you can own it. That's the reality. I'm giving you the heads up. I'm telling you it's going to be the best deal you've seen. There's nothing changed. It's natural. It's Taipei. It's a giant carrot weight. Yeah. Now we'll match the price of the previous piece, 199. So we're going to match that, and I'm still not done. Ooh. This is how crazy it's going to be. You've got your interest-free split payments, which I encourage you to use if you can. It's going to help your, your budget go a lot further. Yes. Look at that. Look yeah. at that wet. Oh, my word. It's stunning. Yeah. 199. Not done. How? So I said it was going to be the best deal in terms of the carrot weight and the deal we're about to do. A lot of you are trusting me. A lot of you are multi-buying, which means that this, this is going to disappear. Now I'm gonna give you 30 seconds, I'm gonna give you a final deal. This should be it. We should be 100 pounds higher, even at our own kind of standards, even our own incredible deals. But it's gonna happen, you want that legacy rose. Maybe you have an Look idea of what you want day. to create with it. Maybe, you know, like I said, maybe the most incredible earrings. Oh, imagine my that. My word. Yeah. 10 seconds and, and I'm gonna blow your minds. I can't wait for this. 199 is a laughable deal, isn't it? It's absolutely incredible. It's crazy, crazy, crazy. Here we go. Price point coming in in three, two, one. Go on, Dave. Ready? 50 quid off 149. Oh! I said it was going to be the craziest deal. I always like to give you a heads up if you I can. Absolutely. I didn't want to let legend. the cat out the bag, but I just wanted to say it is going to be crazy. Like I said, this is one of those things that appeals to everyone. Woo! And if we can make it affordable to everyone, yes. or as affordable as we can, then we're going to do it. And that's exactly what we're trying to do. Areki, you're there. West Midlands, you've got two. Leslie, Hazel, Maker in Gloucestershire, Jacqueline in the Scottish Borders, Maker in Kent, Kenny Yorkshire's got two. Maker in Devon's got two. Dorothy, you're there in Merseyside. Carol, you're there in Devon. Yes. Rupal in Middlesex. It goes off my screen. I've got a lot of you within your baskets. Valerie, all the way in Aberdeen. Congratulations, you've just secured it. Every single one of you can do it. But you have to be fast. This really is incredible. This is literally blowing the lid off off uh, the jade industry. It's yeah, this is why this is why the Financial Times play. are saying we want to come and see what you're doing. We want to we want to be part of it. We want to document it. Um, and I think that is a kind of the ultimate seal of approval. Absolutely. But but these deals are only available to us because we do travel the globe. Oh, I for mean, sure. You, you, you've just been to China. What was the Peridot yeah. like? Was it was incredible? It, was it literally oh, just life changing? We're working on that as well. Yeah, it looks like Savarite. It's no. unbelievable. Yeah, really? Absolutely. It's going to blow your mind. It's like you've never seen. It's like a new gem. See, and that's just accessibility like yeah. we would never be able to get. No. And I want to let every single one of do. if the Financial Times do come and do a story on us, you know, this little kind of um, industry secret that we have. Yes. You know, this little community is going to blow up. It's going it really to explode. will. It and, really will. And, uh, you know, you right now, you guys are in prime position to take advantage of these incredible deals. Yep. But we do foresee a time when it's going to have exponential growth in terms of our reach. Mm -hmm. and we're all going to be part of it. You were the originals. Yeah, absolutely. See, isn't that exciting? You're part of the original gang. Well done. An amazing opportunity. Seven left. Wow. Absolutely brilliant. Isn't that just incredible? Seven, six chances. Yeah, well done. That is just, wow, these carrot weights. These 30 pieces. seconds to close this one out if we can. Um, we might beat the clock on this one, but I'll give you 30 seconds. How many in baskets? We've got myself like 20 or 30 in baskets. Absolutely crazy. Well done, everybody. A tremendous deal. Dorothy uh, getting involved as well. This is just so beautiful. Well done. 0800 644 And just... Yeah, so the one, the one that Dave was showing us, yeah, which is two thousand dollars. Only one available. You get thirteen of ours for that oh, price. Oh God, yeah. Didn't think about that. There you go. But you know, we got a great deal, and we'll always pass it on to you. I'm not showing you that to justify our price. You know, I could put this at two thousand pounds. So that's the price, guys. Yeah. I'm not. I'm saying to you, this is what you know. If we want to replace deals like this, we're gonna to have to pay a lot of a higher price. But right now, you've just got a killer deal. Well done, and congratulations. X. We've got a wonderful kind of three-dimensional. Kind of sculpture, if you want, next. There's carving, this oh, spiral. This is really, very, very really impressive. Lovely. 
This is really lovely. Now, we have done one a little tiny bit like this before, yeah, that lovely that. daisy shape. Do you remember that one? Mm -hmm. Uh, but this has got almost like a coronet. Yeah, undulating, incredible, Jaina. All oh, one wow, that's piece. good. I don't know which way. I'm going to put it here. Oh, they're two. I th it looks like they're two dragons meeting in the middle oh, of the wow. top. Yeah, I can see that. Wow. Not too sure. Oh, there's the other side. Isn't that gorgeous? The depth of detail. The, I mean, I couldn't even draw this, no. let alone carve it. From, from a singular piece as well. Exactly, from a it singular piece. It looks like piece. it's in motion, doesn't it? It does, doesn't it? Yes. 100 carats, one single incredible master carving. Phenomenal. Is Top it? transparency as well. You're going to see the light coming through this. Yeah. Which will be impressive. Absolutely. Let me get my torch behind it, actually. Here we go. Let me get that torchy, torchy, torchy. Look at that. Oh, yes. There you go, everyone. What an absolute beauty. What a beauty. Isn't that gorgeous? Love it. I love, 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 love this quality. Absolutely amazing. Okay. What quantity do we have of these ones? Uh, I hope you've got 200 because I'm going to do the lowest price you've done all We've got what? How many? 200? No, I said I hope we've got 200. How many do we have? Oh, 49. Okay. Uh, I'm, going to go, I'm going to do a crazy deal. Nearly, I can't anyone eat, who darling. wants to get involved. Um, hand carved. I know, yeah, well, that's it, isn't I'm it? Gonna start, I'm going to start near it 199. I'm going to start at 199. So it's going to be the craziest deal you've seen right. on, on these master carvings. And I'm nowhere near done. Um, once this price comes in, Ollie, let's give everyone a minute. We've got 49 of these. You're probably going to want to multi buy. <laughs> Good I feel luck. like I need to apologize. No, on no, 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 no. There's today. four split pays on this. What's he say? Four way. Yeah. Okay, that's fine. Minute clock, please, uh, Ollie. I am going to do the most insane deal. We shouldn't even have split pay on what I'm about to do on this. It will remain. You're still going to get it. Hand Minute carved. Clock. Something completely different. Double-sided carving. 60 seconds starts now. And um, I'm going far, far lower than what you're seeing. When you say far, far lower, Dave, what are your, what, what's, in the, what's in the plan? It's going to be double figures. I knew you were going to say that. Yeah, so basically, your split payments today are guaranteed below £25. Yes. Mm -hmm. Good luck. If you like the sound of that, everybody, for this incredible master carving, if you love the idea of your split payments being guaranteed under £25. Not half a minute, though, guys. Get I've it. Said it. I've told you. I've given you the heads up. You've got seconds. Yeah, yeah, you really do. Well done, everybody. Already lots of bidders getting involved. Your split payments are guaranteed to be under £25. I don't know what the final price point's going to be, but that's just I don't, yeah. Hey? I don't, yeah. <laughs> I love it. I really don't. Uh, Absolutely. I've got 12 seconds to figure it out. Uh, Fife, Kent, Hampshire, Wiltshire, Gloucester, yes, Cumbria, well Essex. Well done. done. Multi buyers as well. This is really, really superb. Well done, everyone. Here we go, everyone. Said lowest price on the carvings, 89.99. 89.99. It is the lowest price we've done. 100 <laughs> carats. Um, sensational artistry done by hand. Amazing. Get involved whilst you can. Yep, absolutely get involved. 89.99. That is um, absolutely amazing. Well done. If anyone else is thinking 99, 99, yeah, yeah, me too. Took no. more than 100 pounds off that. There you go. Jeffrey, you... Norman, Maker, Debbie, Anne, Cody, Maker, Richard, Maker, Susan, West Midlands. Um, bidders all over the British Isles jumping on in and getting involved. 22 pound 49 interest free split payments. Yeah, incredible. Well done at 89 pounds and 99 pence. Well done on four split payments of 24. Sorry, no, not 24.99, 22.49. Yeah. There you go, 22.49. Debbie, well done to you, my lovely Anne and Cody and Maker. Well done to you. Loads of you there about to sell out. This is absolutely fantastic. Well done. These are pieces, these are kind of designs and pieces which cannot be replicated, which cannot be replaced. Can't be uh, uh, like uh, overstated what we're doing right now. Absolutely. It's unmissable. You see these in a boutique in Hong Kong 
and they're priced in application. That's the reality. They're probably just ones or maybe a match pair. Yeah. They have the opportunity to come in and go 89.99 or what was it, 24 pounds something on split pay? <laughs> yes. Crazy. Yeah. Oh, sorry, 22 pounds. 22.49. I know. Isn't that just amazing? Well done, Valerie, uh, Mark in Cheshire, maker in the West Midlands, Jeffrey Norman. Well done to you in North Yorkshire. Absolutely fantastic. Well done. Isn't that just fantastic? Well done. Gorgeous. And 30 you've all got your 30 clock to close this one out. Massive queue. Um, we only had 49 anyway. Yeah, big, 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 big queues. Big queues for all of these. All of these are over allocated. If you do find that something is sold out, please do add it to your wish list. Yeah, if for it sure. does come back in stock, if somebody doesn't check out or for whatever reason, you know, if one does come back in stock for you know whatever reason, then um, you know you can add it onto your order. You'll get emailed. You'll get notified. But please, 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 you know, don't think that you've you know that it's going to be as easy as that. The best way of doing it is to do it now. Get it yeah. now. Well done. Gorgeous. Right. Okay. <sighs> Are we? Yeah. What's this? This one. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. So detailed. Oh. So impressive. Color saturation is epic. Transparency is unbelievable. Talk about detail. It doesn't get. Oh, better. he's so We've beautiful. We've never done a carving like this. No. This kind of almost beaded bubble I love it. frame. Oh. So on it. So beautiful. It's, and this is that glass kind of jelly bean yeah, like yeah, yeah. clarity. Top texture. Yes. And you can see it. You can see how gemmy this material is. You can see how mottled with beautiful. the deep green colors it is. Is it a, it's a parrot, isn't it? Is it a parrot sitting in a tree? I don't know if it's a I think parrot it is. or even, maybe even some sort of. But there's his lovely wing, there's his head and his tail feathers. But then it, it makes me think more of a peacock with the, the tail feathers. You think a peacock? Well, it's just the tail feathers. Yeah. And carries such auspicious meaning. In the, it can be whatever it is. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. Each and every one of you. You know, maybe it's a songbird. Let's hope it's not a pigeon. Yes. Yes. I love that kind of beaded surround you're getting there. And the, um, the detail, I mean, it could be a phoenix, I suppose. Yeah. Uh, the detail of these gorgeous flowers and the branches. Oh, it's just, it's really. It could, ju it could have just been like a, a, a disc carving, but to have all the cutouts, to have yeah. the vines, to have that, that impressive detail, takes it up a notch for me, takes it to the next level. How many of these do we have, Neri? 42. Okay, 42 opportunities, brand new. We've so never tactile. offered material like this. No, and it's, it, it, do you know what? It's such a tactile, carving it's not as um obviously it's very smooth you know it's been polished very you know really beautifully yeah i it's agree a, i see a brooch. a brooch yes sharon i think that's a lovely idea i think it would make a, a phenomenal brooch yeah uh, because of the the shape of it but yeah it, whatever it is to you guys i mean just as a, a piece of art it's sensational absolutely pop it in a box frame it's just gorgeous oh, yeah. isn't it ollie's saying you can imagine this being a belt buckle on wayne's trousers oh yeah can you imagine that? Yeah, like, I, can. I can. Literally jade through and through, isn't he? God yeah. love him. God love him. There you go. Let's, let's see the light through this as well, because we were talking about that jelly bean appearance. We were talking about that kind of translucency. Oh, this is going to look amazing. This is going to look incredible, by the way. Oh, my word. Yeah. Yeah, that's really top quality, isn't it? Bubbles. Mm -hmm. That is supreme. It really is. Like, I want you to understand, like you know, when you see the light passing through every single element of this jadeite, that's testament to the crystallization of it. That's as good as it gets. And we should be paying a premium for it, especially with that saturation of mottled color, the bicolor jadeite. Yes. I'm going to start at 299. That's what I'm going to start. We could start in the thousands. We're not going to. And I'm going to promise you a ridiculous deal on this because it's one of the few carvings we're seeing that we've never seen before. Uh -huh. And I can tell by the response that we've all fallen in love with this piece. I am going to make it as affordable as I can. I am going to do you an incredible deal, an unthinkable deal. But all you've got to do is be on the phone lines ready for this. Gorgeous. Look at that. Still on uh, four split payments. One of the most limited we've had all morning. Yep, yep, yep. 42 of these we had available. Uh -huh. Less than 40, obviously, now. A uh, 30 second clock, please, Ollie, and I'm going to call one crazy price. I'm taking hundreds and hundreds of pounds off the price. Well, we've had a message from Hassan who thinks it's a peacock. I, th uh, I think you're probably right, to be fair. 
four split pays on this one as well, but I am oh, going to do look. something that, that doesn't require four split pays. It's, I know, precisely. And really, from a company point of view, from a business point of view, we shouldn't be offering four, no. four split payments on, yeah, with a price like that. But anyway, we are. So I'm taking hundreds of pounds off. I can see you in the queue with it in your basket. Get ready to check out. Um, Neary, take 200 pounds off. We're going to do some double figures. 99 pounds or 24.99 interest-free split payments. That wonderful depiction oh. of the peacock and the flowers, that decorative, transparent, top gem, type A jadeite in all its glory. Check it out. Here we go. Wow. Four split pays as well. Valerie, Maker, Leslie, Susan, Jacqueline, Gloucestershire, Sally, you're there. Multi-buyers, I don't blame you. You've seen That's the light through this material. You've seen that element of transparency. You've seen that jelly bean-like appearance that is only uh, available in the most coveted uh, jade eye in the world. And this is 100% natural. I can't quite believe that. 99.99. I'm just trying to think how long we've been doing master carvings for. And, you know, for us to be here yeah. uh, at 99.99. This, this is not indicative of the quality. It's not indicative of the amount of work that's gone into it. What it is indicative of is, is, is us um, giving you accessibility, giving you access to... the to world's the most coveted, finest. the most in-demand gemstone yeah. of, of, of its time. Amazing. Incredible. 99.99, Valerie Maker, Leslie, Jacqueline, Sharon Maker, Maker in Gloucestershire in London, Rupal, Sally, Anne Maker, Vera, Liz Maker. Uh, oh, uh, I can't read that name there. Man, Mah I can't read that name, I'm so sorry. Frida Maker, Maker Susan, Maker Anne Maker, Frida. Maker, Maker, Vera, and Oh, there you go. Well done, everyone, my lovelies. Absolutely phenomenal. Oh, 800, 644, 655. Incredible. Well done. 99, 99. That one's going to sell out. Gorgeous. Well done. Well done. Isn't that just beautiful? 30 second clock to close this one out. Yeah. 30 second clock to close this one out. Well done to every single one of you that was successful, that can still be successful, but you've got 28 seconds to do it. Fantastic. Well done. Well done, well done, well done. Use your 30-day money-back guarantee. That's what it's there for. So, you know, when you get this home, use that 30-day money-back guarantee. You know, you've got to the 2nd of, uh, what, where are we now? Uh, September. Wow. Uh, to get this home, have a look at it, study it. Maybe take it if you're going to be going down to London for a day or so. You know, get, you know go down to London. Take yeah, it take a day trip, yeah. Go and get it valued. Go and see what people think of it. Take it to your local jeweller. You know, you know that 30 days is there for your benefit. It's well there done. for you to make up your Right, mind. move on from this one. I'm going to one last auction well with you this morning with me. Yeah. I know you've got the wonderful mask class coming up with uh, Yvonne. With Yvonne, Incredible, yes. Um, things that you'll get to see there. In Gorgeous electro This is my place, final yeah. deal. And oh my I gosh. I decided to go out of the bang. I'm going to do that. Oh, this is for beautiful. Everything. Aqua Jadeite. Top water yeah. Jadeite. Yeah, yes. It really is. How many of these do we have, guys? Oh man, 47. This is um, uh, like the crystal opal or, or like um, the, the ghost onyx. Yeah. This, is just, this is so pure. Yeah, just top water. You can see it in the rounds, which is part yeah. of this whole deal, <gasps> but particularly in that wonderful floor. My gosh. As well. That is absolutely... Look at these silvery... Oh, look at... Mm. Look at the transparency. Blue. Yeah, and I can't wait for you to put a light through that. that yes, oh, this is going to look insane. this is going to be transparent. Yeah. This is aqua jadeite. And in 22 seconds, it will be available. How many do we have, did we say? 40, uh, 47, I think you said. Okay, I'm going to do something. I'm going to do... Uh, like I said, always like to go out of the bank. This is going to be no different. Wow. Oh, that is like shining light through a piece of paper. Yeah. <laughs> That's absolutely incredible. And look how the how the the rounds as well are picking up on that light. Isn't that just uh, forty six of these available? And I, I, I'm get, yeah, I've talked the talk. I'm going to walk the walk. I'm going to start right now. Sixty five carats, aqua jadeite top water. I'm going to start gorgeous. guys at ninety nine ninety nine. I'm starting there. Oh my and gosh! I'm taking, starting. I'm taking a massive amount off. But I've only got just over 40 of these available. Did you say, so hang on, repeat. I'm starting at £99. That's where I'm starting. Like I said, You've anytime, anytime I, I, I join the team here, when it's the final auction, we always like to just go crazy. And this is going to be no different. You, you fact, this is a, probably a little bit too crazy. You have to doing a cartwheel today, Dave. No, 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 no. no. Oh, I'm Matt. still recovering. We, we, got, him. we got him that day, didn't oh, we? We had time. him. We yeah. had him. That was peer pressure at its best, wasn't it? <laughs>
99.99. Crazy deal, incredible. <gasps> Lots of you coming in already. I'm taking a huge amount off this. I'll take a 30 second clock, please, Neary. No cartwheels. Hey? No cartwheels. No cartwheels. Do you have any other seconds. skills in, in the locker? Unfortunately not. Nothing That's my only locker. skill. That's it. And he said, no, That's I know. Anything else you're good at? Nope. You're good at, uh, you're good at tumbling. Work. You're good at gambling and stuff. Mind you, he's probably <laughs> on still I, on I feel tumbling. like I'm in a circus. He's, what's he like? He's really good at tumbling, cartwheels. <laughs> like, what? You are jumping jacks. <laughs> yeah, yeah, play. yeah. Anything like that. <laughs> I'm playing the ukulele. Yeah. I love it. Well done. Right. Come on, Dave. Ready, guys? I'm going to half the price. $49.99. Oh, oh, my God. super quick. Multi-buy if you can. Go. There is no limit on this. You can get as many as you want. Aqua Type AJ, that, that massive carrot weight. Uh, a beautiful collector's parcel here for you to do whatever you, you wish. Yep, yep, yep. That is absolutely tremendous. Well done. $49.99. An amazing deal for you today. You've absolutely aced that. That is absolutely incredible. Well done, everybody. Um, these are such gorgeous. To never be pieces. anywhere near that deal. But like I said, we no wanted way. to give you something special to finish this showcase off with. Yeah, well done. That is absolutely wonderful. Gorgeous, loads of people through. Leslie's got two, well done to you. Loads and loads of different people from all over the Debbie's country. Debbie's got two, involved. Leslie's got two. Got lots of yes. you with threes and fours in your baskets. Make sure you're checking those out. Well done at $49.99. What a tremendous deal. Absolutely incredible. Well done. Thank you so much, Dave. Oh, no problem, anytime. Oh, good Thank to you have guys. you back. Um, the it's Jade, amazing. The gorgeous cameos. I believe, can we just double check with the cameos? Are they all still out or? Yeah, the cameras are all still out. So, uh, yeah, but do add them onto your wish list. Um, they, they were just incredible pieces, weren't they? But thank you so much. Thank you, Carol. And thank you to you guys as well. Back with you this weekend, and I cannot wait. Awesome. We'll see you in a second. Makers. Did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single P&P. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Hello everyone, it's Mark here. I'm delighted to be inviting you to join myself, Eleanor and the crew this Saturday, 5th of August. Come and join us on our safari. We've got an amazing lineup, including eight o'clock show opener, the most incredible elephant pendant. Nine o'clock, we couldn't be going on safari without Botswana Agate. I've got five incredible kits to show you. I'm not gonna tell you about the deal of the day, that's a bit of a secret, but at 12 o'clock, keeping the safari theme, I've got three kits, including the most incredible tassel toppers. We've got a leopard, We've got a lion and we've got an elephant. So join us all this Saturday morning, the 5th of August. You heard it here first. <laughs> Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. 
You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. And you've been given the most amazing kits to work with. I aren't? have. Look at those. They're just incredible. Um, I've never seen pearls electroplated before. They, it, it, it seems to just work so well. If it's done well, like these have yeah. been done, then um, it works so beautifully. Would you mind shuffling one of them, the, one, one of the kits over? Yeah. yeah, no problem. Because I just love the way they're double sided as well. It yeah. just gives you so many more options. I think it just it highlights the beauty of the pearl. It gives it a lovely frame in which to sit. It just it oh, see look that oh, yeah, those earrings are absolutely gorgeous. What what gauge why did you use for that? It's those? one mil. It comes it, I've I've yeah. mixed the two kits up. Oh and, um, how they dare you. I know that's naughty, dare isn't you. it? Uh, but the one mil wire comes with the other kit. Shall yes. I pass it over? Yeah, please Can do. I pass it? Yeah, please do. Um, See, look at the quality. And of I that just pearl. wanted to put those in the wire so that they moved and you could see all around them. Look at the size of this. That's huge. <coughs> it's absolutely gigantic, isn't it? Yeah. Huge pearl. Goodness me. Wow. Oh, yeah, that is absolutely stunning. Look at the quality. I think what we'll do. Um, can we do the demo? Can we start with the demo and then and then um, and then we'll bring the kits to air? Would that be okay? Okay, no, yeah, no problem at all. I love that. I love what you've used as little kind of pots to hold things. Uh, in. Do you know that's not my idea? It's little seashells. It's not my idea. I, I saw it. somebody using them on um, on YouTube, and I thought, well, that's such a good idea. Isn't it a lovely yeah, idea? It really is. Oh, yeah. it's gorgeous. So the well, little flux and the um, and the um, what am I talking the about? Solder. solder. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I think, shall I keep that on there? I don't want to burn the board. Well, why don't you, you can shuffle it up if you want to, whatever you want to do. I'll, I'll be careful. OK, uh, what I thought we'd have a go at is the scholar. Oh! <laughs> is, is it brave or is it Yeah, stupid? no, it's great. No, it's great. It's brilliant. So, um, this. What I've got here, um, I've got a mandrel. Now, this is a metaf it looks tatty, but it's so useful. I've got a, a friend who does wood turning, mm. and I wanted a mandrel that was... Um, it didn't taper. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a step mandrel. So that's what I've used to make those, um, those scallops on there. Yeah, lovely. And I thought, well, I just... Lots of people have commented on that one, mm. so I thought I'd give you uh, a little insight into how I how I did it. So what I've done is I cut, I think on the necklace there's six pieces. Uh, they are four centimetres of um, yes. the one mil wire. Mm -hmm. And then I, uh, what I did was yeah. form it around, around this mandrel. If I have annealed it, mm -hmm. uh, which is heating it up, making it softer to work with, uh, and you can actually get your rubber mallet and and heat and uh, hit it. But to be honest, it doesn't really matter. It's your design. Mm. You can have them as curved or as um, straight. Well, it, it, you can have as many as you want, and you can have them as curved as you want. Um, so mm. I thought we'd have a little go of doing that. 
Now, while you were um, you and Dave were busy over there, I set these out on my block. I don't know if I'm in the right place. Uh huh. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Well uh, so I've just bought three for demonstration, um, and that one is is loose. Uh, well, they're both they're all three loose. But what I did while while you were busy, I set the top two up uh, with a little bit of uh, flux in there. For people asking if you could use the um, argentium. argentium flux earlier on, yes, you can. You just dab it on with a brush, put on your your, your solder. Uh, I mean, I should think, although I haven't tried it, but I would have thought you could use solder paste very easily. And I <coughs> thought I would think it was maybe a little bit easier because it would sort of keep it in, in place where you wanted it. I think either the flux it. or the paste would be easier than the... Palins yeah, it, probably. They? Definitely. So that's why I thought I'd take the opportunity yeah. to just get a couple in place while we were waiting. Mm. So, um, I was, so what I did to prepare these, where did I just put that one that I did? Um, I got a little needle file, a tiny little needle file. It's ever so useful, this. And I shaped the ends of the... Um, little curves yes, so that they fit. go together like little <clears throat> mitres. Oh, lovely. So those two I did so that they mitered together and then this one I I put together like that. I don't want to knock everything and then shaped it down uh, with the, the ones above. So we'll we'll have a little go and we'll we'll do that one up there first. That's the one I need. This is my what I've just done. Okay, so we're going to go in with the torch and go in gently because if you are using pallions, they will jump about. So go in gently, just start heating it up. I, I find if you go around the edge, just to start getting the heat into it. Actually, because they've been sitting, look, they're not jumping around too much. They've dried off a little bit. There we go. Get them heated up. As, as before, you want good contact. You want them nice and clean. And you can always get your solder pick or your tweezers. And if anything moves, you can just knock it back into place. Mm. Great. Do you see it? Yeah. There you go. Hopefully that's okay. If it is, it is. If it isn't, it isn't. Exactly. Don't and, you know, wrong. you can just go back in. I mean, it, not everything works first every time. But let's uh, Yay. stick it in the water. Yeah. Oh, could you? Oh, we love that hissing sound. <laughs> there, oh, the hiss. Yeah, yeah there we go. <laughs> so <laughs> try that off. Now, normally, you would put this in the pickle. But of course, we haven't got time to sit here watching and waiting for the pickle. So let's um, just clean it up because the pickle cleans it up and gets the mm. fire stain off it. Am I in the right place? There, yeah. So, or the fire scale. So let's just clean that up and hope that that is clean enough because um, solder will not flow if it's dirty. Um, oh, that's one okay, thing you absolutely um, hate. If there's a gap or if it's dirty, it just will not go. So we'll try it. It might work, it might not. Uh, as I say, um, you would pickle it. But let, let's have a go. So we'll, we'll put a little bit of flux onto the, the top piece and onto this piece here. But yes, the seashells are lovely, aren't they? Oh, and they're lovely gorgeous. to have on your bench and, and work from. There we go. So then we would put that. Like I say, this is your, your design. You don't have to have it exactly the same as this. And sometimes it just decides for itself how it's going to go. Doesn't it? Yes. <laughs> so now we want to get the little pallions. I'm not making life easy for myself with pallions, am I? There we go. So by there. by heating this up, by soldering this second piece on, you're not you're not. Um, I know. I can't <laughs> think of the word. All right. 
<laughs> you're not undoing anything that you've already done I'm by not soldering the, the two. I'm not unsoldering, if that's the yes. word. Is that what you're trying to say? No, you're not. Good. Um, yeah, uh, it's it's a really it's a really good question. Thank you, Yvonne. And um, <laughs> what you would normally do is start with hard, go to medium. They're not being very nice to me in there today in the gallery. Spit yeah. it out, Carol. <clears throat> oh, you would you would go to hard, medium, and then easy. Uh huh. Um, because they all they all melt at different, at different temperatures, temperatures. Yes, and they absolutely. get lower temperatures. So uh, we just need one piece on there. But this, the time on this is all in the setup. It's worth taking and the time, it, it, it really does is. Take. That's why I thought I'd do the first two and get them all set up. No, because it's great the idea. Last, the last thing you want is to keep, is just to sit watching me uh, playing around with bits of solder or moving around. So as I say, we haven't pickled that piece, so We'll, but we'll try our luck with it. But do just take the take the time. It, it is worth it. If you did put it in the pickle, how long would you have to put it in there for? Well, it depends on a lot of things. It depends on the temperature of the pickle, how strong you've made it. Um, it goes white. You know it's done when it's gone white. So we're going to try that. And we can move it if... Uh, we can move it about if it's not in the right place. So let's give it a go. So now we've got more to heat up. So we'll heat up the top two again. Lovely. Oh, that's uh, right, okay. Lovely. Yeah, all the kits are on pre-order. So is the key with this just to keep that flame moving? Oh, yes, sorry. The key, keep the... I was concentrating. I know you were. That's talk. OK. Yeah, keep the flame moving. If you keep, if you keep your flame in the, in the same place, it will, it will melt, and that's the last thing you want. So keep it... What the aim is to get it all at the same temperature, and then what, you do, what makes the, the solder flow... Is, is the heat of the temperature, uh, is the temperature of the wire. Mm. It's, it's not melting the solder, the, the metal does that for you. Mm. So let's uh, see if we've got that hot enough yet. Let's see if we can push that up there. Oh yeah, there you go, that's better. Oh, that might have done it. Let's hope so. Got, can I breathe? I've got everything crossed for you, <laughs> everything crossed for you. Uh, right, I'll oh, put them down. Let's see. Yay! Yay! Yes! So that's what you're <laughs> up with. This is where you have a big sigh, really. So then it's all in the it's all in the cleaning up then. So, um, but also I, I won't do all of the all six because it's it's all the same thing. But um, as I say, play around, make the little pieces of whatever shape you want, and. Um, and just play around and put mm. put them in whatever pattern you is pleasing to your eye. But uh, that would now go into the pickle again. Let's move that off there now because we've finished with that. Let's uh, go back on here. So I will do it with. I love these sponge mm. things. We used to have a lot of these. Yes, didn't we, at we one have time. them in the past. Yeah, yeah. Uh, they're ever so useful. But for this uh, demonstration, I will use that instead of pickle. It's, it's not ideal, but, it, but it, it cheers it up a little bit. There we go. And then basically, once you've done it all, mm -hmm. it's, all in the clean, it's all in the clean up now. So yeah. you get your little needle file and where these, <clears throat> uh, where these solder joins are, I mean, that one is a bit spiky. So just spend, spend the time and, and get, it, get it looking neat and tidy and, and work away at that. Yeah, go up there a bit. Mm -hmm. uh, so you'd, you'd do them all like that. Gorgeous. And in all the little nooks and crannies. And okay. uh, get, just get it all looking really nice. Mm -hmm. And then we'll, we pre actually we we can actually pretend that we've um, 
we're only putting two on, or three on yeah, that Yeah, I mean, that looks so, lovely like so that. It really let, does. Let's pretend we're doing that. Let me get my... Um, I've got my bale making pliers here. Mm. So what I did on mine, um, you can turn these curls, you can turn them that way, you can turn them to the outside, yep. or what I chose to do was turn them to the back yeah, nice. so That's that really uh, they were a little bit more hidden, mm. I thought. Which looks lovely. So uh, let's have a go at that. So. Put that um, put that level with the top of your your pliers. I'm going to use the little one in this instance, <clears throat> and just roll it over. Lovely. Yeah, that looks lovely. So like that. So it's more or less, and you can fiddle around with it. Let me just get my pliers. Okay. We can uh, we can straighten those up and make sure it sits right behind. Yeah, lovely. Uh, and then what I did, uh, sorry, I haven't got another one, a spare one. Can I you borrow go that? Yes, please. Uh, what I did was I made I made um, mm. a head pin. Mm. Uh, head pins. I always keep um, loads and loads of featherweight head pins. Yes, in because lovely. you. you you can't, I'm sorry, say again. Gloria loves your design. Oh, She's going Gloria. to be trying it out. Thank you so much. I'm so glad you like it. So um, one millimetre wire through there was yeah. a, a bit tight. Yeah. So I got a piece, because I don't want bags and bags of point, uh, 0.8 millimetre feather, uh, head pins. Head pins, yeah. I don't want loads of those. <clears throat> so you can make them as you go along. So I made one. You just put, um, I think we have... Um, we have demonstrated it before. You just cut off a piece of um, of wire, yeah. put it in your tweezers, just heat up the bottom, and it balls up. Yeah, yes, which is really exactly nice. which is exactly what I did Wonderful with that. Idea. Roll the top, put it on there, and uh, basically that's the essence of it. Oh, Yvonne! Is that okay? Wonderful demo! Yeah. Yay! Oh. I'm Ooh. having soup for lunch whilst watching Yvonne. My postman just delivered my bead soup, says oh. Alison. There you go. Oh, Alison taking us right into her home there. What flavours the bead, soup? Bead soup. <laughs> yes, how lovely. Oh, gorgeous. Oh. Well done. Um, how lovely. Isn't that lovely? Um, so these kits are on pre-order. Which one are we going to do first, Neary? This kit, which we're doing first, is really rather lovely because you get three of your electroplated pearls, uh, which are here, which are all through drilled. Um, they are really, really metallic. They've got some gorgeous kind of gorgeous tones going through them. D through drill from top to bottom. You also get, look, sterling silver sterling silver paperclip chain and then look I, I love these earrings I love the way they've been made gorgeous sterling silver earrings can you see that with that really lovely decorative loop and then with the elongated loop as well that looks kind of ready to go I took it? mine apart and turned one the other way up um Right. Because I didn't want to, yeah, I didn't want to just use them as they were. I wanted to change it up. A I bit. see. Yeah. So uh, what I did for the moon, for all the lovely people who've bought the disc cutters in the past. Yes. I cut out a little circle, <clears throat> then put that circle back in and cut out oh. a chunk to make the moon. Yes. Yes. Um, so where I'd swapped over. Um, Onto the other earring, I just wanted to put. I'd got some little stars in my stuff. Yeah. In fact, we do sell them soldering solderable, solderable elements. Solderable elements, yeah. Yes. And we've got some stars, or did have on, yes, the, on how the lovely. website. And I thought, oh, well, we'll just do a little moon and stars. Oh, on gorgeous! I like the way you've put the decorative chain on the bottom of the moon-shaped earring. I think that's a really. You've kind of turned it upside down. Absolutely, you, yeah. It's because really I, nice I didn't really do. want it hanging. For, well, I wanted to make them different, you know. Yes. No, I like that. I love asymmetric yes. earrings. Yes. It looks uh, it looks great, and and that's all precious metal. Yeah. Yvonne, that's so nice. And isn't then it? I used um, I used the 
pearls for the earrings. Yes, lovely. In, with the one millimetre wire out of the other kit. Excellent. Uh, because I just wanted those to swing. Yes, you basically. see that. And they yeah. work so yeah. well. They're so contemporary. And, and the way that's door joined together is basically loops on the end of the wire and jump rings. That's as simple as that. Isn't that lovely? You yeah. see, we were saying right at the beginning of the show, what's so lovely about these kits is they really do... Um, they make very contemporary pearl pieces, which is so nice considering, you know, a lot of pearl pieces are quite, um, yeah. not, I mean, not dated, but, you know, very classic, very traditional. I love to um, modernise uh, pearls. Yes, I think that's a really yeah. good thing to do. I love I to do it's... the half chain and half pearl necklace. I love that. I love, love that design. It's such a winning design, yeah. isn't it? Yes, it is. Here we go. So you've got all your elements here. Oh, We've got that, Maker, that Karen. That Stephen, thank you, lovely. Um, Stephen and Susan coming through to get this already. That's great to see. Well done. Okay, here we go. So, price point on this, amazing. Here we go, all the way down. Now, remember, these are sterling silver elements you're getting here. This is really fantastic. We're at $69.99. Now, I think if you were faced with the question of, you know, how much would you, how much would you expect to pay for this, that, and the other? You know, I think, you know, for the for the for the pieces that you're seeing here, which Yvonne has made, which are also those earrings, for instance, I can absolutely imagine those earrings be, you know, 60, 80 pounds. Absolutely. One hundred percent. I know she's out of the wiring, but, you know, still. Well, we've got two sets of earrings out of those, haven't we? Precisely. That's exactly it. You've got your sterling silver uh, paperclip chain. That's a full length chain. You've got your sterling silver earring findings which are these ones here with that, I mean, they are really, to all intents and purposes, they're, they're ready done, they're ready made. You don't have to do anything with those at all if you don't want to. And you've got your three electroplated plated Biwa pearls as well, which is just gorgeous. Anita, Karen, well done to you. Geraldine's through, this is really good to see. Well done to you. All the way down, under 50 pounds. Yeah, that's fantastic, isn't it? We're at 49.99. Do you know what I really love is the texture on those. Aren't they beautiful? Fabulous. They're really gorgeous. 49.99. We're not done. We're going to go lower. Your three Biwa pearls, your paperclip chain, your gorgeous decorative earrings. They're absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Do you know, it's a really good point, actually. Ollie's, um, a dire a, a, a director Ollie's saying, if you took these earrings just as they are and you just sold them, how much would you pay for them? How much would you expect to pay? Well, you wouldn't charge less than £20 for any earrings, would you? Sorry, say again. You wouldn't charge 20, less than £20 for any no, earrings. No, no, no. Sterling silver earrings. And you've done nothing to them. Yeah, absolutely. You see, no exactly labour charge it. in that. Precisely. Ready made. It's done for you. Are you ready? Heather, Debbie, well done to you, Anita. Here we go. Price point coming in any second now. <laughs> well done. 0800 Oh, I love the look of that pearl. It looks like it looks like liquid mercury, doesn't it? It does just actually. gorgeous. Here we go. All the way down. Enjoy. Here's your deal. Twenty-nine ninety-nine. <gasps> Oh, I feel a bit bad now. That's incredible. Yvonne's worked so hard on these pieces. <laughs> I feel a bit bad we're doing this. Oh, gosh, but do you know what? That is, no. that is just tremendous, isn't it? I Debbie's got doing. to Gillian, Christina, Bernadette, Sharon, Mary, Anita. Well done to you, my lovely Mary. Karen, well done to you. This is absolutely phenomenal. And it's all precious metal. And what's so nice is, um, thinking forward to future generations as well, um, My, um, I was telling you before the show, actually, my gorgeous grandma uh, left a couple yes, of pieces you of were. to me, which yes, I absolutely were. love. And I love them. They've got a sentimental value. Am I going to wear them? Probably not. It's not really, not really my taste. So what I'm going to have it done, uh, what I'm going to have done is I'm going to have them kind of reimagined, remade, if you like, into pieces, which I would wear. And what I love about these kits is that this is pearls reimagined. It is. These aren't necessarily yeah. the pearls that my, that my great grandma would have worn. Um, but they're the kind of pearls my mum would wear, I would wear, my daughters would wear. Yeah. You know, it's got that that modern twist, and I think it's really important that we that we do consider. Yes, it's wonderful to look backwards and to look at the classic designs, but I think it's really important that we're kind of that we're kind of looking at um, looking forward with our with our fashions, particularly with things like pearls, which are going to be around forever. You know, they're so wonderful to use. Twenty nine ninety nine. What a deal! You know, we said twenty pounds for the earrings. Yes. Twenty pounds for the chain. Yeah. No labour. Yeah. And you've still got all three pearls. Oh, left. yeah, yeah. It's absolutely incredible, isn't absolutely. it? Absolutely. Amazing. Well done, everybody. 
loads of people coming through. Yeah, so uh, all of the components you're going to be getting here are all sterling silver. The electroplating on the pearls is a base metal, just to let you know. Uh, but uh, the wire that you're getting, the chain, the earring findings, that is all 925 sterling silver. Well done, everybody. Go, go, go. Uh, sorry, the wire you're getting in the second kit, I should say. Uh, but absolutely amazing. Well done. That chain is just per the reason I added the little pearls. Yes. Is because it's so easy to add on Well, it's to. such an open link chain, isn't it? And there are lots of designers using this quite, uh, yeah. th this type of chain at the minute. A, because I think it's a really attractive chain, but B, I because they can it. do things like this. Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, with those little pearls. Oh, gosh, you've done well to get those pearls, wherever you got those from. They're well, really... I got them from here, but for a long time. They're like ago. hen's teeth. <laughs> pearls like yeah. that so absolutely beautiful uh, to see uh, the little pearls that you could do birthstones if you wanted to you could do all sorts you could do crystals topaz um what what do you mean how many how many of this kit do we have <clears throat> oh okay i know if i i know <laughs> if is literally you've had a lovely day <laughs> You've had a lovely day, but uh, oh, bless her heart! Look at her. I just can't believe it. I can't. I can't believe there's a clock going all the way back down to. Is it Somerset? Yes. Oh, she's look at be that. Livid. She's. I know. Look at this. A hundred pounds. That's from the Monica Veneda website. That's for the ultra textured necklace. I love Absolutely it. Absolutely gorgeous. I we love we it. put it in a kit. Slightly different. I know, but slight. Yeah, but but yeah. You can see the inspiration. Yeah, yeah. Twenty nine ninety nine. We're not done, and now I, ha I, I literally have no idea where uh, Neri's going to go. Now this is absolutely ridiculous. What do you mean, no one? That <laughs> he's so <laughs> naughty. He loves it when this happens. Oh, that, that, as a bracelet, that would be nice. Do you know what? Should we put a fibre back in your pocket? Let's just go for it. There you are. Gee whiz. Put the <laughs> absolutely Neri. Well done. Twenty four ninety nine. That be is fair. These do work so well together. Oh. They really do, don't they? £24.99. What a deal. You've got to get the next kit to go with it. That's why we've gone a little bit lower with this kit. Um, absolutely fantastic. Do you know, over here, we're mid... We're, <laughs> over here, we're mid-summer. Over on the other side of the studio, it is Halloween. Halloween. This is Hobby Maker setting up all the... Why are those colours so bright? He's literally from the 1980s, Michael Wolf, isn't he? We've gone he? from Christmas to Halloween. Give us your 1980s stance, just a, just a 1980s kind of stance of some description. Here we go. <laughs> That's a just 17 stance, isn't yeah. it? Smash hits. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Ms. Magazine. Oh, I used to love it. Well done. 24 99 Loads of people coming through to get this. Well done. What a great deal. I know. It's absolutely amazing, isn't it? It's so good. It's so good. There is nothing in this kit that I think, yeah, oh yeah, twenty four ninety. Can the, you imagine the chain how pleased is worth more I than was that. when it came through the door? I bet. Oh, um, there were so many things you could do with it. Well, that, and that's exactly it. When you're, when you're given the luxury of having a couple of kits where everything crosses over so beautifully, mm -hmm. that scallop, have you, you must have done that kind of scalloped wave design before never. in something. Have you not? No, never. I think that... That could be no. like like a signature, couldn't it? It's just so lovely. It's your, just Young gorgeous. Natalie, um, design, guest designer Natalie, mm. she said it reminded her of mermaid scales. It is a little bit like scales. Yeah. It, it's exactly yeah. like scales. Yeah. Yes, it really is. It's got that really lovely mermaidial kind of uh, um, oceanic kind of feel yeah. to it. It's just, it's so lovely. Really love that. Really, really love that. Do you know yeah. that's really good? Yeah. Ollie would take the necklace and gift it, and then everything else is his. I like that, Ollie, yes. And do you know, I made every, every single piece from, from the two kits. Uh, I've used it all, mine. Yeah, of course but, you uh, have. But uh, yeah. there's a lot of sterling silver in there. And, and, that's, and, and let's, not, let's not kind of, um, let's not, um, mm -hmm. actually, that's a really good point. Sorry, I, I know you've just taken the details off, Neri, but I, I think it's definitely worth doing this. And let me get back to grams. Hang on, is this... Oh, gosh, hang on. How do you... S <laughs> I've got G and I've got GN. It's going to be G, isn't it? There we go. Right. Oh, Two... Four and a half grams of sterling silver in this kit. Obviously minus the pearls, but yeah, four and a half, four and a half grams of sterling silver. And that is a metre. Yes, yeah, so the next kit we've got... 
Oh my a word, eight grams yeah. of silver in this wire. It's one millimetre wire and it's one metre long. It, it's fantastic. I, when I saw that, I was in heaven. And you were working with this wire with the greatest of ease as well. I mean, I know you'd annealed it, you'd heated it slightly so it's easy to work with, but yeah. The, I think a lot of people are, are afraid of working with sterling silver wire because they think, oh, I don't want to do it an injustice. So I'm going to start using, I'm going to start off with using silver plated copper. And I totally understand that. But yep. you'll find when you work with silver, it's even easier to work with than your copper wire, isn't it? It really is. And, you know, <clears> don't <throat> be frightened of it. You can, if it goes wrong, that's how you learn. Yeah, absolutely. Um, you know, melt it down, make it into, make it into a little pebble. Love that. Set a stone in it. Oh, do, just, you know, yeah, just use it. There is no waste with sterling silver. Absolutely. That's the thing. Yeah, you can just keep melting it down yeah, and exactly. granulating it. Yeah. Um, beautiful canvas of pearl here. That's absolutely absolutely gorgeous isn't it stunning colors are lovely there as well aren't they absolutely yeah yeah now the colors you're getting here the secondary kind of veils of color you're getting here are absolutely gorgeous aren't they um a meter of your one millimeter gauge sterling silver wire as well which is just incredible this is simplicity but what's so great about this is as Yvonne said you know there are so many different things you can do with these kits of course they cross over beautifully but um Gorgeous. Yeah, we do quite often say this, don't we, that with them, um, you know, our big strands of pearls that we bring you on Jewelry Maker, quite often you get a bit pearl blind and you think I'd actually pay more for one pearl than I would for the whole strand, just purely because it, it does lose its impact slightly, yeah. I think sometimes. So with a pearl like this, I mean, literally name your price. It's such a large individual piece. And isn't the thing it? is, you don't have to use it all in one pendant. You could make two pendants out of that. Mm -hmm. You can have just the scallops and make use the pearl for something else. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. It's a lovely idea. It is through drilled. So if you want yes. to wear it as kind of like a watch style bracelet um, face and you a watch face bracelet um, kind of um, uh, style of pearl, you absolutely can do. Less than 20 seconds, we're going to be bringing your price point in. Amazing, well done. Lots and lots of people coming through, lots of you there today. Always great to have your company, uh, but particularly when we're bringing you precious metal pearls, etc., etc. It's just always so good, isn't it? And giving you the chance as well to work with great quality ingredients to make commercial jewellery, avant-garde jewellery, you know, modern, uh, to give... Uh, classics, kind of a modern twist. It's up to you. Well done. Twenty-four pounds and ninety-nine pence uh, for your wire and your enormous. I think sting younger pearl people well. would you would wouldn't turn the nose up, but they do sometimes turn the nose up at pearls um, oh. because they think they're. They used to be classed as old-fashioned. I think they're coming more into fashion Absolutely. In, more no, I think you're right. I think now. you're right, Yvonne. Um, but uh, y younger people uh, wouldn't turn their nose up at those Harry styles Harry Styles wears them. Harry Styles he wears does. them. He does. He does. Lots Harry of boys Styles wear could them. wear anything and he'd still be <laughs> utterly gorgeous. I just, I just love him. I love Harry Styles. <laughs> I love him. I love him. Oh! It's... Hey? Oh no. Uh, I know. It's just look. Oh, Neary. Minute to drop the price. I'm sorry, Yvonne. This is just. This is, <laughs> huh? She's never going to want to come back. <laughs> this is crazy. This is. But mind you, it's the customers. They get a great deal, don't they? Of course they, they do. Which is always Look brilliant. how much you can make. I mean, I know. it's all quite elaborate. It, yeah, <laughs> gorgeous. You've been really indulgent with these pieces and you could have been much more... I could have spread them out a lot more, yes. You could have done, but I think yeah. I think what you've done is is, is just right. It, it's so right. Right for the kids, right for you. Um, it's just it's just great, great stuff. Uh, here we go. Less than 30 seconds. We're going to be taking uh, the price point down again. I know this is us. We are live. We have to be reactive. Uh, well done. What a deal. Absolutely phenomenal. $24.99. Here we go. Debbie, Jacqueline, Lorna, Janet, Maker, Bernadette, Paula, Hilda, Frida, Sharon, Elspeth, Gail and Mary. Uh, Gail's just checked out. Well done to you, lovely Gloria in Staffordshire. Here we go, everyone. It's like a doorway, I, I think. It is, isn't it? It's like it? a little yeah. doorway. Fairy lovely. door. <gasps> Fairy door. Oh, I love it. 19 pounds oh. and 99 pence. There's a meter of sterling silver in there. Okay. <laughs> 19.99 for a meter of one millimeter gauge sterling silver. Forget about that. Forget about that. A meter of wire for 20 quid. That's amazing. That is incredible.
Yeah, the wire would easily be that price point. Yeah. But nothing less than that price point, I mean. And then you get the gorgeous statement pearl, which is which is enormous. Eight grams of silver you in there. You could get lovely. so much out of a meter. Hmm? You could get so many pieces out of a meter of jewelry. Well, how many? Um, how much? How much in a ring? Oh, what that? Here we go. Let's get the old. This is this is going to be. This is sixty-five centimeters, isn't it? Something in a ring. Do you think? No. Oh, what did you say? Did I say centimeters on the? I don't get those muddled up. How? How much in a ring? There we go. Ugh. That. Oh, it's all wobbly. Got a ruler somewhere. Yeah, here. Because I'm thinking, I mean, how many rings are you going to be able to make with something like this? I mean, I've. Oh, this is just. Sorry, I have. It's because it's one millimeter gauge. We're looking at yeah, about probably about six and a six and a half centimeters. Not 65 centimetres, yes. six and a half. I thought you said I got 65, I was like, I got then I thought maybe six 65 millimetres. There you go, 65, 65 millimetres, there yeah. we go. We'll get there. <laughs> How big are your fingers, Yvonne? I'll, I'll get there. <laughs> <laughs> I see, I'm in feet and inches. <laughs> but you can, but you, can make, you can make those rings again and again, again and again. Yeah, and so simple, so easy. How many and stacker rings could you get out precisely. of Precisely. Yeah. And you know, if it's a sterling silver stacker ring, you know, you're going to be selling each one of those for the absolute minimum of kind of 15, 20 pounds. Yeah. So if you, you sell one of them, you've made your money back. I don't think you don't sell anything sterling silver for less than fifteen. Pounds, oh, you do can't. You? you can't. Yeah, you, know, you wouldn't. <clears throat> and also, I think that if you do pricing's too low, people become very suspicious that it's not you real. You are absolutely right. The amount of people I know that price their jewellery in a, in a re, what they thought was reasonable, mm. and they weren't selling, <clears throat> and then they for whatever reason, up their prices and everything started selling. Absolutely, absolutely. I've heard it time and time again, that. Brilliant. Thank you, Mr Neary, says Gloria. Oh, Gloria. I oh, know, massaging his ego there. <laughs> he loves it. He loves it, doesn't he? You're right there, Neary. Oh, he's loving it today. <laughs> If anybody has a go with a scallop, send it into the Wall of Fame. Please do, because that's, that's going to be a really popular design, I think. I hope so. Mm, I hope so, too. I, I know so. I know so. Uh, gorgeous. Well done. Loads in. But what are you doing in there, Neary? Oh, Neary, that's just enough. He's being very... Mm, being very bolshy. OK. <laughs> Helen, this is what I have to live with. This is what I have to listen to every single shift. Did you you hear that? You heard I that. heard that. Yeah. Yvonne's a classy lady. She's not even... <laughs> I don't know about that. Oh, I, don't know why I, I instantly regretted it when I said that. You can't. <laughs> you can't. You can't say things like that, Neary. I I heard you. Well, and then Ollie said something. Anyway, uh, Wendy in Cambridge and Flintshire, <laughs> Elspeth Violet. Well, there's this load of you there. Well done. Check out my lovelies. Hey, it's the go go go. Right. Okay. Come on, gang. What are we doing? Oh, go in. No. Oh, that's annoying. What about the other ones? They're going to be even smaller. But I'll see what I'm doing. Oh, what a shame. I know. It is a shame, isn't it? Yeah. Just seeing if these pegs go in these pearls doesn't look like they do. And it's really annoying. It's nothing stopping you filing them down a little bit. Or sanding them down a little bit. Or reaming the, the pearl. Yes. There you go. I'd be more confident reaming the pearl, Would I think. You? I think so. Oh, gosh, these are like little dresses on mannequins. Um, They're like little fairy skirts. They are. <laughs> they are. Look at this. Fairy doors and fairy skirts. Oh. He did it yeah, a ballerina. Did a ballerina. Oh. Yeah. There you go. So I've got gorgeous little pegs here. Are we doing them all? Do they come together? Oh, Neary. Seriously? I'm going to do the gold one first. Okay, where's my where's my washboard? Where's my tweezers? The rose gold's pretty, isn't it? It is. I do love a, a love a bit of rose gold. Here we go. Yellow gold plated sterling silver. Is that right? Yeah, yellow gold plated nine two five sterling silver, with a beautiful white zircon, genuine white zircon. Oh, my gosh, that. that is a proper amount of gold in there. So for a gram of precious metal in there, and that is um, amazing for a for a for a bale. 
a bale to have over a gram of precious metal and that is seriously impressive if there are certain chains you put around your neck with less than a uh, a gram of sterling silver that that is really quite just impressive just think of the work in setting that little stone on that little uh, yeah little skirt and, <laughs> and yes absolutely and do you know what's word. do you know what's in, um so interesting and what's good about that is is is, is as soon as we bring you anything which is gem set. The, um, as soon as we bring you everything that is gem set, the manufacturing costs of it sh shoot upwards. Because of course you have to get a gem setter involved. It's not just a, you know, somebody who is, um, you, know, you know, a metalsmith working with this. It's now a gem setter as well. You've got a zircon on one side and on the other side, you get another one. Oh. Two gorgeous white zircons there. That's really Yeah, great lovely. for earrings. Nice yeah, idea. Yeah. Really lovely. Um, now, it's very, uh, it's, it's not very often at all that we bring you bales like this with such a long peg on. I mean, that is really, yeah. really impressive, isn't it? It really is, yeah. That's really, really nice. Do you know, the silver one would go well with the silver earring findings that were in the last kit on the little, um, what's it called? A paper clip. Chain. What, these? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't you think well, that would look lovely on there? Yeah. Oh, sorry, I was took meaning on the bottom. What? So? Oh, there. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's yeah. a lovely idea. Yeah. Mix those metals up. I yeah. like that idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's a lovely, a lovely way of uh, utilizing these, aren't they? Gorgeous. Such beautiful planning has gone into this, and such. Um, if I show it to you from the top, you can see those lovely kind of swirls. It is like a little a, a dress, nineteen ninety nine. So much work Not in done. that. There is a lot of work. And yeah. also as well, something that you'll be fully aware of as well, and something you mentioned a couple of times, after you make things like this, they're not going to be ultra, ultra shiny. They've got to be polished by hand. They've got to be put in uh, huge containers of shot and kind of gently vibrated yep. um, uh, to kind of get any fire scale or any kind of um, kind of oxidization off them. This is, to get them looking like this, this is a, this is a lot of processes. Is, you can spend as, well, I can spend as long polishing as I can making. I bet, I bet you do, yeah. yeah. And especially if it's an intricate, something yeah, kind of interesting, intricacy yeah. going through mm -hmm. it, whether it's a ring or whether it's got little undulations like this does here. Yep. Absolutely. Here we go. £12.99. Well done. That is absolutely brill. Good. There you go. Joy, well done to you. Maker in Fife, well done to you. Absolutely brilliant. Well done at £12.99. It's just great, isn't it? Wonderful being able to bring you things like this today. An absolute joy. Well done, everybody. And it's not plated base metal, it's plate plated sterling silver uh, as well. Exactly. So, yeah, you've got that precious metal quality going yeah. all the way through here, which is just fantastic. Mm -hmm. Well done, everyone. Don't forget your 30-day money-back guarantee. I'd be multi-buying these. Any, any gem where you've... Because um, we've, done, we've done peg bales where the peg has been very, very short indeed, and that's, you know, that's fine for certain gemstones, certain beads which you've got. But if you've got a, a through-drill bead or if you've got a bead with a larger kind of hole in it or it's a larger bead in general, then, you know, you're going to need a larger kind of uh, pe peg to go in there. You can always cut it down, obviously. But if you've got a particularly large gem, then this is absolutely perfect. One of those pearls you had earlier with the the one decorated With the pearl, one, yeah, the gem set one. Beautiful. Absolutely. Yeah, decorated. Yeah, that's a gem lovely set. idea. That's all right. <laughs> uh, well done. Uh, Count your miles taken too. That's great to see. Well done to you, my lovely. Should we do the rose gold one near me now? Ras gold, ras gold. What are you thinking? Ooh, thinking. All I told you about thinking, thinking. Mary. Eh? All I told you about thinking, <laughs> eh? Oh, all I told you about thinking. <laughs> oh gosh, hang on. Here we go. <laughs> that's beautiful. Rose I gold. love. The rose do vary, don't they? And um, that's a right. They pretty really one. do, don't yeah. they? I think they vary massively yeah, they when do. they're when rose gold is plated on something. When rose gold is plated on silver, it can look delicate and pink like this, whereas the bangle I was talking to you about earlier on, which my gorgeous grandmother uh -huh. left me, which is solid rose gold, is beautiful, but it's almost red. Yeah. It, the and old, it's beautiful. Old rose gold. Old rose gold. That's exactly yeah. what it is. Yeah. It's almost like a red gold. And you, it's, you see it in um, jewellers' windows with the sell second hand, I was going to say, but pre love, pre love, yeah, pre love, yeah, yeah, yeah. the old antique jewellery, yes, yes, put it yes, that way. Uh, the it is very dark, yes, and it, 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 it's absolutely beautiful. I don't know whether it's because it's a, 
a different a different grade or whether it's because it's not plated. I, I don't know, but this is just gorgeous. Twelve yeah. ninety nine, stunning. Tisla flu. Um, let's do the sterling silver one, shall we? Sterling silver. Oh. Here we go. Got some beautiful pearls that would go on there. I know, right? I've just seen them. Perfect. Absolutely. That perfect. is absolutely brilliant. <laughs> beautiful. You see, now I look at it like that. That could be. That would be wonderful as. Um, Make that into earrings. Definitely. Yeah, that would be a sweet of jewelry. Earrings. That's like wedding jewelry. That's yes. like yeah. the you know the biggest Bri day of your life. Jewelry. Bridal jewelry. Yeah. Oh, look at that! Gorgeous. Fits the size of that pearl beautifully, yeah. doesn't yeah. it? Absolutely. <gasps> Almost like a parasol going over the top of the pearl. Oh, that's absolutely gorgeous. Okay. Janet Maker Candy Allison's got three. Well done to you. This is just incredible, is it? Look at the quality you're getting there. Don't you think the three is for earrings and a pendant? Oh, I, I hope. Alice I really three. hope so. I hope so, Alison. And what's so great about this is, you know, you can cut it down. Yeah, that's a good idea, actually, Ollie. Um, you could form this peg into a loop yeah, you could. and hang something from there because it's yes, long enough easily. to be able to do that with you very easily. easily yeah. yeah. Janet, well done to you, maker in Fife. Oh, Northamptonshire, Sharon in Lanarkshire, well done to you as well. £10.99, amazing. Joy to the world! Anyway. There she is, Helen, well done to you. Gorgeous, loads of people there. Alison's got three still, that's great to have you there, my lovely. Well done, everybody. Oh, my word, oh, 0, 800. Three. <laughs> oh, another three going to lovely Janet in East Riding of Yorkshire. There we go. Sharon and Caffilly. Helen, if you want to, check out my lovely as soon as you can. Well done. Oh, loads of multi-bidders coming through, I think through, I'd please. be tempted to get three, wouldn't you? But, and, and do you know what, um, Yvonne? That's going to be probably one of the easiest, quickest sweets yes. of jewellery you ever make. Absolutely. Isn't one it? One of the most beautiful as well. Oh, absolutely. One of, maybe <laughs> yeah. even one of the most valuable sweets of yeah. jewellery you ever make as well. Isn't that wonderful? Yeah. Interesting to think that sometimes making those incredible landmark estate pieces, heirloom pieces, doesn't always have to be the pieces that you've spent three weeks mm -hmm. making, mm -hmm. does it? No, it doesn't. Sometimes it can be it can be the piece that's taken hardly any time to make, but you've just got gorgeous ingredients. And you can afford to take just three pearls out of a whole strand. I imagine you can you always could. pad yeah. them out with something else. Can't with we? the spacer yeah. beads that we bought you earlier on, or with your other your knotting gems. or yeah. anything. Yeah. A bit of knotting, yeah. yes. Gorgeous Bedfordshire. Well done to you, my lovely maker in Fife. Well done to you. We're going to do these pearls. <laughs> yeah, we're going to do them. They are stunning. These incredible pearls coming up now. What a gift, sir. Bye. She's amazing. Um, show, us, show, us your, show us your necklace again. She said one of these pearls were going in, in, in the shell that um, she made. Talk to us, how did you make that? I, sand, I got a shell from the beach and uh, sand cast it. Uh, and then I drilled a hole through the top and, and just hung the, dangled the pearl from it. Did that take a lot of polishing? That's no, so not really. Did it not? No, because it's the intricate stuff that takes most polishing, to be honest. That is incredible. Yeah. I love the pearl you've got in there. Yeah, it was on, um, not last time, two shows ago that I was on. Oh, really? Yeah, I brought, oh. I made it for one of the samples. But I have to say, yeah. you, this one of it these would, would go look amazing. Beautifully. Yeah, it would. These are um, some of the most incredible pearls we've ever had on Jewelry Maker. These are tricolor pearls. Uh, to give you that kind of tricolored quality in a strand of pearls is amazing they do look amazing don't they like a, a handful of just light and energy do you know i said it last time i was on but i've got loads of pearls but i've never bought them from anywhere else other than jewelry maker really and that is the that See, is the i love that yeah yeah with um we've had i can probably think of 
two strands of pearls I've seen over the years on Jewelry Maker, which I've, I've looked at and thought, hmm, I'm not as impressed with those as I thought I would be. Every other strand has been a quality which, honestly, world, they, world renowned. Yeah. We are as known for our pearls as we are for our prices. We are as known for our pearls as we are for our incredible deals. Not without working really hard. Uh, we, we work with a few different pearl farms out in the Far East. We visited these pearl farms, which is not the norm. Most people wouldn't, most manufacturers, most jewelry makers, most, you know, people, uh, businesses, I should say, wouldn't make the journey over to, um, over to China, to the pearl farms. It's, you know, particularly remote region of China. It's, um, you know, uh, it can be quite difficult to communicate um, uh, without kind of yeah, broken English, a bit like Dave, what, a bit like what mm -hmm. Dave was saying earlier on. But we don't let that stop us. We go over there, we talk, we, we, we invest time in, 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 in meeting our pearl uh, uh, contacts. And so when we go to places like the Hong Kong Gem Show, we get them to bring along their finest pearls. Uh, and then we hand select the finest pearls from that incredible selection. What we've got here is, is, is quite literally some of the finest pearls you will, some of the finest freshwater culture pearls yeah. you will find in the world. The colors you get here are absolutely astonishing. Um, we have to, we have to give you the best quality, um, the best quality that we can. We're not like a, uh, uh, I don't know, like uh, when you buy a car or when you buy a house. That's the kind of thing you maybe do maybe a couple of times in your lifetime, maybe three or four times in your lifetime. I don't know. It's in our interest to give you the best quality we can because we want you to come back to Jewelry Maker day in, day out. Um, it was started um, you know, almost 20 years ago by Steve Bennett, who's the founder of Gempori. He's still with us uh, uh, today. He might even be in the building today. I don't know whether he is or not. Um, and... He made it his business to literally travel the world and to go to some of the to go some of the to some of the most remote regions of the world. Uh, we were one of the first um, uh, uh, gem, uh, well, one of the first European uh, set of gem buyers to be invited over to the uh, Russian Darkside mines over in uh, Russia and in Siberia. Uh, some of the first uh, uh, gem buyers, uh, Western gem buyers, to go to Ethiopia. Uh, we've got incredible contacts all over the world. And when we go to places like India, and, and this is something that Zena said the other day, apparently, when we go to places like India, there are, there are people queuing up to speak with Steve because they know, A, how, how, much we, how much we invest, how much we commission, what kind of numbers we kind of uh, commission as well. And, and there's no one else like us. There's no one else like us in the world. We're at 499. And we're not done. How many of these strands do we have left, Neri? Today is the day that these go. Today is the day It's 40 that these centimetres, go. not 38 centimetres. Yeah, it's a really decent length um, really strand, you're strand you're getting. Yeah. The quality of the pearls you're getting. I mean, it, it's interesting. You know, you pick your favourite one. That's my favourite in the middle, bottom yeah. row in the middle. But then I'll see one. Oh, that one on the top yeah. row is, you know, my favourite. You will, you, will, you will get little personalities coming out of these pearls, little... This one here is one of the most metallic pearls I've ever seen. And you know, they're not just thrown on the strand. They're, no. They're selectively done, aren't they? They absolutely are, Yvonne. And they've, they've got this, they've had this attention to detail applied to each and every one of them. Look at this one here. See how metallic this one is. That is, I mean, it's not really coming over, unfortunately, on screen, but this one is incredibly metallic. This one here is like a bronzy colour. Can you see that? Oh, yeah, there we go. That's yeah, beautiful. They're gorgeous, aren't they? Um, they've got such incredible character, such incredible quality. All these colours, by the way, are totally natural. Totally naturally occurring. We are so lucky to have these. These are the kind of pearls which, um, you know, during, uh, you know, the COVID-19 pandemic, obviously, you know, uh, gem shows were off. Uh, gemstone mines were closed, uh, cutting houses were closed, and um, we were in the very fortunate position where we could still we could still keep things running. We could, you know, we as a business still very much operated, and it was absolutely fantastic uh, that we could still come into work, and it was wonderful. However, we had the chance to take advantage of some really incredible deals, like once in a lifetime deals. This being one of them. Well done. Six chances available. First one's gone. Well done. 
I've got makers involved. This is so gorgeous. And yeah, you can literally see your face. They always so say, put, pick your favourite pearl and put it in the middle Ooh. of your of your whatever you're making. I'd find that but I was just going to say exactly Can you put them all thing? in the middle, please? Yeah. I know yeah, that's, well, that's them all in the middle. That's it. <laughs> 299, four chances remaining. Well done at your final couple of opportunities. Um, I love pearls. Margaret means pearl. Oh, does it? I didn't know that. I'm lucky enough to have loads and loads of JM pearls. That's so lovely. Aww. And do you know what's so nice as well is that, um, as Yvonne said, you know, she, 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 you know, you, you bought, you buy lot, you've bought lots and lots of pearls from Jewelry Maker over the years. We have people who just buy pearls from Jewelry Maker and nothing else, and you know that's absolutely don't, fine. If that's, you know, don't that's, blame them. That's fine. Um, um, uh, but as soon as you do go elsewhere for a better deal or a bigger pearl or whatever it might be. You're going to compromise on quality. That's my personal but opinion. But a risk disappointment. Absolutely, yeah. you do risk disappointment. Yeah. And obviously, I can't, I can't vouch for the credibility of, of of anywhere else that you're going to be buying things from. Virginia, congratulations. Tracy, well done. Margaret in Fife. Sorry, I beg your pardon. Maker in Fife. Well done to you. Lots of people there. We've got three opportunities remaining. Well done. 0800 655. What an amazing show it's been today. It's literally been crazy we've bought you so much variety haven't we it's been wonderful we bought you plated base metal we bought you sterling silver we bought you jade pearls we Jeez. bought you um incredible cameos those what a mix, cameos. Eh? oh it's been great hasn't it yeah um well done two opportunities remaining well done everyone go 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 fantastic well done let's leave that one with where you. else well would you see all that mix of mix of items i know it's great isn't it we got the bezel strip back. Yeah, I think so. So we bought you the bezel strip earlier on in the nine o'clock hour. And um, if you didn't see the demo, Yvonne uh, demoed with the bezel strip, uh, which, was, which was just perfect. So um, a point which you made, and it has been made before, but I think it's always really worth mentioning, is that the bezel strip you've got that you've used here if I put this next to it, you can see Yvonne has cut that bezel yeah. strip in half. Now, she hasn't cut it that way. It's been cut left to right. Can you see that? And Along the what, length. What, you can get up to, up to 50 centimetres yeah. out of this. Yeah. And that is Absolutely. Definitely, that's definitely worth mentioning. That would look odd if you'd have put the full the full kind of width of this. It just wouldn't have worked, would it? Because it would have overlapped on the As you say, it would have opal. puckered earlier uh, on. Yeah. That is, that's like a machine made setting you've oh, done there. You are thank so you. good. Yeah. So good. It's only because I enjoy it. What you enjoy Yvonne, doing. It's, ob it's it obvious shows, you enjoy it. It's yeah. obvious that you yeah. enjoy it, Yvonne. And it's just. Yeah. It's got that really beautiful it's look fun. to it. Now, the great thing about this is it's 999 silver, which means it's as close to pure silver it as is. you're going to get. Yeah, it is. So it's very, very soft. Very malleable to go around your stones. You can still solder with it, presumably, can't you? Uh, this is soldered. Yes, you, you, can, you, you can still solder with the 999 silver. It's not like... Oh, it's no, you just you use, no, you just use your normal silver. Brilliant. Your normal solder. Sorry. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and at eight at eight pounds and ninety nine pence, absolutely amazing. Loads in baskets. Well done. Make it five spot six. Yeah, it's so handy to have in. It's great. I think as well if you're maybe um, new to gem setting, but you've done kind of soldering before, maybe. Or it, it's just a great entry level kind of I, way. I think this is setting. this is your first venture into into stone setting. Yes, I think bezel so. Bezel setting. I think so. It's yeah. what I did first. Yeah. Absolutely. And then you, then you, pro once you get good at that, you, you progress to you other things. Do claws and yeah, all sorts of absolutely, things. Absolutely, yeah. Oh, just gorgeous. Well done. Eight ninety nine for that today. What a deal. That is, well done. That is good. Mm, really good. Well done. One more opportunity. Oh, look at those. Dave's ready for Halloween over there. <laughs> Lack of costume, though, I have to say. Disappointed. Oh, it's, oh, it's there. got his cape, it's got oh. his cape back. It's got his cape back. It's going on. Hoping to see grot bags, but that's not uh, no. Oh, love grot bags. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> oh, Yvonne, no, don't don't laugh don't at his jokes. Don't laugh at his jokes because he will just he'll come out with even more. Don't egg him on. 
Oh, he needs no encouragement. Good job, we're near the end of the show. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, defo. Here we go. So, gorgeous uh, Baroque pearls in the most beautiful papaya colour. They're absolutely gorgeous, aren't they? Beautiful kind of um, corally colours, oranges, apricot qualities. Um, these have got the most... Oh, see, look at this. I, I can't decide which one's my favourite. They're all different, aren't they? This one, I like this chunky one here. I've never seen that colour before. How would you describe it? Is it peach? Is it pink? Is it... Papaya? <laughs> <laughs> Back to that, Yvonne. <laughs> Always count on Yvonne for a bit of... For a helping hand. Oh, papaya, Carol. Oh. Uh, yes, it's very peachy, yeah. Uh, it is very peachy. April, Bellini. Oh, now you're Bellini. talking. Now you're talking my language. Peach Bellini. There oh. you go. Oh, Neri's getting a picture of a papaya up now for me. Yeah, well, oh, well, actually... Well, um, papaya's a bit more orange. I think this is more peach bellini. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? It's beautiful. a beautiful colour. We're not doing it justice with we're, these descriptions. We're not, are we? Are we? No. no. <laughs> London, Hampshire, Fife, well done to you. Three opportunities. Oh, gosh, there's more than enough people for this to completely sell out. Well done. Where are we going to start, lovely? Starting at 299. Oh, Absolutely Amazing. 299, not done. First one's gone. Here we go. Less than 50 seconds, we're taking that price point down again. Well done. Oh, Neri Nunu. Where are you thinking? Hey. One more's gone. Oh, we got Jeanette and Virginia joining us now on the web. Oh, and um, Maker in Hampshire. Can you count? Oh. They've got to be a talking... Tell you what, collector in Hampshire. <laughs> They've got They're to be a talking a point wearing a, a strand like that. 16, 18, 19. 19. 19 on the strand. 19 on the strand. Here we go. I'm going to give you a little bit of money back in you. I don't really mind counting, don't worry. Uh, Anita, well done. She's got it in her basket. Absolutely fantastic. Well done to everyone coming through. Look at that. Isn't that got £15 each at 2 dollars Oh, not for long. Here we go. All the way down. Yorkshire's there. Well done. 15 pendants. 19 pendants. That's amazing. Mm. 2 four, nine. 19 pendants. How, how much is it now per pearl, um, Neri Note? 19 is... Thirteen pounds and ten pence. That's Incredible. amazing. Let me tell you something. You are going to be selling each one of these pendants for more than thirteen pounds ten p, aren't you? Absolutely. I mean, move that decimal point. One hundred and thirty pounds. And without maybe. a lot of um, a lot of work, you absolutely. Could make a, a pretty pendant. With I'm those. a big fan of that, Yvonne. Yeah, without a lot of work. <laughs> without a lot of work. <laughs> Coasting, just coasting. <laughs> Gorgeous. <laughs> Yvonne, it's been so lovely having you with us Thank today. you. I've thoroughly enjoyed good, it. It's nice good, to see good. you back. When are you back? Do you uh, know? 24th. Oh, perfect. Yeah. Oh, that's a Friday, Thursday. Don't Friday. know what day it is, actually. Who? Thursday. The Thursday. There Thursday. Oh, there you go. Yeah. Um, it's been wonderful having your company today. Hasn't it been an amazing show? It's been so much fun. We've all learned so much. Lovely to see so much gorgeous sterling silver. Oh, have, we, have I lost my... I'm going to need you to count me out, please, Michael. I've got, I've lost my ears. There we go. So uh, absolutely, about how long have we got? 20. 20. Okay, 20 seconds left. This is horrible doing this without the, uh, without, without people in my ear. Anyway, lovely to see you. 15 you. seconds. Lovely to and see thank you. Thank you very much. It's been a smashing Pleasure, morning. Pleasure, sweetie. Thank you yeah, so it's much. It's been great. You need to join Count Bradford, the other side of this. There we go. He's got his cape we'll on. He's got his cape. I'll <laughs> see the other side of this one. Hobby maker.